actual experience you get from this. What up, everyone? Hold on. Let me get that sound going. All right. What's up, boys? Hey, fellas. So, this is a, sort of a test stream. I want to find out how good Solo Rogue would be. I'm curious. I thought it would be a fun thing for a stream because me workshopping this is probably going to leave lead to um, a lot of a lot of trial and error, and uh, also. Rogues are nuts, dude. Rogues are actually insanely strong. Gnome Rogue, Gnome Rogue. Okay, I'm actually considering a Hoffling Rogue because they have stealth efficiency. But we'll look through the classes and kind of make a decision. But I think that's going to be a really good one to go for. That or something damage related. Because you, you'd be surprised how much damage you can actually do with these fat Rogue builds. Also, a tiny little Hoffling Rogue it just sounds funny to me, you know? Solo is in no party members at all. Yes, Solo is in no party members, no companions, unless we really, really need it. But I'm going to try and avoid it as much as I can. Hawk Rogue. See, that actually... Okay, you you think that's dumb. It weirdly sounds really cool to me, you know? I love Hawks, dude. They're my absolute main. What do I go? What do you guys think? Balance, tactician. I'm thinking just regular balance. Explore mode is for babies. I don't know what this is for. Like, if you don't want to do... Uh, combat or some shit i don't i literally don't get this like it offers no challenge or uh, no interesting what, what is it for has anybody played explorer what, what's your reasoning behind it i'm actually curious balanced yeah tactician's kind of like try hardy guys like i feel like i'll just get my absolute cheeks clapped but uh tactician isn't that difficult from what i've seen they made it seem so difficult in the play thing, but I think they were just underleveled and badly set up. Well, like, nobody- Explorer doesn't allow multicast, it's not good. What the fuck? What's even the point? Sex percent runs? Dude, that's so funny. Have you guys seen- people have started making, uh, sex speed runs to get in, and Lazale's apparently the easiest way to get there. I knew she was easy. <laughs> what about Githyanki? Githyanki have some good shit. They're also really weird looking. You know? I could be a little pencil man. Well, first of all, Rogue. <laughs> They're so dumb looking, dude. I'm sorry. They're just so gross. What do you even get as options? Oh, they have a lot of... Dude, they have so many more face options than every other race. What the hell? And not, not one of them has a nose. That's kind of an okay pro- God, I hate this hair so much. This Justin Bieber ass bullshit. No, thank you. Not be tiny boy? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. So, uh, okay. So, Bre Dragonborn are a bad pick. They're actually pretty terrible. They have base racial speed and no other racial features. The only thing that you get is a breath attack, which immediately becomes complete dog shit after, like, halfway through act one it starts to get really bad when you're like level three and up it just starts to become really really terrible um resistance to one specific type of damage is okay like it, it's fine but n like fuck that elves are cringe tieflings are a bad pick like they're fine but they don't really suit stealth races like they don't offer any bonuses drow are kind of like edgy they're like dark elves or like edgy elves maybe a drow but i'm thinking halfling or half -orc. Hawks are, are based. I love Hawks. They're super underrated. They're they're really strong too. It's something that people underestimate. Deep gnomes. A gnome could be a good pick. Gnome cunning advantage on intelligence, wisdom, and charisma saving throws. Does this does that mean saving throws are for just when you're being attacked, right? When you're resisting damage. This isn't for dialogue. So like I wouldn't get a, a bonus to charisma through dialogue, right? Off walk and go full thug. Well, we're going stealth. Maybe I'll put it up to a vote because this is going to be like an important vote, right? Hold on, let me let me let's put this up. Oh, all right. Let's let's put up the op uh, options. Race. I'll put up gnome. I'm not a gnome. 
Also, we can dance over people's bodies and say you got gnomed. Also, gnomes look stupid. <laughs> I'm sorry, but they look weird. They, they had that, like, big hands, probably a normal human-sized wang and big face, but on a small body. It's like little people, like actual little people, you know? Because halflings look like, I don't know, slightly more... Dude, halflings are so funny. I might have to go halfling. Gnome. Half. Romance everyone? No, ew. Ew. Um, brave, lucky, or half orc. Half orc. Wait, what did gnomes get then? Hold on. Rock gnome, forest gnome, deep gnomes get 24 meters of dark vision and advantage on stealth checks. Ooh, that's better. Hold on. Okay, I might make a, a, a one of these goofy ass little guys because it looks like they they don't. 7.5 meters of movement range, 7.5 meters of movement range. So they don't have brave, so I will I lose advantage on saving throws against being frightened, which who cares? Uh, when you roll the saving throw, you must... That's pretty good, though. That's also pretty good. Lucky seems great. But gnomish cunning, advantage on things. How about a deep gnome? I'm gonna put that on. Like a gnome, but deep. Alright, I'm putting up the fall. I'm I'm leaning towards deep gnome. I've never made a gnome. I've never made a deep gnome. Um, we could probably make this guy look pretty pretty stealthy. I think guild artisan is a background because insight and persuasion is useful. Also, dialogue is going to be a must. That being said, I could get an extra stealth proficiency. Seventeen dex, probably not. I'm gonna be rat fuck stupid. His intelligence rolls are never really that important. Wait, why did it put a secondary in intelligence? Weird. Probably constitution. Just shrug off those extra hits. Then 16, 16. Because you don't need that extra one. Gnome boy? Is this on tactician? No, we're just doing normal difficulty. Deep gnome? 62% deep gnome. Alright, I'm just gonna end the poll. Goddamn, boys. All right, deep gnome it is. The deepest of gnomes. Your advantage on stealth checks. Advantage on stealth checks is actually wild. That, that's not even a proficiency. That's just advantage. So I get to roll twice and take the highest result, which means I'm probably never going to get seen. Plus 24 meters of dark vision. Dude, if we just go, go around turning off the lights and doing full stealth. Okay, I'm, this is getting... This is getting good. And then if we get a proficiency in stealth, we should have wild pluses to stealth. Yeah, so... A plus seven to stealth with the extra thingy. Slider hand checks have got to be high. Acrobatics, I do. Do we need acrobatics? Helps you resist being shoved, and that's it, right? And then athletics is like your jump ability, or is that no? That's just based on strength, Bruh. Make him green, noblar team. Oh, dude, I could totally make him into a noblar. That's fucking great. Came from the halfling ball video, dude. Glad you liked it. Hopefully you liked it. You might be just coming like, got like this video sucks. Let's go t tell this guy he's gay on stream. <laughs> I don't go. Perception is a must. Oh, dude, you're so right. Perception is a must. Well, we could get a double proficiency in perception then. Deception. I'm not really worried about dialogue options because we'll mostly be killing, but I could take a mild proficiency in persuasion. I feel like that's the most useful one. Uh, investigation. Analyze clues. Solve mysteries. Uh, I do kind of want that second in stealth, though. Helps you with hiding. How actually useful is hiding on the regular, though? Because I... I I don't know. Maybe we take the proficiency out of stealth and put it in something else, then I can put the extra in. It doesn't really matter, does it? Rogues are so good for this, though, dude. All these extra proficiencies, you can kind of be good at everything. Intimidation. This guy is not intimidating. Come on. Go assassin? No, we're going thief. Assa oh, wait. Assassin might actually be worth it. Because we can get benefits out of that. We'll, we'll, we'll deal with that when we get to it, alright? Hiding for sneak attacks? Yeah. Yeah, very useful for stealth rogues. Uh, I think plus five advantage will be fine. Right, okay. So, we need to put the last full... Athletics and acrobatics are not going to be super important. 
maneuverability is super important though actually oh man insight i don't know i don't need to read people perception is obviously a plus especially if we're going solo i'm trying to just do everything you know what i mean Slider hand will get us into most good situations we can kind of stealth and steal our way through the game instead of talking to people um but let's get that extra proficiency in stealth right and maybe out of sleight of hand because i can re-roll sleight of hand stuff but stealth oh man dude i'm so indecisive with these what do you think is more important stealth or sleight of hand persuasion i'm gonna put a small thing into fuck it deception whatever perception uh we could be a deceitful little rogue Hi, oh, okay how are you doing i'm glad to catch you streaming again hey thanks my dude I'm, I'm doing good dude i'm doing fucking great the the Halfway video has gone gangbusters, dude. People love that. Loved it. I did not expect it. I really did not expect it. Stealth? Yeah, all right. We'll go stealth. Slide of hand is less important. Plus five to sl uh, slide of hand is pretty good. Investigation, insight. We can put an extra in. Investigation, insight. I guess athletics? Get, get us out of a negative? What is that? Okay, somebody explain athletics and acrobatics to me because it just says helps you resist being shoved, helps you shove and resist being shoved. So this is dexterity based, so you can avoid being shoved, but you're not good at shoving people because you don't have much strength. That's basically it. Hey, Oko, what do you think of the current Warhammer situation? Uh, I think it's pretty gross. Um, I think it's, I'm pretty disappointed in CA uh, for letting their marketing team do what they've done, and I kind of don't want to play the. It's kind of why I don't want to make content on the DLC right now. And also, I am f completely obsessed with Baldur's Gate right now. So, it's sort of weirdly good timing, if that makes any sense. I, but yeah, I don't, I don't like the whole Total Wall situation right now. I think it's, I think it sucks. I think they're overcharging people, and I think it sucks. I think the reasons for doing so are not okay. <clears throat> okay, I've been wanting to get this one. Never played Divinity 2 before. Would you recommend doing that first? No, just, just get Baldur's Gate 3. Don't, don't even... I love Divinity Original Sin 2, dude, but everything you, you'll get out of that game, you'll get out of Baldur's Gate 3 and more. This game is a fucking masterpiece. This game is an absolute masterpiece. I fucking love it, dude. Like, I loved it in the beta. I had 150 hours in the Chapter 1 uh, Early Access, and I've already doubled that in the time that it's been out. I, dude, this game is a, a fucking incredible, and I'm not even all the way through Act 3 yet. Like, it's ins it's just incredible. Are you going to play on Taxation? I'm just going to play regular. <coughs> Normal. Oh my god. <coughs> I'm going to play regular difficulty. I'm not going to bother with Tactician. I just feel like if I'm going solo, if this game had Lone Wolf, I would play Tactician. And okay, lol, sold. I'm going to get it. Dude, it, maybe try to get it on sale, see if you can get a, a cheaper copy or whatever. I w will always, I will always advise that anyway. But like... Just, uh, this game is worth full price. I, it, it just is. It, it, the amount, it's, the amount of content and effort out into this game and the scope and the quality, dude. Like, the only thing that I don't like is there's a couple, couple of things that I wish were different, and, but, and also the children voice acting is very clearly adult women trying to uh, act like children, and it still bothers me as much as it does in every other game where they do that, because it just is not, it's too, it's not convincing at all. I don't quite, you're playing with your regulars only? Or like Bannerlord with your chat too. Um. Oh. Uh, I'm playing with just me for this one. This is a solo playthrough, or not a full playthrough. This is just a solo run. I just got to Act Three and I'm 200 hours in, dude. Incredible. It <laughs> the amount of content to be had is just nuts. Why did you catch it like a gimp? Because he's a deep gnome, dude. Anyway, let's let's uh go for a, an extra thing here. Right, deception. I'm just gonna double into persuasion just so we have that option, and then deception if we need it. <laughs> We're good at stealth. We're good at sleight of hand. All right, I like that. All right, and then okay, charisma. I don't want any negatives. Wisdom is good for saving throws and stuff like. Uh, what do you call it? Insight, and uh, <clears throat> perception, and all that kind of shit. I feel like intelligence is probably the least useful, and we don't need strength for going stealth because we're going to be finesse based. I don't want to put that extra point in. So we'll go a little bit more charisma. I'll put that extra point to dex because fuck it. And then we can go strength. So just so that our jumping isn't terrible. And then. Shit. How did I end up with one point? 
How the fuck have I ended up with one point? Strength also affects jump distance, which uh, that can matter. Yeah, no, I agree. I agree. I don't even know what to put this in. Charisma, I guess. I can't use it to bring myself out of any negatives. All right, well, I'm going to take the point out of dex then and then put charisma to 14. All right, I like it. We're a criminal. So we're good at deception and stealth. Maybe I just take it out of percep persuasion, though. A plus six to fucking persuasion, dude. Fuck yeah, we're going to talk people's pants off. All right, character editing time. What's the weirdest face? Oh, that nose, dude. That's very stealthy. That's kind of normal. I kind of don't want to look like... I like this. I look like Adam Driver. Hold on. Hold on. Can we make Adam Driver really quick? I won't keep it, but I just want to make Adam Driver. Slightly tanned. Hair. Bruh. Tell me that's not Adam Driver. <laughs> uh, the only line that I can think of of an Adam Driver line off the top of my head is his, his very famous line from Black Klansman. So, <laughs> please make Gnome Adam Driver. I feel like I want to make a more iconic and, and unique character than Adam Driver. Keep Adam Driver alive. <laughs> we can't say that here, haha. You know exactly what I'm talking about. You get out of here, you spear trucking. <laughs> People aren't going to even understand the reference. I'm just going to look bad. Go watch Black Klansman. It's a really good movie. Adam Dryder. <laughs> he just looks like Tiny Adam Driver. <laughs> okay. All right, voice. Where to next? Mm. Nope. Let's hope the locals are friendly. Okay, I want a handsome, handsome man voice. We're gonna go with maybe some scars. Some very roguelike scars. Or I could just be completely fucked up. Is this a supposed to be a burn? Like a burn scar? Or is this just supposed to be like you're fucked up? Because the image makes it look like a wound. And then you put it on and you're, it's just like a burn, I guess? I don't know. Make Peter Dinklage? I mean, we could maybe make Peter Dinklage. Hold on. What kind of beards can you have? Ooh, you can have big beards with these guys? Maybe we just go with a big old fucking beard. A hot iron fell on him. Make him green. I Everybody makes their guy green, though. I want to go for stealth. Right, we're going for full stealth. So we're going to make the, the deepest gnome. I'm going to go for very deep. Everything. Uh, a little bit of an eye scar, maybe. No freckles. I'm going to make him old. He, he, he has become a master of stealth. Viking beard. I like the beard. What do you guys think? Maybe a handsome mustache. <laughs> I don't like the hair, actually. This is some... Nah. I kind of like bald with the mustache. Short Hagrid. Man climb down a chimney. Make <laughs> love the beard. I mean, it's not exactly stealthy. People will hear it rustling from the trees. All hobos are rogues. What if we just make him look like a little wretchedy hobo then? Oh my god. Beautiful locks. God, that looks whack. He looks like somebody that would get knocked off a flaming bridge by a Balrog. Um. Oh! Githyanki hair could be good. If Githyanki have anything, they have terrible hairstyles, and I like that a lot. We could have speak to the manager hair. We could have Swain 
We could have this the the director of uh Larian's CEO hair. Swain is a cool guy. Oh my god, this dude. No Yankee. No Miss 20% hair. Edoko, your Hoffling Barbarian video is doing so well. We love to see it. I know, dude. I'm fucking dude, it has Oh, it's, it has almost 2 million views on the uh, the Twitter thing post that I put up. I tagged Larian in it and it didn't do anything for like two days. And then out of nowhere, people just started sharing it and it went crazy. And uh, I was just kind of blown away. So it's got like almost like uh, it's encroaching on 4 million views across like everywhere that I posted it, which is wild. That is crazy. I'm super happy people like it, though, you know? More than anything, I'm just happy that people enjoy it. Because uh, I had a lot of fun making it, and I was hoping that would come through. Alright, I'm going with the Gathanki hair. I love the receding hairline. I think it's very natural. I want stealth hair, though. So maybe we just go with, like... Yes. Yes! It matches him. Eyes? What about just, like, black eyes? Uh, it's a, It's kind of scary. Pink eyes? I wish you could have like pink eyes. You know, like a pink eye? Like actually like sore looking eyes. Green? Piercing blue. Piercing blue eyes. Like this? It I don't it's off putting. I don't know. I don't like it. What about can I get like demonic blue? I'm not a big fan of blue, though. That kind of looks good. What about one blue? And then we get heterochromia and we make the left eye like black, like that. So it's like a sans... <laughs> kind of like a sans scenario. He closes this one and then he shoots with this one. Hey, Okoi, is this a gnome? This is a gnome. This is not a gnome. Oh, no. I like it. Sans underdog. <laughs> Sans underdog. No. A little bit of graying in the beard. He's seen some shit. This just kind of looks like he's got cum in his beard. All right, I'm in extreme. <laughs> Sans underbeard is kind of funny, but also absolutely awful. I do love the mustache though. This is just charming. This is a charming man right here. Oh, what about... What does the normal eye look like? Ooh, that's really strange. Uh... What about... Can I get... Ooh, that looks kind of good. Nah, that actually kind of looks too cool. <laughs> I like the sands, the stupid fucking sands eye. Agreed. The gray is weird. All the highlights look painted on. Yeah, that's the problem. My problem with face paint, too. If you look at the face paint. Actually, this doesn't look too bad, but if you... On some character, like this. To me, this looks like it's too neat and it looks like a PNG. Which it is, but... Oh, almost, dude. Mike Tyson. You have some Mike Tyson fit. Uh, just a little bit of edgy eye makeup. Tentacle eyes, which is so wild to me. This, my favorite one, though, is... Where is it at? It's just a bunch of drawings. Here it is. It's a pretty amazing. It's just a bunch of drawings. Look, and there's a really good... <laughs> there's a really good drawing of a... Of a... a, a like a... What do you, what do you call it? Beholder? Okay, do you think we could do a solo run together? I'm s Dude, I have so many campaigns, I, I just absolutely cannot. The neck tattoos are kind of okay. I would have to give up the hair, though. Also, there's just a bow on his face. This is what I did for my for the other guy in the last stream. So I'm going to do something different. I just I wanted to show that off because it's so funny to me. All right, we're going with this hair. That's a guarantee. I don't know about body art for this guy. I might just not. 
Just, can we make it look like he's just eaten? <laughs> oh no! Ew, ew. Oh no! Ew! He's just drinking milk. He just, it just looks like he's been drinking milk. Eating paint. I think Sans Underdog. Oh my god. A lot of these just look like he's just been blasted. Calcium man. The man with the strong bones. Why does that kind of look cool? Am I, am I whack? That, why does that look cool? I, I gotta say, Polynesian tattoos are pretty dope, though. Oh my god, everything looks like he's just been absolutely blasted, dude. A paint eater fits with Okoy? I do... I'm so, Okay, I'm sorry, but paint does smell good, though. Um, wait, I'm, I think I'll gasoline. I'm making your point, and I hate it. God, yeah, dude, Polynesian tattoos do look pretty dope. So we go with some SoundCloud stuff. I kind of like the cum lips. Let's make it a little bit more subtle, though. Well, paint. His lore is that he chugs paint, right? To gain power. Uh, I'm not sure about the earrings and shit. Can I get, like, something subtle? I'm a big fan of piercings and shit, but uh, I don't know, man. Not... It kind of interrupts the mustache. What about... Is there nothing fucking simple? Easy breezy. Hey, little skull earrings. All right, I like it. All right. What you, okay, last decision is going to be big beard. Big beard or mustache? I think the mustache, personally. Share the load. Sans cum lips. I don't... I feel like that's really not what we should do with this guy. That shouldn't be his name. Sans underdog is pretty good, though. And we'll just call him Sands. But we'll change the name, so he'll be like Sands Underdock. Mustache? Big beard, mustache, stash, mustache. Yeah, yeah, I like the mustache. I think it's roguelike. What about neck beard? No. Definitely the mustache. I've already gone with other mustaches. I think the floaty mustache is good. The only other thing I could think would be different colored hair. But I think that the fact that it's the same color as his skin gives him this smurf vibe that I'm really into. Uh, or mate, what if we go with like a skin color and then we highlight a little bit into like a fade? So, what about into like what the fuck? What? How did that happen? Oh my god, it's like white fading into brown with a pink stash. Why does that happen? Hold on. Oh, I think I... St oh, right, okay. I think it's because I still have the... The graying. Yeah, it is. That is crazy! What? I don't call it accent? I don't have an accent. I'm from the UK, but I have a bit of an American accent. It's somewhere in the middle. Now you gotta do Markiplier? Uh, um, undoable. Not, not gonna, gonna happen. Wait. What do you guys think? Highlights or no highlights? It's sort of getting a little bit, um... Oh, actually, some of these are dope if they're subtle. Can we get, like, a subtle one? Oh, just the pink stash? Why is the mustache just pink? It doesn't change any of the highlight in the mustache, but it does add highlights. Why? A little bit of a subtle pink? It's getting whack. We need, we need to bring that stealth edge back. Wait, there we go. Just a slight tinge, right? I like it. Alright, there we go. What do you guys think? This is our boy. This is our stealth boy. Yes? Sans Underdog. We'll, we'll call him... Sans... <laughs> Sans... Underdog, right? Sans underdog. Or, hmm. <laughs> Is it just Sans? Just the full Sans? <laughs> he 
<laughs> he's so perfect. He's a little stealth god. Hate that mouth tattoo. You don't like the cum lips? Maybe we edit the cum lips. What do you guys think? Yes or no to the little white... To the paint lips. It's supposed to look like he just drank milk. He's a proper young man. He's just a little guy. Yes, keep him. Keep the lips. No, change it. Love it. He needs milk. No. Oh my god. Keep the lips. No. Oh my god. This is... There's so much fucking... I would be more inclined to keep it if I wouldn't, if I know that I, okay, hold on. Keep the cum lips. This is, um, this might be the first time this has ever been pitched as a poll. <laughs> Do a poll? Yeah. This is a heated debate. The cum lips debate. I'm gonna try and like spice this up a little bit to distinguish it. Like san What would this be? Like sans? How do you say the A with an umlaut? Or that little accent, whatever it is. Okay, I'm making history. Oh dude, 52% yes on the cum lips. This is close. This is a close one. I've never seen, you know, this is, I think you guys are just attached to it because it's kind of funny. We may get bored of it though. Maybe we take that into account. Thief is just really good generally. I want to be thief. I don't want to go the other way. I think thief is good. I'm going to give it like a little bit more time. It's lame in the long run. I think it will get old. See, that's a good point. That's a good point. I'm sorry, but 53 three more percent of people want to keep the calm lips, and I'm 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 down with that. Assassin is crazy though. Assassin is okay, but you, assassin is only good for that first like sec second where you surprise people, and I know what's gonna happen for the most part, so I can surprise people for a good amount of the time. But sometimes I'm not gonna be able to, you know. You can take it off later, I think. No, you can't. You absolutely cannot do There's no character customization post uh, character creation, which is something that I really want Larry to change. Like, there needs to be like a guy you can go to who can magically change you. Even if you can't change your race, just let me change like skin color and face paint and hair and beards and like tattoos, piercings, earrings, you know, all that kind of. Just let me change everything but the base race or and the background, right? You can only respec. You can't change your character after it launches. They, yeah, they're working on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know, I know. I, I, I've heard that they're working on a on a post customization change. I hope it comes soon, though, dude, because I'm already like balls deep in my campaign. It's not going to be that. That being said, I'm probably going to do like fifty thousand playthroughs of this game, so I will get use out of it. But still, all right, I'm ending the poll. We're t we're we're guys. We can't be discussing cum lips for this long. Sans, Un uh, you know what? I'm I'm going with I'm pulling the trigger on Sans Underdog. You need to guard him. Oh you fuck, dude! I always forget about this. This is actually a pretty important part of the game too. So I'm just gonna spice it up. We're gonna go for a male dwarf because they're funny, and but we're gonna give it a girl voice. Good luck. Follow your in remarkable. And we're going to go with Truly. this beautiful face. And we're going to burn them up. And we're going to take away their hair. Oh. We're going to take away their hair. And <laughs> Wait. Okay, well, I know what I'm doing now. Hold on. Everyone knows what's going to happen. If this guy shows up later down the line, too, it's going to be so bad. It's going to be so bad. <laughs> I can already see people in chat figuring it out. Oh no. <laughs> oh god. Wait. Um Where's the <laughs> Oh no. 
Oh no, oh no, oh no, it's him. <laughs> oh God, oh no. Wait. Now we need subtle. <laughs> A little bit of dark rings around the eyes because he's evil. <laughs> oh. All right, good. The neck rolls, dude, the neck, the neck rolls are just hilarious for this. What color eyes did he have? Green? Oh, blue, right? Because he's... I don't really want to look it up. <laughs> I don't want that in my search history. Somebody knows. Somebody knows. What color eyes did he have? I mean... <laughs> You're just gonna stream up. I, I know, I know. I know. <laughs> Come on. Brown? All right. Fine, I'll look it up. Oh my God. Okay, apparently it's, they're blue. Oh! <laughs> Oh, I mean that's probably how he uh, how he looked. All right, let's get on with it. Um, wait, does he still have a lady voice? Follow your instincts. Oh, that's gonna be really <laughs> awful, though. <laughs> but good luck. Nah. Follow your instincts. Yeah. Don't be All right. Afraid. Let's fucking dive in, boy. Maybe we get. <clears throat> Maybe we get. Congrats, Oko. You are now on a list. On a list of most fun character creators. No way. Are you trying to make Hitler? Uh, no. That's. I'll have you know that that is Charlie Chaplin. I hate the lips already. I hate the lips. Nah, they'll grow on me. I look like a tiny little Gith Yankee. All right, we gotta work on finding a ranged weapon. Like now. Oh, you're stuck with tools, no way. Camp supplies. Can't. All right. Oh, you're stuck with grease bottles and shit, dude? No way, dude. Little blue Gith, tiny proper man. He's just a little guy. Just a little guy, a little man. All right, keys. Did anybody else do this? Put all your shit to the bottom of your inventory so that anything new is at the top so you don't clutter all your shit together? Please do this. I've seen so many people's inventories just looking like a cacophony of just the most messy bullshit I've ever seen. Oh, just a little guy. That actually looks so much better than the leather armor because this looks like I have boobs slightly. And this is just precious. Just a little guy. All right, let's get on with it. Oh my God, a jump distance, dude. Oh no. Oh no, we're not gonna be able to do anything. Oh no. My legs are pathetic. Just use the sort button. It has an auto sort. Nah, though, nah. If you can keep your shit organized, it's better. All right, suicide. Breaking knees. Needs more leg day. We really got to pump up the jams with this little man here. Oh God, the image is so off-putting. Look at this little gremlin man. That is Sans Underdog. Speaking of which, we can get some tremendous rogue gear in the Underdog. So we got to like prioritize that. Dude, some of the fights are going to be so hard though. I should have installed like a... Mu Look at that fucking run animation. Are you kidding me? Dude, the guy who made these doors commented on my Halfling video and thanked me for doing the font animation. You know, in the Halfling video, which is pretty insane. Playing Tactician? No, but we could. I could knock it up to Tactician at any time, so. I could also knock it down to an easier difficulty, but we're not gonna do that, because that's for pussies. Let's go slap that brain. 
I'm actually gonna get the broom to help us if we can. Uh, I'm gonna organize these two. Melee, get fucked. Melee, flourish. Does anybody actually use these, these bonus actions? I always dual wield on a rogue with a finesse weapon, so I just never use shit like flourish. It's not worth it over an offhand attack. Going to get good brain. Let's see how this goes. Yes. You've come to save us from this place. From this place you'll free us. Um please. Before they return. They re remove us from this Alright, dexterity. We should have a good from amount of pluses place. to dexterity. Free come us. on, baby. It's a... Woo! Nice. Slipping those little fingers in deep. Dude, gnomes have big hands, though. They have adult-sized hands on a on a toddler's body. On a child's body. Uh, I'ma spare this boy. Nice, nice, yes. Um... Alright, let's go. Homies. Small homies. No spoilers, but you they're they're the stuff later down the line with this brain is pretty cool. <coughs> Alright. I love this animation is just precious. Look at my little run, dude. Oh, I'm the best guy. I, I kinda regret the color in the hair. Ain't no solo run liar at Okoye. Hey, I, I'll have you know this is just a temporary little guy. All right, what do you suggest? All right, lady, all right, lady, let's get into the fight. Brain power. Okay, this brain, I regret, I regret it already. This brain sucks. Can I kill her? Can she, can I give, get her bow? Nice. And I'm gonna take your health potions and uh, I'm gonna take your Revivi scroll. I, wait, do I need Revivification scrolls if I'm doing a solo run? I don't, right? They're pointless. I could just make extra money off them. I'm ne what am I gonna do? Revive myself? Ain't no way. Ain't no way, ain't no how. And also, I'm gonna take your camp supplies. And... Your armor's worth a good amount. I want that too. Let's keep it TOS. You can keep your underwear, lady. Although, the underwear could look really funny on this guy. Oh, have I got a little waistcoat? That's fucking precious, dude. What? I get a little underdog waistcoat with my underwear that has straps? You can keep your underwear, lady. In fact, you can have my clothes. And I'll take yours, because they're probably cool looking. What do they look like again? Why can't I wear them? Oh, it takes an action to put clothes on? Eat a dick, game. Wait, I don't get an action now. Fuck! It took my action to put a bow on. Alright, you do the work, Lazale. Where are you from, Okoye? Your accent is almost American, but something sounds different. I'm from the UK. I just have a bit of an American accent. Uh, it, I don't know what it is. Like, it, I've been perpetually on the internet for about 15 years. And I watched so much YouTube and American TV as a kid that I picked up an American accent. I've just never lost it. I used to have a really strong Yorkshire accent. I get this every stream, though. I used to have a really, really strong Yorkshire accent, which if you don't know what that is, it's one of the goofiest uh, accents in the UK. I lived there and I grew up there. I can say that. He's from Britbong. I do am. Oh man, our movement speed is so bad. Can we get le leg extensions for this little guy? Oh my god, the misclicking is so bad. Here we go. Nice, nice. Nice job, Lazale. Carry. Alright, I'm gonna go cr light crossbow, I think. And I don't have a proficiency in medium armor. Maybe we keep this, though. <gasps> I keep my waistcoat on with the little pants, dude! What? Yes! Yes! Uh, look at this little outfit for my man. Dude, look <laughs> at the little waistcoat! Alright, we're keeping that. That's mine now. And also, short bows are... W Wait, what's the difference? Uh, 18 meters, 18 meters, two-handed light. 
it's uh, proficiency 1d8 it's literally just, it's just better right void bulbs could be good if we keep that all right go ahead and kill the demon cpt you won't at okoy what demon cpt you're lying you have the most what okay i'm from south yorkshire but you sound like freaking isaac arthur the famous youtuber is like minnesota florida and you have some boston tendencies i i'm <laughs> i don't know what to tell you i came from leeds near leeds in a place called pudsey yeah it, i'm from that much yorkshire dude that it's such a dumb place name pudsey wild all right let's keep a hustle on oh i have no proficiency in anything dude wow Press K to turn your sneak attack into an ask reaction. What are you talking about? K is your skill thing. What do you mean? Oh! Why would I do that? Deal extra damage to a foe you have advantage against. Deal extra. Why would I want to ask to do extra damage? Attack an enemy moving out of your. Yeah, what? I don't need to put that on reaction. It's fine. Say, uh, say aluminium, aluminum. You've put, you spelt it aluminum, but it's aluminium. <laughs> I still say words right. Uh, one to six, four to nine. Finesse is where we're going. Won't be able to take another dragon attack. Ooh, second short so I don't mind if I put that on my body. Let's go. Through the sphincters. So you don't have to click it all the time? What do you mean? Oh, wait. You mean like, what do you mean? As choose whether or not the reaction triggers automatically or whether the game pauses your frame point. Yeah, that's all that is. It's already ticked. So it'll already happen. And then I can just fucking stealth attack. It's fine. Oh my God. Why does this keep auto locking? I got to keep my stealth stuff together like like so. <coughs> Do you get more XP per creature if you solo kill? Absolutely not. It, we are at a downside in every feasible, in every feasible way. Th this is the real problem with the, with this um this doing a solo run. Is you're just at a disadvantage and you have no advantages. Get your little crossbow, bud. Okay, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to raise them up so I could get the XP off of them. Does everybody remember which button it is? Is it the middle one? Nope, you have to cast it. Deal sneak attacks. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I'm not gonna be able to... Shit, shit, hit it. I'm not gonna get her out. I don't need Shadow Hot. We'll find her and kill her later on. I am gonna take these, though. Alright. Can I? Oh shit! I have the key. Man, I'm, I've been playing mid to late game so much. I've, I'm sort of forgetting the beginning now. I have so much time. I've done so many playthroughs though. I have so much time at the beginning. How many hosts are these gay infected? Can you save this lady? Or nah? Is that like a, a dead? Wait a minute, dude, if you save, if you save this slave mind, what happens if you save this for the thing later in game? I'm gonna do that, hold on. I don't think I'm ever gonna get there actually, <laughs> but later on, you can do some stuff with, I'm not gonna spoil anything, but you can do some stuff with these slave mines. So I'm wondering if like, if I save them for the whole game, can I do the stuff late game? A lot of people will know what I'm talking about, but I don't wanna spoil anything. You can? Dude, I, if you imagine if you get some like crazy, like strong thing out of that, that would be such a cool mechanic. You won't get there? You just spoil for no reason? What do you, hey, I didn't spoil anything. I'm just saying you can do something with them way later on in the game. That doesn't spoil anything. Wait, they, don't they wait? Yeah, I'm taking them for no reason. I'm never gonna get that far with this guy. 
I'm talking late game, dude. Can I actually get her out then? With that little rock? It used to be that you put the rock in the console or some shit. The mechanisms are nothing. The cons. Do you gotta talk to her? Damn it. You. We have no time for stragglers. Look at my little head in the cutscene. Um. Hurry. Uh. Now do I do it? The mechanisms. Nothing. All right, you're on your own, Shadowheart. Bye. I'll kill you later for your gear. I don't know, you didn't grab the rune? Oh, you need the rune. Okay, that makes sense. Oh. Alright, let's do this. We are nearing the hell. Okay, lady. Why don't you put some armor on? God, gross. Have some modesty. Your ankles are showing. Oh, no, they're not. <laughs> She's wearing boots. Wait, can I take the boots? I'd like some fancy kickers. Medium armor. Damn it. Damn it, dude. Whatever. Dude, look at my little jacket. I want to find some dye. Yes, 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 yes. All good, all good. Commander Zao. Wait, I don't have the achievement for killing Commander Zao, but I definitely killed him, and it's in my fucking... my most recent video, that I definitely killed him. So I don't understand why it, tell, it keeps telling me that I haven't. All right, whatever. Come on, big damage, big damage, big damage. Ah! I don't need the sword anyway, to be honest. Oh, I forgot I took away her thing. Nice. Maybe disable achievements. Mods well, disable achievements. Maybe it had something running. No, I didn't have anything running for the Halfling video. I did it in multiplayer and we had no mods running. I actually haven't installed any mods simply for the fact that you can't. There's no uh, mod manager. So if you install. Oh, I don't have quick action da dash yet. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, 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 gimme. Can I get, um, yep. Try and move away from me, idiot. No mod manager, you tweaking? Do they not have, is there a mod manager? What? How do you get the mod manager? Is it like a, wait, is it like an external thing or is it literally just built into the launcher and I just didn't notice it? You can use the Vortex Manager for BG3. Oh, that's different. That's not what I meant. I meant like one built into the launcher, but I guess that's, you know, they could never add that. Nexus. Oh, okay. I might do that then because I wanted to use the uh, mod that, uh, you know, when you have like a summon or a pet or anything like that. Oh, fuck, dude. I have no carry weeks. I have no strength. Shit. All right, I'm gonna have to... Yep. Am I overweight? No, he's perfect. Might as well try and kill this guy for XP, but it, I don't think it's gonna happen. The Mind Flayers are already on 38 HP, and this guy's... He's got a lot of health. Um... Also, it's wild that this guy doesn't provoke attacks of opportunity, but I guess this is a tutorial. Eat my shit. Yeah, alright, I think I'm gonna... <laughs> I think I'm just gonna save myself. Ah, oh, fuck. How do I get all the Nautiloid tanks, then? These things are heavy. These shits are heavy, and I am not. I do not have muscles on this, man. Dude, 24 meters. This guy's gonna be a rogue god. I'm just gonna goof on him, then. Wait, I don't have a candle or anything to ignite it. I just have grease. You don't get tanks then? Give them to Lazale? I don't plan on keeping Lazale. She's only here for the tutorial. We must die! Shit. Oh, that mind flayer is dead, dude. All right, we're out. Shit, this is really bad. He's done some terrible rolls. 
Give me those gems. Give me the fuck. Run. Alright. Have the brain tank the majority of the damage. Shit, I should have jumped. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Come on, dodge, 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 dodge. Alright, I'm gonna have Lazale slow him down. Um, I'm gonna give them astral knowledge of... Strength, because that'll help my hit chance, maybe. Oh, fuck, that used my action. <laughs> no, fuck! Shit! Alright, goodbye, Lazale. I literally didn't know the... Shit, oh, dude, my movement is so bad. Go with your little legs. Go, 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 go. Shit, 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 shit. Shitty shit, shit. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, go. Nice. Get back, you vile fiends. All right, now we heroically solo. Okay, here's the plan. Mage hen. Distraction over here. That hits the brain. This also hits the shoots of the brain. They miss because they're cringe. Then I can finish off one of these amps to get a little bit of extra XP. Because I'm going to need it. Kill steal the mind flare. Oh, that would have been a good idea, dude. Wait, did you ally with us? Yes. Little brain man. <laughs> I get pranked, dude. See the way that she died? This guy's just looking around like, well, that fucking... <laughs> he really fucked us up. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. Oh. You didn't know you could... You didn't know you could ally with us? The little brain man? You just gotta succeed the checks. All right, come on. Big damage. Yes! A little bit of extra XP. And then... Uh, I feel like if I... No, I, can't, I don't want to risk it. Let's get out of here. The hell also, this cutscene is so funny that. to me. Oh, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to show... So, no more Warhammer 3 videos? Uh, I will probably get back into Warhammer 3 videos. I'm just... I am I really like Baldur's Gate. I, I already really liked it. I've been... I've been waiting for the release of this game for three years. I bought it back in, like, 2011 or 2010. 2011 uh, 2020 or 2021 I forget exactly when it was I think it's 2021 it was December of 2021 2011 um, I probably won't be making Warhammer 3 videos anytime soon uh, or maybe not I might do a stream or two of the new DLC just because I have early access and I yeah, I would I wouldn't begrudge showing it off for people that want to see it but uh, I wouldn't advise I don't want to say don't buy it as you wait, because that's kind of a review uh, and, 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 and but I would say that pre-ordering is generally a bad idea anyway no matter what it's just a bad practice chaos of the crap into the it's never a good idea to pre-order unless it's for a game that you know is going to be good like Baldur's Gate or Elden Ring you know because they've been out in an early access they're they're incredible companies from soft and Larian the only two games that I can honestly say are worth the, at uh, full price is El Elden Ring and Baldur's Gate 3, which is wild. <gasps> Funny head! Okay, well, now I have to... Oh! Oh! <laughs> it looks so bad, actually. I'm going to need every help I can get here. At least I can give this guy everything. If I come across any ability, any any anything, like the, the witch's hair from the swamp, anything, I can give it to this guy. S to your hat. Fresh water. Hat on fleek. There must be a Larian is just lovely. Yeah, dude. I'm ho I was hoping that they would respond to my my video. Um I'd love to see their take on it, the halfling video I made. You know? I don't know if that's egotistical for me to be like, react to my content, but I would love to see their take on the on the Hoffling video, considering it, it, it's it been so far-reaching. I, I never expected people to like it so much. Um, do I love it? Like, I don't know. Maybe that means that they, they, they have to have seen it, right? I mean, it, it got shared thousands of times. It has like 2 million views on, on the, the explosion scene alone on Reddit. On, on, uh, on Twitter. Like, I assume they had to have seen it. I tagged them in it. The amount of notifications that they must have gotten. Notice me, Larian. 
Please. I love you and your game. Please. I beg you. I need validation from Papa Larian. You can hide armor while wearing it. Okay, it's sitting right above your crossbow. And the no, I know. That's what I was doing that for the longest time. See? Oh, wait, what do you... What do you mean? Oh, you can hide the... Oh, that's cool. Place weapon. This is just for the instrument, right? You mean this? Where you can, like, hide and show your stuff? I like the jacket too much, dude. This outfit is adorable. Alright, Shadowheart. Talk to me, lady. I think the lead dev retweeted it. Oh, damn. What? Stop! Not another stepper out! Wait. I just start making the fucking sands noise. You're the one who left me to die on the ship. Suddenly you see what Okay. Um uh, no can we get, is there like a sassy so option? Stand aside, I have lock picks and the skill to match. Jesus Christ, dude. Okay. By all me. I'm going to see what All right, lady. Hopefully there's um, no more of these creatures along wait, the way. Wait. Even I said just okay. Hurt your right. You can call me Shadowheart. Okay. Okay. I want to free stuff. Give me your stuff. Take thoughts. This is how you really sleuth free gear. I don't. This is this isn't, isn't worth much. No, no. I'll take a circlet. That doesn't weigh much. More healing potions. This is how to finesse healing potions in Scrolls early game. Serious artifact. She can drop it. What? Can I pick it up? Well, it just returned to her. What? <laughs> What? All right. Is that supposed to happen? I could have sworn that isn't supposed to happen. All right. Well. Oh, camp supplies. Now, how do I kick her? Ungroup. Oh fuck. No wait. Oh fuck. Can I tell her to leave? Something the matter. Um. If you're sure. Yeah. Bye. Get out of here, lady. Can I kill her now? <laughs> no, she's invincible. What? <laughs> she's just like fucking screaming in pain while walking away. Uh, I'm gonna sell all this, I guess. Wait, circlet's gotta be better than funny hat. No, what am I talking about? Funny hat all the way. Uh, I'm gonna send these to camp. I'm gonna send all of my camp supplies to camp because there's no point in having them in your inventory. Now we weigh a lot less. All right, should we just try lock picking this, or should I go and fight the brains? She'll die in camp probably. Let's go check on that. I'm curious. Her fucking just corpse is laid out in camp. Where is she? Is she actually dead? Oh, wait, shit. I get... No. Sheesh. Sheesh. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Please don't. Um. Oh, my God. I forgot about the funny outfit, dude. I forgot about the funny outfit, dude. No way, dude. Okay, we don't need Mask of the Shapeshifter. I'm going to check out all this other stuff, though. Maybe we can use some of this. I always forget to use a lot of this. The potion of animal speaking, that's always useful. That's for until long rest. Potion of mind reading, that is not until long rest. That requires concentration, right? I don't know. Uh, potion of flying, that could be useful. Drink to slow your descent. Feather fall could be good. Hill giant strength. Elixir of hill giant strength, fuck yeah. Food, food. Oh shit, this is the wrong inventory. Oh my god, dude. I hate you. Um. What was I gonna do? Oh, food, right. Fucking poutine. Dude, I've always wanted to try poutine. Has anybody tried poutine that's in the UK? What's it like? I don't trust America's super food stuff. I've been to the US, I've tried food. I've never tried poutine. I don't know if it's good. We do not need the loot. 
Funny bicorn is a no. Cape? Cape yes, cape no, guys. I look like a wizard. I vote no on cape. And needle of the outlaw rogue. It's just a dagger, right? I'll take short swords. They do better damage. Kind of underwhelming a little bit. Drip, drip, no cape, cape, yes. No, but yes, cape. Okay, guys, pick a lane. And not drink multiple potions just override your animal speaking when you drink the hill giant. No, it doesn't. See? See? Elixir of hill giant strength, speaking with animals. These are different. The speaking with animals is a potion, not an elixir. Elixirs override. You can only have one elixir at, at once. Wait, can we drip out our stuff with the Drake's eye? Sheesh! Can I... Wait, can you die? You can die underwear, right? I'm assuming. Sheesh! Look at my little vest! Oh! Oh, boy! And also the shoes. Oh, that was... Okay, that was pointless. That was kind of... That was pointless a little bit. Also, we can do a potion of mind reading. And that also stacks, but it requires concentrate. What? The Detect Thoughts potion doesn't require concentration, but the scroll does? What the fuck's that? Look, the scroll of Detect Thoughts requires concentration, but the potion doesn't require concentration. Holy shit, uh, what a waste. Wait, oh fuck, I didn't try on the Twitch outfit though. Oh! <laughs> God! Oh, I might have to. I mean, this is a Twitch drop. What do you guys think? Numero uno? Or, num or numero dos? This is very circusy. This is very, um... Oh! I like the booty shorts a little bit more. What do you guys think? Two? $5,000 shirt, right? I don't know. This is very ostentatious. But funny. Okay, we can either go for little booty shorts and little pink. Oh my god, those hams. We could go for little, little booty shorts. This little cute outfit right here with the gold belt. Or this. What do you guys think? I'm kind of on the fence a little bit. The pants with the flaming jacket? Yeah, I kind of- this is a little bit more unique. I think the other one's a little bit ostentatious and showy for our boy. He ain't like that. Sans Underdog is a man of class and grace and composure. We can always change later, maybe mix it up. Alright, let's get the fuck out of camp. Dripped out like you wouldn't believe. Onwards on our adventure. I look like I'm sponsored by McDonald's. This is fine. I take Ronald McDonald as a companion. He'd be goddamn terrifying. I was terrified of Ronald McDonald as a kid. I don't know what it is. They just happy looking clowns. Clowns are naturally terrifying. I don't know how they ever thought that the clowns were cool for kids. This ain't Twitch chat, for fuck's sake? What do you mean? That's true, that's true. This ain't Twitch. Alright. We're gonna have to play this big, smart style. So I'm gonna use some stealth here. <clears throat> we do 5 to 17 damage. If we hit a 17, we're gonna kill one of these in one hit. We might even crit. So if we go all the way over here, they have to go all the way around. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna... Get discovered. Oh, we successfully... Okay. Shit. Do now. Do go now. Oh, one down. Let's go. Oh. Why do we sound so handsome, dude? Look at this. <laughs> why are my legs so far apart? All right. One down. Um. Yeah, I can't really do much. I can't throw anything. I'm not going to chug. We got 11 health potions, though, which is pretty good. Clowns became a fear for me when I saw that what Raka Raka did with Ronald at Okoy. I don't even know what the fuck that you're talking about. Yeah, you forgot to kill Shadowheart. I'm, I don't need to kill Shadowheart. It's fine. 
She can just sit in the camp and I can I can use it for story stuff maybe. Um Can I Hide uses my action so I can't sneak attack. Dude, I need that fucking Do I really not have advantage? Alright, piercing shot, definitely worth it. Gaping wounds. I love a good gape. Alright, now I gotta get all the way back over here. What? Pro strats. When they get up here, we can just jump away, I promise. He wants to romance Shadowheart? Dude, I would have to climb her like a mountain to get in there. Have you seen my guy? The only person we're gonna romance is Halson, and that's for the bear scene. <laughs> because it'll upset people, and that is very funny to me. Alright, one down. Come on, big damage! Fuck! And then we can jump over here. Uh, right? Tactical genius over here. It's not even me, it's him. Now they have to come back around and we can just keep jumping over infinitely and they'll never be able to catch us. My man might be tiny, but he's got a big brain inside of that big... I almost said big black dome. <laughs> he does have... He's technically black. Fuck yeah, level up. All right, baby. Now, he's gonna have to dash again because he's too far away, and then we just finish him off. That 21 strength jump. Oh, yeah, shit, dude. We got the... All right, good, good, uh, yeah. Good catch. I forgot we we chugged that potion. Ugh! And that's how you kill three brains without taking a drop of damage. I don't go getting canceled now. What do you mean? I'm getting canceled because my guy's black? That, that's racist. Don't be racist to my little dark elf, my dark gnome, my deep gnome. Uh, ooh, we have rapier proficiency. That's kind of cool. I, can I, <laughs> why does he have watermelon? I'm sorry, I'm connecting the dots where they don't exist. I see what you're doing, Larian. I see what you're doing, Larian. There's no way. There's no fucking way that's unintentional, dude. <laughs> There's no way, Larian. I don't believe you. Right, I'm gonna stop putting the key items over here, I think. Healing potions are good. We don't have any spells. I don't plan on having spells, so this should be fine. Why didn't you grab it? By the way, okay, please do Doc and Docker video uh, soon. I can accompany as a pro bod. Bod is a bit OP. I'm buffing now. It is funny. I might... I was terrible at that game, dude. I was so embarrassingly bad at that game. I made one video on it, and you can just see how terrible I am, and it's so embarrassing. So maybe. I might make another video. It's a pretty fun game. Pretty good game. Pretty cool. Um, I'm gonna put throwing items over here, and then everything else like that, right? Throne, it'll add it. Potions and useful shit. Stealth, melee options. We're not doing magic. Magic is for little babies. Please explain watermelon joke. Absolutely not. <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> if you don't get it, I'm not <laughs> explaining for very good reasons. Nice. Mark these tools. This one we can just break. Leather helmet. That's going to put up our dex thing. Does this actually not work? Or is this bugged or some shit? Because look, I, I noticed if you actually check the thing, does it go up? Like... Uh, plus one to dexterity saving throws, right? Dexterity saving throws, plus two from class, plus two from class. See, it doesn't do anything. It doesn't add any. Oh, wait, plus, plus one from leather helmet. Okay, good. Yes, that does work then. What does it look like? Oh, we look like a superhero. We look like a medieval superhero. Well, I'm going to organize a little bit here. Got to kind of have all my stuff meshing together. Actually, you know what? Spike bulbs are terrible. As are caustic bulbs. They're not worth it at all. You're wasting your turn if you... Actually, I don't know. Caustic bulbs, because if they stand in the acid for a turn, they take damage. We'll play it by ear. Whatever. If I use it, I use it. What is this? Potion of Featherfall. All right. That ponytail, just in time for a starion. What? What ponytail? I have a hair quaff. 
Caustic bulbs reduce their AC as well. Ah, that's true. That's true. Also, I think caustic uh, liquid is flammable, which is good. You look like you're playing. You look like a child playing dress up at the rent fair. I always thought it was rent fair, like rent with a T, but apparently it's not rent fair. You look like a mini Roman soldier. What are you talking about? What kind of Roman soldier looks like this? Oh, these are the little jacket? The little color for McDon McDonald's jacket? Oh shit, I didn't level up. <laughs> Alright, not much to uh, worry about. We got all our coming actions. Which I'm probably gonna just replace outright. So we got cunning jump. That I mean, no, ignore that. Cunning dash. Cunning disengage and cunning cunning jump. Cunning jump would be really useful actually. That being said, it already uses a bonus action, so I guess it's completely pointless. But one that uses movement speed instead of a bonus action is always great. No! <laughs> Can I blow up this rock? I fuck, I'm doomed. Never mind. <laughs> four bods is probably OP. You mean four bods in um this game or four bods in uh Dark and Docker? Hi Rokoi, uh loved your BG3 four berserkers vid almost choked drinking my water. Four berserkers vid? Oh you mean the four uh, barbarian vid for, for BG3. Yes, thank you. I appreciate that. It's one of my favorite videos I think I've made in a long time. Alright, I'm just gonna stealth the shit out of Astarian, I think. Uh seven to seventeen damage, he's got ten HPs, five to okay. I'm gonna take the melee option on this. Get right up and personal in that big vampire ass. Oh, he died. He the didn't die. <laughs> he didn't die. No, he has more decks than me. No. Get fucked. Oh, come on. Oh, I don't have an action either. Knocks them off balance. I can't even kill him. What? That's such bullshit, dude. I'll just do an offhand that. No, I'll knock him off balance if I can't kill him then. God damn it, he saved. Whatever. Hit me. Ow. No! Why does he keep healing? What? Are you fucking kidding me? Well, you're doomed now because I have two actions. Piercing strike. And offhand. Come on. Nice. Die, Astarian. God, he almost beat me. That's so embarrassing. Eccentric clothes could look good. Tasteful shoes. I'm already, ro you know what? I'm already rocking it. That's fine. We'll leave a starium for dead. Amp supplies. And where are my chuggies? There we go. I'm not wasting my short rests. Short rests are for nerds. A starium gaping you? I know. Oh my god, ew. <laughs> Gaped by a gay vampire. God, this game is amazing. Ooh, can I just... If you just kill him, do you get good XP anyway? No dialogue! 35 XP, good. Alright, I'm taking off dual wield because it, it is such a liability. His action voice is making me laugh a little. Calling it a short rest is racist. <laughs> oh, I get it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We'll call it a, a, a normal size rest. A normal size rest. I'm surprised the chat didn't, li didn't rock up with short. Short that goes in the book. There it is. Uh, you will make an evil run? You mean a doc? Wait, I don't quite. Are you doing doc urge? Also thief or assassin? Thief? Uh, I think it's... Actually, I don't know. We're going to weigh the options when I hit level 3. Um, Alright, I'm actually going to... I'm going to let, let this guy live. I'm going to slap his hand, though, because I think it's funny. A hand? Anyone? Ow. <laughs> <laughs> it's never not funny. Um, helping and with a keen and calculate twist, Anyone? you attempt to sabotage the sig. What? What happens if I do that? I've never done this. Oh, I crushed it. What 
Whatever you're doing is working wonders. Now a quick little pull should do the trick. What? What did I just do? Did I lift? Did I just like? What just happened? How did you speed up the deal? The roll so much? I just hit spacebar. Did I just like fix the portal? Hello. You gaped his portal. A gale of water deep. I'm gay. Ugh, dude. I'm usually better at this. Can I just say the one joke in the video that I made, made that made me laugh more than anything was me cutting off when he says he's Gale at I'm gay. And I that legitimately I that made me laugh at my own video editing that. I'm such a fucking juvenile. Gape of water deep. Uh I'm not wasting any time, I certainly hope so. Okay, blah 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 blah. I don't should Okay, um never mind, I was on the roll line, blah 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 blah. So that's all that matters. Ship, you two were on the receiving end of a rather Couldn't have phased it more. You don't happen to be a cleric. Uh, really there's no high These tables are beyond even Doctor? line of fingers like yours. Um, Surgeon. Uncannily adroit with We're most certainly going to need a healer. I'm not certain? looking for a German companion. Uh, might be around the actually, you know what? Yeah, join me. And I'll send. I'll, and then I'll loot you because I want more healing potions. And I don't want you to fucking heal this time. Sans Underdog. I regret the name a little bit, but not really. Go to camp. We'll dress him down to his nines. Okay. Take, wait, can I? Hold on. I want to see if I can take advantage of something here. Can I give him a bunch of stuff? I want to try something here. <clears throat> can I make him a... Oh, I would have to respec? Really? Oh, man. No, I don't. Long. Okay, here, here's my plan. I get long strider and false life you can only cast on yourself expeditious retreat maybe i don't know this really doesn't matter and then i take off all this bullshit i put on these two things for cantrips i accept we go out we give long strider to my tiny boy and now he has three meters of movement to long rest yes and expeditious retreat which is only for Gale. Wow, that's stinky. Wait, dash available as a bonus action to long rest. Okay. All right, now we talk to him. And I say. And now I say. What? What? Go ahead. Oh, there we go. I question the wisdom of that decision. Yep. But I so be it. Um. No, I need you to. I question the wisdom of that decision. Yep. All right. Bye. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> Onward. Adokoi, respect him to transmute a wizard and have him uh, do your alchemy in camp. Ooh, that's a good idea. I could, I kind of just want him as a, as that. Like every time I level up, I can, and I, every time I do a long rest, I can go to him and just get, have him get a bunch of ritual spells and long rests so. Because now I have three meters of extra movement, which makes up for the fact that I have tiny legs. Oh, if I, okay, if I chug the fire resistance potion, it's going to replace my hill giant's potion, so I'm not going to do that. Fuck! I didn't mean to do that. I meant to add it to where's. Dude, he's a gnome, my guy. I am a gnome. Call me racist, but why halfling? Yeah, I'm still not a halfling. I'm a, I'm a fucking gnome. How dare you, sir? I got hops, though. Oh my god. Wait, I'm just going to hop everywhere. Are you kidding me? This is so much quicker. Oh my god, the 20 was- this is so much faster! Of course I, want to reach, but not I am a god! A tiny god and a- I almost said dark skin. Stupid political correctness. Alright, here we go. Then we stealth shot. Okay, it's gonna have to be a regular shot. Wait, I want to show you guys something. I want to see if this works. I have a- I have a big brain move. I have a big brain move. There it is. Oh, uh, no. No, all right, okay, hold on. I have an idea, I have an idea. This has worked once. Let's see if I can get it to work again. Uh, throw this like this. No, it didn't, fuck. They moved away. God damn it, dude. Fuck. 
Also, it takes away my action. I don't have a bonus action right now. Fuck! So my idea was to pull that woman in and then drop it so it kills all three of them. And I have made it work once. Oh, Adokai, both halflings and gnomes are short and ugly. Alright, that's our first ban of the day. What do you mean? Are you saying that short people are, are ugly? Are you saying that, that they are ugly in, in and of themselves? Because that's rude to all the short kings out there. Seen anyone but us. It's just wilderness out here. Get fucked. Get fucked. Get crushed and fucked. There's one less greedy bastard to share the loot with. Alright, I know. Look at that. No! Fuck! Fuck you, Warren! I need to get my stealth attack off, man! And now I can't move out of this? Um, alright, what's a good move here? God, I'm so weak. I don't want to use a potion speed. Wait, transform the targets fire resistance to the final vulnerability. Targets that are immune to fire damage are unaffected. Wait, so that is so minimally useful. Um Maybe a grease bottle. I tell you what. I'm gonna I'm gonna throw a grease bottle. Hopefully he'll fail it and fall. Nice. And then I leave. Did he ragdoll into the fucking wall? <laughs> he did! He's like laid up! That's fucking great. Uh, let's get out of here. And then hide. Now she can't do do any, any kind of shit. Come on, fall, 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 you idiot. Come on, moron. Oh, he just hit. Oh, he can't see me because I'm a god. I am a stealth god. All right, and I should pass the stealth check. Really? What? You gotta be... F you gotta be kidding me, man. Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Ah, oh, she's gonna get some stupid dead angle on me. Watch. No! You... Oh. <laughs> it's just skipping... <laughs> Fools! Yes! This is why greasing up little men and women works... <laughs> what are these sentences, dude? Get fucked. Uh, disengage. Where are you? Have that. Fuck, fuck. I didn't mean to do that. Um, shit. What's the move here? Big D&D. &D, okay, moment. How dare you? Uh, this is good. Right. Damn, do not cast sleep on me again. I swear. You're gonna firebolt me or some bullshit. No! I knew it! God, I can read these people like shitty books that they are. No! Alright, this is bad. Shit. Alright, uh, bonus action chug. And then we finish this guy off, please. Nice. His little body ragdolled, and that's very funny to me. And then we hide here. And then she slips on the vines or what? Nope, she jumps. Okay. All right. Okay, she dashed, which is great for us because that means she can't attack. And now, because we're she's out of our line of sight, we sneak and we sneak attack her. Maybe one shot her? Ooh, eat my whole balls, lady. Shit, where do we even go now? Can I just... What if I switch to melee and then I get like a foot away from her? That's got to be a better idea than running away, right? Nice. Nice. You can't shove me, lady. <laughs> please. Please. I have so much strength. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, I just fucked. <laughs> I fucking love having high strength, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was fucking perfect. I'm gonna take some of these things that were actually worth a lot of money. So, a lot of the swords are worth a great amount. Because they're worth like 40 and they only, <laughs> only weigh one. Nice. Also, I'm not wasting a short rest, so I'm gonna chug again. Back to full health. Good stuff. Grimblebuck. Laid up. I've never talked to this guy, but apparently you can talk to him. There's a whole other dialogue option that I've just never explored. Shovel, always good for digging up stuff. I don't know why it puts it in your thrones, your throwing weapons category. I don't think there's anything of much value around here. There's that chest with a healing potion, but I guess we'll do it this way. So this is like gonna be where it's it's actually gonna be like a 
fucking laid out body. <laughs> She's fully T posing. That's fuck. That's so funny, dude. I see Oko is is playing, and I click. I see him yeeting somebody. Times will never change. I throwing people off cliffs is always going to be my favorite thing in games. Nothing is more satisfying in video gaming than ledging people. Everything all right out there? The DC to intimidate you guys running into them was like seven. Yeah, how do we play this? Performance deception. See, this is where we're good. Nice, nailed it. All right. Oh shit, I already just quick save. All right, here we go. You're dead. Can I run around him and then step? No, because you have to be a certain distance, I remember. Oh, he's surprised though. So I can sneak attack him because I advantage. Nope, never mind. Never mind. I shoot him in the mouth and then melee attack him. And then he's going to be surprised for a turn. And then we walk around the back for effect. And then slash him in the back. And we miss. And then we follow it up with a really good critical. Come on! It didn't even kill him. I... Don't you dare. Don't you dare. You little. No! Nah! Ah, you moron. You tried it. Nice. What do these bottles have in them? Dry, dry, dried at the bottom of this. Are these just bottles? I never picked those up. I, I, I feel like they're supposed to be oil bottles or something. Can I just say it is surreal not having a bunch of portraits on the left side of the screen? It feels really strange and also kind of freeing and I really like it and playing solo is very fun but also <laughs> really difficult. Okay, moment. How dare you? I th you know what? This has been going a lot better than you probably thought, right? Can can you at least give me that much that you thought this was going to go terribly and then I it was just going to be me dying and reloading over and over again? Can I, can I get that out of you? I know that's like 80% of the people in my regular audience. No? Yes? Come on. You won't even give me that? What does this plaque say? Ancient, indecipherable I don't care. Text covers the plaque. What if I just make like a big old box wall for this, for this bit as well, for cover? For stealth and for cover. For high ground also. Hold on. All right. Oh, no, didn't mean to do that. Didn't get down. Also, I'm going to turn on all the lights to give myself the edge in terms of lack of light. Because I have 24 meters of, uh, of dark sight and they don't because they're, they're cringy little humans. And I'm a cringy little gnome. I'm disappointed that you aren't sucking. God, what a weird sentence. All right, we darken the room. So they don't know what to expect. Then we unleash boxes like this. Build a little box wall. Like this. Like this. And then we can move this around wherever we want. So we can put it like here. Then I can have a little stealth wall, right? Eh? Okay. And then, go up to camp. And then we... Oh, there's free shit here. What? A ball? Oh, this is just... <laughs> That's just a bunch of Gale stuff. I'm gonna take that mugwort off him. Can I use some alchemy? I won't be able to make anything yet, will I? Potion of mind reading. Dude, now that I know about that mind reading thing, I'm gonna be chugging a potion of mind reading every goddamn time. Oh, shit. Uh, where's my box? Adokoi, grab the portrait worth 35 gold. There's a portrait worth 35 gold? Alright, I'm gonna grab all the Nautiloid tanks. And they're gonna weigh a ton, and I'm gonna be overweight. No, never mind, I have 21 strength, because I'm a little strength goblin now. Dude, I wish I could play as a goblin so bad. Can I just say, if anybody can do that, please make, like... I'm waiting on that there's a mod that's already doing it, but uh, he's not adding in ogres to the mod, and I'm so crushed. But I want to play as a goblin. I will be doing probably a live stream or a playthrough of that. 
when that drops by the way as an ogre or i'll do a four ogre video a stream all that kind of stuff because <clears throat> playing as an ogre in this game would be amazing just just a big old guy with like terrible intelligence modifiers i crave that so bad having like a negative four to intelligence all right so pro tip for this oh i'm fucking stuck shit Spread these out a little bit. You'll get more people. God damn it. Do I not have any way of doing fire? I need to find candles or something. Shit. I have no way of setting off anything on fire. Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah, okay. I have an idea. I have an idea. Okay, so here we go. So, stealth. Turn this brazier on. Just really quick. Wait, are there any candles? How long does do flaming weapons last? Like two turns, right? It's not very long. All right, and then we dip in the fountain thing. Those are swords. That's not a bow. Okay. Dip the bow in the in the brazier because that makes sense. And then we turn off brazier. Open the thing. I'm a quick save here as well. Open the brazier. And then shoot. Oh, and then we get we have crazy decks, so they're fucked. I can't do this because I don't have an action But Wait if I switch to melee weapons are they gonna be on fire? They're not all right shit. I don't have an action Wait, all right, and then I hit this And knock all of that everywhere and then we run away. Oh Shit wait, am I not gonna have any way to light that on fire now? Maybe they'll set it on fire if they're burning do not shoot me. Do not shoot you, unbelievable. Okay. All right. I don't quite using any mods. No, 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 no mods. Oh, don't jump. Don't jump. Oh, they got so far, though. Okay. This is. Oh, shit. Wait, do I have fire on my bow still? Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Wait, not enough movement? There's no way I don't have enough movement. Okay, bonus action. Is bonus action a dip? Fuck, I need that. Um, Alright, potion of speed. Uh, Light the candles. Dip. Fuck! I don't have a bonus action. Oh, shit, dude. Um, Alright, I'll just kill this guy. Shit! Alright, I'll just kill this guy. Nice. And then I'll put the chair on the table. Block their way so they can't shoot me. Like this. Maybe put the put this little trunk in the way. No. All right. Uh. All right. This is good. We need a turn. Nice. Another one died. There's only two of them. Stand on the no. All right. All right. We got this. We got this. All right. They're pretty close to the explosive thing. All right. Now is our chance. Now we dip. Potato chip. We get. Oh, make sure you got your range weapons out. Got the crossbow. And we dip. Get our flame thing. And then we fucking shoot the Nautilite tank and get them both. Come on. Ah, four damage. One of them died. I think the lady died. So it's just her now. And then we just finish her off. Come on. Yeah, she's got two health. She's screwed. And we run over here. And hide. And she hopefully burns to death. No! Ah, oh, you're doomed, lady. You're doomed! Woo! And that's how it's done. That's <laughs> sort of. That went pretty good. Solo, solo rogue. W taking out like seven or eight guys. That worked pretty good. It only took a speed potion and a little bit of some other stuff. We should get more than we lost. How much XP did I get, though? Ooh, leather gloves, leather boots. I don't have any gloves on, right? Nice. I like the fur boots. Boots with the fur. Now carry the candle with you. Oh, you can't pick up these candles. They're, they're only usable candles. You can get them out of boxes, though. Maybe there's some in the boxes. No, nope, I've already been through those. It's just a chance thing. You just have a chance to maybe get 
candles out of like crates, boxes, barrels. Did they close this door again? Oh no, they died. They fully died. <laughs> Scroll of burning hands. That'll be good. I'm actually going to keep some of these because th this sucks. Scrolls are burning like tier level one spell scrolls or level two, whatever they are, like get so bad by late game. Fuck, I gotta stop doing that. We need options for this little man. How close are we to leveling up? See, if we were getting extra levels, okay, that'll be super, super useful. Alchemist fire, always good. Simple toxin, I actually am going to use that. I can get that as a bonus action. We need everything we can get. We are... <laughs> we have limited options with this little guy. I hold scrolls. I hold some scrolls. Some scrolls are not worth holding because they're terrible. But then some are really good. Come on. Ah, I guess I don't need candles though now. But I've also used all the nautiloid flasks, which means I gotta start looking for oil barrels. A, a different hat. Hey, yo, what? Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. That's pretty good. Although, we're giving up a leather helmet, so I kinda can't, because I, I actually want the stats. <laughs> Plus, I'm not about to unequip my little McDonald's outfit, so. Shit, wrong way. Drippy? Big iron on his hip? Yeah. We're little iron. I, I, re I named him wrong. The cowboy no. How many XP do we actually? 329. We can get that off of just some interactions alone. So I could weasel my way through, like, over to the dragon thing, pass, like, a speech check, and bam, I can hit level 3 really early on. Nice. Okay, perception. Having high perception is huge. Role play a gunslinger. Dual hambo's quickest draw in the underdog. That's the plan. That's the plan, my guys. We're going dual uh, handbows. Do we actually have efficiency, uh, proficiency for those? We do, yes, because Sans Underdog is proficient with these following weapons. So we can use long uh, hand crossbows. Hand crossbows are unbelievably good, by the way. They're, you're essentially, they're your best friend is a rogue. You should always use them. If you want already. This place wasn't built for the living. Damn, that's a lot of protection from good and evil scrolls. I'm actually gonna pop one of those now so I don't forget it requires concentration but it gives us uh, adva disadvantage and blah, blah 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 whatever we need to figure out something for those undead though because that's going to be really hard to deal with that's actually going to be really difficult especially without explosives I might have to go get some oil barrels and come back what do you guys think You did tower my ogre that way to handle inventory. Wait, did, yo, hold on. Did the fucking Plankton voice get better? That, that sounded way more like Plankton. You did tower my ogre. Thank you. Thanks for the donut, Anos. You did tower my ogre that way to handle inventory. What? You did tower my... Am I just... Am I having a stroke? Thank you for the dodo, my guy. I, I am too dumb to understand what that says. Ooh, a trident. Soul coin, always good. I'm so confused. English probably isn't his first language because he's donating a sec, so I'm not I'm not about to make fun of the guy, but I, I don't understand what he said. I feel dumb. Blank today, our voice is so good at singing. Dude. I it sounds way clearer. It used to be like robotic. That actually sounds so good now. Can I disarm this? Do you not get the option? Can I hit what happens if I hit the button? <laughs> okay. Yes, yeah, so okay. Here is a stroke police. You have a stroke. Oh god. Okay. Oh I forgot to grab the st No!
right. Okay. On in on in hindsight. <laughs> in hindsight, I okay. I thought you could disable this. I'm gonna be real. Okay. No, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, go, 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 jump, 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 fuck! I'm fucking dead. I'm fucking dead, dude. I'm gonna burn. One HP. We can do it. We can do better than that. God damn it, dude. Fuck. You can disable it. It. You didn't detect it. You can just. Oh, did I fail the perception check? Use turn based. All right. Fine. Okay, you shift space. Is that to turn on? Yeah, turn based mode. Fine. There you go. There's a trap. And we out of here. All right, thanks for that. I forgot about turn based mode for a minute there. All right, and we in. Let's go see the book with a huge cock. F8 is quick load. Oh. Yeah, I should probably do that. <laughs> now that's a lot There's a bunch of hotkeys that I don't use, which I probably should. Ooh, another soul coin. I feel like that's not a guaranteed drop out of that. Oh shit, I don't have anywhere to put quest items and stuff. Somebody remind me to get a uh, pouch. Alright, let's see if we can nail this. Okay, what? book is far lighter than it should be with um, such a massive lock smash lock open with gnome strength fuck look at Ancrelia's book <laughs> the these, the oh these little little just wrist pads fuck yeah the how did I win that as the locker, what was once script is now in a Oh, come on. There's no way I passed this. Oh, come on, dude. How did I fail the strength check and then... Okay, game. Brave and Feebleman, we can try to deal half damage with weapons actually strength. See, this is just not worth an action, in my opinion. You're using your entire action to make sure that the enemy that you're enfeebling deals half the weapon damage with strength. It's just so specific, and it requires concentration. So even if they deal half damage and they hit you, it'll break concentration and you lose. It's just so bad, dude. Am I the only one who just thinks Raven Feeblement just sucks ass? Control Wizard goes hard. Yeah. On my, I, I wasn't a huge fan of Wizards. They do get super strong late game though. Scribes, but no sign of a struggle. I'll be real. They get really strong. And then again, so do fighters. My fighter is way stronger than my than my mage. My fighter could absolutely clap the cheeks of my mage. My uh, Eldritch uh, half orc fighter. Oh, quite you're the best. Love you. Ah, oh, love you too, buddy. I don't want to be parasocial or anything. Knives actually seem to be worth it, by the way. Fucking... They sell for 16 and they only weigh 0 0.45, which is nothing. That's nothing. Give me your gimme, 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 gimme. Wait, if I put the quarter staff down, what happens if I put it in the chest? If this game went to level 20, then wizard would be the most OP class. Yeah, true, true. I go but I go for fun instead of meta anyway. Like, I don't care if druid if uh, wild shaped druids are mid. They're they're fun. They're really, really they're they're fun. I don't care if rogues actually rogues are pretty meta. I was gonna say I don't care if rogues are like bad. Rogues are amazing. I don't care what anybody says. Rogues have got to be easily like top three classes. Like I, I saw this guy made a tier list for the classes and Rogue wasn't even in, the, in like the top five. And I was like, this man is sleeping on Rogues so bad. Especially if you put a point into Fighter and you get a uh, twin weapon proficiency, which is what we're going to do later. Your inventory management is phenomenal. I always end up with the entire kitchen it in my inventory. Like that is so good, dude. A hundred percent that's been patched. That sounds exactly like Plankton. Oh my god. That's perfect. Thank you for the dono, my guy. A Soon Song. That is a cool Korean name. 
Why are Asian names so cool compared to like Western names? I guess that's a matter of perspective, but John Smith, like it's, it's so boring. Learn like Indian names and shit. Every other country, I feel like it, like other culture has like cooler names than I guess white people, I guess. Damn. Miniature Wesley Snipes US. sneaking in Nutshot's playthrough is gonna be lit. <laughs> Dude, they made it so much better. I'm so hyped. That is so good. The inscription is in a language unknown. That really sounds like Plankton. That's amazing. I, we need to go back to the yelling uh, crab stuff. That's amazing. Edoko, your full halfling uh, bath was literally the best video I've ever seen on YouTube. I've never laughed so freaking hard in my life. You earned mine and my brother's subs. Dude. Thank you, man. I'm glad you enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun making it. I never expected it to take off like it did, though. Like, it, it is crazy how popular it's gotten. Like, it's easily the most popular video I've ever released, and it's been, like, three days. Like, it's insane. Crab, thank you for the donos, by the way, guys. Uh, Dennis Zerzako with a five-year dono. Miniature Wesley Snipes sneaking in Nutshot's playthrough is going to be late. <laughs> Miniature Wesley Snipes? Because he's, he's not even... Okay. Why the Wesley Snipes comment? Okay, we gotta figure out a plan here, actually. Oh, fuck. How am I gonna tackle this? Okay, guys, I need strats. I actually need strats here, because this is gonna be really difficult. I gotta... Scroll of Burning Hands could be good here. We don't have any, like... I don't know, dude. What's the move here? Maybe just hucking Alchemist Fire outside of this little room and kiting them into it? Just don't fight, hide, and avoid them? Uh, we can try that. Well, let's see what happens. Let's see how this goes. Oh hells! Oh. Something just woke up. Dude, my guy sounds way too cool for his stature. You know? Oh! Oh no, you don't. Oh shit! They like patrol and stuff. Okay. Hold on. Okay, maybe we can take advantage of this. Let's 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 wake up. Oh fuck! I gotta kill the undead first. All right, well, we'll get this amulet of lost voices. Maybe we can speak with the undead and then tell them to chill the fuck out. All right, let's see how this goes. <laughs> I could really use those those dual crossbows already. Get him, hit him in the back. All right, I've used up my turn. That's fine, though. They're surprised. I can use this. I got the drop on them. Bullshit, I don't have advantage. What? Wait, am I not hidden? Okay, I see. Oh! Nice. Ah, shit. We're not far enough. I'm gonna get hit. Damn it. They're gonna hit me with, like, a bolt or something. Go on, Eldritch Blast me or some bullshit. Oh, nice. Toxin on the undead. It's acid damage, right? Oh, is it shit? Is it not? Oh, it's poison. Fuck! Your immune to poison. Fuck! I thought it was acid. Shit. Okay, maybe we hide. Ooh, nice. Yes, okay, this can work. And then we get here. And then I don't have advantage because I used my action to hide. How did. What happened? I proceed to hide. God fucking damn it, dude. What? Can I dash and then still hide? I think I'm hidden. Yep. All right. Shit. Shit. Oh. They don't know where I am. This is. Look at him look around. I love that little addition. That's so cute. Oh. They. Lo nice, dude. No way. Ain't no way. I got away with that. <laughs> no, get fucked! Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, no, no. Ah! Okay, this is good, this is good, this is good, this is good, this is good. We can just keep kiting them and stealthing them. Like a little goblin man. Nice, nice, nice. Get fucked! No fucking way, dude! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Somebody play the fucking... I'm done. I can't wait, wait, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have to, I have to. 
gear health theme song hold on wait Okay, we got this. No, 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 don't. Oh, fuck. Why is this working so well? Why is this working so good? The fuck, did he? Ain't no way with this. Ain't no way with this, man. What? We are a god. We are a little god. This could not be more perfect music. Get fucking clear, dude. What? Holy shit. Oh my fucking god. Yo! Solo gnome playthrough is where it's at, man. Yo, that was fucking great. <laughs> the true Okoi moment. Hey, I mean, I didn't fuck up, so maybe not. That couldn't have gone better. Wow. We cleared out that whole thing very decisively. Nice. Um, we're now we're let's go get that free health potion maybe i should do that as a stream highlight that was crazy i can't believe how well that worked rogues overpowered it's just that it's that ability to hit people and kill them or even damage them without them noticing is it because they were undead or is it just like the stealth system is a little weird because that seemed crazy strong i've had similar things like that happen before but yes stream highlight yeah i should i should highlight that because that was crazy a little man did so good. Ah, we failed the fucking perception check. All right, let's go deal with Lazale, I guess. Damn, dude. We're killing it out here. Also, is this scaling with my strength? Because my strength is way higher than my dex now. Maybe that's why I'm hitting for so good. That didn't make... That was a really bad grammar. Stealth system is super jank, but that's really good for us. As a solo player, we can take advantage of that. Speaking of which, also it was really dark in that room, so that probably helped. And considering we have stealth proficiency and shit, I'm just gonna light these guys up because I want the XP. Oh! oh, yo, no way! Oh, we're in combat though, and so is Zale. Nice. Oh, I'm gonna hide over here because there's no point in wasting an action. So she'll hit Lazale. She'll hit Lazale, and almost kill her in one shot. Goddamn! You finish off? Oh, almost. Ah, shit, we got discovered. Oh, she ain't going nowhere, though. Do I have advantage? No. Can I stealth? What if I... Ain't no way that works. Nah. Disadvantage. I don't know about that. Don't you dare hit me. Nice. Nice. Where are you going? Get him! Get him! Dude, we're cracked! We're so cracked with this little man. And now we can get Lazale for story reasons, I guess. She gotta put some clothes on, though. It's a little unacceptable. Alright, lady. Um... Alright, I wanna see what you have. What do you got? Can she give you anything? If I give her, like, perks and stuff? Oh, okay. A lot of people are saying this. Once you're going to look at the tomb after killing those are dead. Fuck! Yes. Yes, I was. Shit, dude. What does the underwear look like? I oh, know, I'll lose my little... I'll lose my little jacket, actually. You know what? Alright. Alright, I'm gonna go back. Yes. Yes, go to camp. I don't want you. It's a solo playthrough, lady. You're cramping my style. And if this man has anything in style... <laughs> oh, this run animation is precious. Mm. Certified Oko moment. I tell you what... 
We've had plenty on this stream, but it's mostly been good stuff. Why did I come back to the Zale with no clothes? Um, this is the morning after. Pay someone to comb through your streams to make a compilation of the abundant Okoi moments. I've, uh, I've thought of doing that. A, a buddy of mine, uh, likes editing. So he just, like, cut together a bunch of clips. Or, like, was trying to do YouTube shorts and stuff like that. I need somebody to, like, go through a stream and just comp make a compilation of me fucking up. And, like, all the best, only the best Okoi moments, though. I can't, it can't just be, like, all of the moments. Because it was every time I fuck up. <laughs> oh my god. You'd just be uploading a whole stream. You know? Which is not great. Alright, here we go. Yes, no. I love you, Withers. You're so cool. Alright, go. Yes, I will. You're the best. You're, you're my favorite. You're my favorite little undead man, and I love you. Withers is such a cool guy. Such a nice guy. Can I teleport anywhere? Uh, overgrown cliff ruins? Nope. Uh, roadside cliffs. That's it. Please just showcase different underwears at least once. Oh, like try on their underwear? I feel like it's kind of gross undressing your companions to try on their underwear. I mean, you, like, even in, in like an RP context, you're just like, hey, Lizale, can I... Can I borrow those? <laughs> Can I borrow those? Just for a minute. I just want to try them on. And then what if you keep them? Like, it's I'm, I'm surprised that the compa there isn't like a program they could think program the pro oh my god a programmed in thing where if you try and take your companions' clothes, they like they they act like you're weird, or they they at least comment on it, you know. The fact that they don't even mention it is crazy. You're a rogue. They don't ask. They don't even know. <laughs> like, I'm just accident. Like, when women take off their bra without taking off their shirt somehow. I just, they don't even know. It's just gone. We're off to find the wizard. So, I, there's really like a, a, a Looney Tunes ass Disney run to this guy. Like, I'm running downstairs on the first day of Christmas. On the, on the, you know, on Christmas Day, I mean. I don't even. Speak the dead could be useful, actually. All right. Open the Open bloody the gate. Bloody gate. What? Nope. Oh shit. Oh nice. It's my turn first. Oh, I I might have to. I have so much strength too. Can I throw him? Uh, fifty-six percent disadvantage. I'm still gonna do it. <laughs> it's always so funny. Um. Is Arsonist's oil worth keeping? I feel like there's not going to be anything that has fire resistance that I'm going to need to bank on this hard and waste the bonus action using, especially when I have hand crossbows. Actually, I'm just going to sell it. The more money we have, the better. We can fund our little man's misadventures. I have no more actions, so I'm just going to hide so I don't take any random hits. I'm going to let these guys fight. I still get all the XP, right? Throw her. Let's go. It always... the dude, 20, Having high strength is just unmatched. If you haven't tried it, by the way, you're doing yourself a disservice by not playing a uh, Berserker Barbarian. That okay, that'd be a great run though. Solo Rogue My Underwear run steals every underwear in game. I could do a speed run to see how fast I can get every NPC's underwear. <laughs> underwear collection speed run. Get aside with the goblins this playthrough? That would be very underdark of me. That would be very Sans underdark of, of Sans. What do you guys think? I could put up to a vote. We could just be totally evil or totally good. I named my Sans Underpants. If anybody doesn't know, by the way, this guy's called Sans Underdog. I didn't suggest it. Um, and I, I do hate it, but I also love it. Not because they enslave your kin. Oh, that's true. That do be true. Maybe we just go on like a freeing the, uh, freeing the gnomes kind of playthrough. You know? Ain't no, I'm sorry, ultra instinct ass. What the fuck? <laughs> Who is this 
guy? What? Who the fuck is this guy? Fucking Spider-Man. I feel like he's gonna start doing that wrist flick Spider-Man bullshit. Goblins are gnomes with sharp teeth. That's a little racist and, you know, re reductory. Reductory? Is that a word? Goblin wick? <laughs> it's gob wick. These guys might die. Oh no, they're actually doing pretty good. Kinda. Oh, Ramira's gonna get fucked. Okay, with just one of me, I think... <laughs> People are gonna start dying, shit's gonna go down. Alright, did this guy hit me? No, he didn't even get me. Alright. Can I stab him in the face? No. I'm just gonna go melee then. Come on. I dodged that, bitch! I'm going to further shame you by pushing your body up. <gasps> Can I get pushed onto that person? No way. Ain't no way. No, let me get my positioning right. Ain't no way. Come on. No! Come on! Ugh. You can do something like that, by the way. If you don't know this tech right, get a chest, fill it with a shit tons of heavy crap, and then use a blast spell to push it off a cliff onto somebody, and it will do insane amounts of damage. And I might be doing that uh, to, in order to try and kill the dragon or something. Because I want to see how much experience you get for killing that red dragon. Either that, or we're going to sneak up behind the red dragon, put a shit ton of explosive down behind it, and then blow it up. What do you guys think? I want to do one or the other. As long as it doesn't drag me into dialogue automatically and I can actually sneak in. I want to try some shit like that. Blowing up the dragon would be amazing. Uh, Alright, there's no way I'm stealth in here. I'm just going to have to... Bin. Let's start finishing him off. One down. Bugbear's almost dead. We're good. I can get those gloves off that guy. Gain of the Absolute or whatever. Both. You mean the dragon in Act 1? Yes, the dragon in Act 1, the gift dragon. Hey, yo, they, they, they kind of cleaned house a little bit there. Maybe we knock him out also. Oh shit. I'm gonna do that. Oh! Okay, they're apparent. Oh, hand crossbow! Oh, fuck yeah, dude. Oh, fuck yeah. Four to nine. I'm gonna put it to the side right now, but I definitely will be using that. Grease, scroll of grease, actually extremely useful. Do not underestimate scroll of grease. Knocking enemies prone is so strong. Are they gonna accuse me of stealing? No. All right, good stuff. Only one of them died. It was Both from my favorite TV series, The Sampsons. Is this an open world game? Um, yeah, kinda. It's like a, it's a, it's what I would call a semi-linear free roam game. You have complete freedom to roam around in different acts, but when you proceed through, the, through those acts, it goes to, yeah, it's kind of free roam. I don't quite, do you like Linkin Park, their new song, their new song Lost is Insane? No, I, I haven't listened to Linkin Park since I was about 12 years old or 13. In like the early 2000s. Well, I guess the mid 2000s. See much player bells. I don't, I don't fucking. Okay, Hello, rogue. Bell, you again? All right, curly Show hair. Fuck. The Yorkshire accent see. ass. Well, I didn't clean. Okay, well I'm gonna the hit him. Um. Twitches. He's about melee to attack. Blow. Aim a blow at the human. What if I just started blowing him? Fuck yeah! You're about to get slapped, son. Ugh! <laughs> Take that with your fucking curly hair. That, Look at me stance, though. The goblins have found us. No doubt the beast will be back. We need to pack up and leave. Immediately. Immediately. Did he leave? Is he crying already? Can I loot him while he's down? Nah, Zevlor would get mad. You acted quickly. I'm just sorry I didn't get there. Thank you. Um, I'm Sans Underdog. <laughs> I should warn you. I feel like they, no they have no context or awareness for Whatever the name Sans Underdog. Like see to it quickly. The druids are forcing everyone out. This attack will only strengthen their resolve. 
Uh, I have no quarrel with druids, stay. blah, 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 blah. You what brought you here? Cool. The desert was that, yes. Um, the ritual, Perhaps something. Yeah, I'll see what I can do. Sure. I'm probably not going to do any of that. All right. Time to go kill a bugbear for extra XP. How close are we now? Oh, if I kill this bugbear, I'll level up. Nice. I got to stop running and start jumping, too. You're so fast. Ooh. Get fucked! Nice. Um, ooh, she's probably gonna get absolutely rocked. I don't think I can prevent this. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna hide. You're on your own, lady. Oh, she's he's surprised. Nice. Of course. I knew that. Whatever. Oh, she discovered me? Are you serious? A lot of help you are, lady. I'm gonna get behind her so she might die instead of me. Well, I'll throw something to her, not me. Nice. Oh, you idiot! You fucking moron! You could have survived that! Ain't no way! Alright, well, thanks for the scroll of Featherfall on the coin. And the books. Which I will read. Oh, did you guys know you can do this? Look. Peer through the telescope. <laughs> Too small to peer through the telescope. Nice. The drag. It's a dragon. You see a dragon circling like no, a No, she's so cute. Prey. Simp! Hunting. Dude, it really looks like I've been drinking milk, you know? From certain angles. Uh, brass locket. What is this for, then? Oops, shit. I don't want to rip this guy's weak-ass brass locket. Shit, I need a bag. What do you get a bag or a satchel or some? I need, like, a, a place to put all my quest items and shit. Basic poison, constitution saving throw. I feel like we're not going to need poison. Oh shit, wait, I need this though. Sc Scroll of Featherfall. Always useful. Uh, empty the whole canister of Skull White. <laughs> Alright, oh shit, alright, level up. Nice, alright, here we go. Look at my precious little outfit. Alright, Thief, I think is... Alright, this is the big decision, kind of, for early game. Do we go Thief for um, falling damage and a second bonus action, which is huge. And if we get level 4, we can get... Um, I'm going to put one level in a fighter to get twin weapon fighting, because it makes us way stronger. Um, or Assassin, which is... You're against surprised enemies, it's... You advantage on attack rolls against creatures that haven't taken a turn yet. Uh, any successful attack roll against a surprise creature is a critical hit, and uh, you immediately restore an action or bonus action to start a combat. So basically, it's like, Assassin is good for ambushing, and only ambushing, but Thief, you get a bonus, an extra bonus action, which is just crazy. Thief? Thief is almost always better. Yeah, see, that's what I mean, because... Most like if you're fully if you are doing assassination shit, if assassin gave you a, a guaranteed critical hit every time you're attacking from hidden, then I would totally take that. But thief is better. Two bonus actions is crazy. How do you have 21 strength? Uh, because I have a elixir of hill giant strength. It's a long rest. Oh fuck! I thought she was gonna blow him there. Holy shit! I want my buff. Thank you. All right, uh, yeah, there's fucking nothing over here. Into the town we go. Up to 27 hit points already. Good items. It's going well. We got some good, some options. Maybe I need to use these a little bit more. This is about your 
Assassin has got tier on solo, especially once you get Bloodlust Elixir, even more if you get multi for two attacks. Yeah, late game, I'm sure it is, well, is there probably worth it. But that Act bonus action, dude, do. don't underestimate having an extra the bonus rich, action. Some bits and bobs I okay, I kind of want these gloves. I might just, this might be my first major purchase, is gloves and missile snaring. Every time you take a ranged weapon attack, you roll a 1d10 plus your dexterity modifier to reduce the damage, which is fucking crazy. They're really good early game gloves, so I think I'm gonna just outright buy them. And then also I want a hand crossbow. Can I just sell my whole shit before I buy these? Nope, didn't think so. Uh, why does this default to one, by the way, instead of defaulting to two? I, I, I don't understand. Maybe I can just... Hold on. Can I just... Can we stop shouting? No, you can't multi-select in this menu. I didn't think so. God damn it. Should be here selling the heavy stuff, actually. I'm dumb. All right, we'll buy the gloves and then fuck i should have bought the gloves and then he would have had enough money for me to sell all my shit i'm fucking stupid because now i can just fucking hit sell wares what what is worth so much money oh the revivify scrolls please the revivify scrolls and that's that's gonna be worth so much money in the long run Revivi scrolls. Ooh, a plus one set of padded. What do you guys think? Plus one set of padded or we go for some other shit? Just drag him? Eh. Also, I might buy some healing potions. We have a good amount of money. They're worth almost nothing. And the more healing potions we have, the better. We'll find better soon. True, true. Uh, you sure for light armor though? Scroll of Enlarge. Ooh. I kind of want to see my guy as a really big gnome. That sounds kind of funny. Healing potions are hella cheap. That's true. I, I always buy healing potions, like big or lot. Ooh, Hill Giant Strength. I'm buying that. I want to continue my strength after a long rest. Unless I can get an elixir of bloodlust. That'll be my goal. Elixirs of like elixirs of bloodlust are like pretty much the best in the game. They're nuts. They're absolutely cracked. Also, collecting arrows could be good. Ice arrows are amazing. You're slipping. I'm not gonna waste my money. Maybe we'll come back and get it later on. Goodbye. Get a little bit of free extra XP. Uh, persuasion. Just fucking crushed it. I'd listen to me. I'd listen to my little guy. Wouldn't you? Can we talk? You're addressing me, a humble ox. Yeah, I'm sure this guy isn't some something else. Not gonna spoil it. Off. This creature isn't what it appears. No, you are incapable. Equation. Way too many bonuses to turn it down. Even if we fuck it up. I'll tell you this much. No. All right. Funny. Did you just say TikTok? Oh man, cringe. Have you ever thought about how certain phrases are ruined by popular culture? Like how like you can never say there's something among us without people going, Among us? Sauce? You know? I don't, uh, okay, you can right click instead of pressing space when skipping dialogue. Really? Why? Can you guys hear me slamming the space bar? <laughs> is, that, is that why? <laughs> I didn't even think about that. Uh, I'm gonna let her fuss on me. I love Ethel. I wish you could join her, dude. Are you gonna get branded by the goblins? I've never seen anyone does it, so it would be interesting. Sorry to go on about it, but are you all right? Wait, are you gonna get branded by? The goblins. I've never seen anyone do it, so it will be interesting. I think there's probably downsides later on. 
What, is there any downsides to getting branded, guys, other than being able to use branded weapons as a bonus, but then, like, absolute gear? Gear of the absolute? Um... Alright. What's wrong? Uh, as cool, cool, yes, cool, cool, cool. I may have something at home. No, do you need it? Hey, father. Is that anything good? You're an idiot. Ooh, thirty, dude. Fuck yeah. Dude, they're so cheap. They're actually so cheap. It's so worth it in the long run to buy healing potions. I can't stress that enough. Like I've got, I'm up to twenty. Like I'm so unlikely to die now, just based off of that. What do you guys think of like a long haul campaign like this, by the way? Because this is, I'm actually having so much fun. It's actually pretty bomb. What do you guys think? Oh, I forgot to equip the gloves too. Shit. Nice. So now we're resistant to miss. Oh! You, fat best to fill your I did not mean now, to. While we still... <laughs> Yo, that's so high quality. Bruh, look at that. Dude, Larry are so talented. How long until Roland shows off his thunder wave? Yeah, Invispot, buy Invispot. Oh shit, yeah. Good idea. <laughs> True. Yeah, bro, a tie a game with this guy. It could be a good, good stream. At least we get until we get to the point where we're really, really strong. 124, fuck that. I'm not spending 124 gold on being able to go invisible. You break invisibility when you attack. Thanks for fighting off those goblins. Long haul campaign with chat. Uh, I want to bring my Dragonborn into Zuckerberg. If you, uh, you know what, I would love if there was some way for players to hop in and out constantly. Oh, dude, I thought there was a plus one hand crossbow for a second there. I was about to cream. All right, so we sell a light crossbow. We buy a hand crossbow, and then we get dual hand crossbows. Look at our little guy with our crossbows. And then I might buy padded armor. Orange dye. How about I buy like? Oh, I'm not gonna see it anyway. Never mind. I don't. Maybe it's not worth it. 200 gold for one more armor class, and one less bludgeoning damage. I don't know, man. What do you guys think? The Zent have one-handed crossbows. That's what these are. Hand crossbows. They're not just a Zent thing. Oh, you mean like they have plus one versions? That worth? Darkness arrow. Ooh, darkness arrows are really good. Yeah, darkness arrows are so good. How much are arrows? That might be worth it, actually. I'm gonna buy a fire arrow because they're, they're cheap as hell. Yeah, fuck it. I'm gonna buy some, some arrows. Knocking people back would maybe be okay? This is the first time I'm buying so much shit. I have so many items! God damn, we may have to call the herd a little bit here and cut down on some of these... these things. Shit, where do I even put arrows? Rogues always have, like, they're, you don't even cast spells and they always have a billion things on their bar half the time, at least I do. Flying could be good, featherfall, uh, I'm gonna phase out the scroll of burning hands. I think it's gonna be very rare I'm actually gonna be able to use these. Can you put your shit in a bag? Like your arrows in a bag? Depends. How many people are dumb enough I would like to see how you fight the bigger fights. Uh, for the really big fights, I'm, I'm gonna have to employ some new tactics, like explosive barrels and shit. Look at these little hand crossbows, dude. They're gnome-sized. It's perfect. He could probably fire one of these by itself, legitimately, as a full-size crossbow. Uh, Alright, we're two now. We've done damning. We've got our shopping. Maybe we rescue the goblin and then kill the goblins in the cave? Or kill that goblin? It really depends who we're joining. Alright, well, we need to go talk to the druids. Onward and outward! Uh, we're so... 
goddamn good at everything, dude. Fuck! <laughs> it's a good timing for that. Come on, don't fuck it up. Bruh, you know what the worst part about this is? The stuff that's in this chest is dog shit. Wait, sturdy. What do I need to break a sturdy? 10 damage at least. We can get sturdy. Uh, weak to bludgeoning. Do I have anything I can do bludgeoning damage with? Can I just punch it? What if I just punch it? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Because of my 21 strength. Four gold! I wasted two lockpicking things on four fucking gold. Larian! Larian, why? Oh, this will be fun as a rogue, actually. I'm the same height! I'm the same height, dude! Oh, man. You can't... Go on. <laughs> Look Take at my mustache. Way. You can't get this Lucky. past me. Uh, nice. I never learned names or anything. Just... Anyway, forget that. Take the ring. I want to show you how lucky it is. Come on. Nice. Advantage. Oh, he ate it. Weeping, bleeding hells. Okay, maybe you don't need extra luck. But simply... He <laughs> bends down, he has thing, it on his cock. <laughs> call it. Heads or tails? Ah, uh, oh, oh, well, I forgot we were talking to a kid. That's awkward. I was the same height. I legitimately forgot this was a child. Pocket the ring. Tails. See? I've got more where that I came feel like from. that goes... <laughs> I feel like that goes the same way. No matter what you do, you can drop the act. I, uh, I don't know what you mean. Um... Hey, that hurts. I'm running an honest... Uh-huh. Uh huh. And I promise, this isn't a Tinker's Trash Scam. Um... Look, I swear to you, these rings are the real deal. I promise, I'm... Last chance. I want to get these rings, stuff? actually, because... That's what I got. Uh... Okay, so... These rings are fucking great, look. Ring of being really invisible. <laughs> Ring of Lacensis, uh, infinite uh, ring of infinite wishes, and the uh, ring of resistance to ants. I love the ring of being really invisible. It's four gold. I'm buying it. I want the ring of being really invisible. It's it's too it's too adorable to not get. It stands on the dock and his ring of being really invisible. Oh. Look at my mustache. You can't get this past me. Because I have a wizard mustache. Oh. You suddenly oh. feel something moving against your back and turn. One of the big kids. That's How? a girl, by the way. How did you catch me? Um, I love that there's these interactions like these as a rogue. This game is so good, dude. It's fucking massive, the amount of different interactions and shit. I can't even... I feel like if I looked at all the coding behind all of this, and the, the you know, like, the logic lines and the coding and the amount of, like, trees that come off of just a single conversation, my head would fall off. Like, it's so impressive. Oh, okay. I guess I'll try harder not to get caught next time. Uh, did they actually lift money from you? Oh, I get a magic ring too. Fuck it. I'll use a magic ring of, a ring of being really invisible. Please. I don't, I don't care. Are you a goblin or just a really dripped out halfling? I am a gnome. I am Sans Underdark. The, the uh, deep gnome. Like a gnome, but really Let deep. My daughter go right now. She's a I wish it had an effects soul. like tricking the ogres. Yeah, that would be back. cool. I do love Let the ogre interaction through. though. Lumpy Enlightened I wish was a companion. If I could pick one character to be a companion, it would be Lumpy Enlightened. Just like a permanent companion that you have rela you can like romance and uh, I mean uh, develop their quest line and stuff. Uh, no. What can we even do here? I'm like... 
there's the kid and the kid fight, which we could do. Oh, I need these. I need these. Give me. Give me. Give me your gardening, lady. I need these. I'm just going to take these. Thank you. Okay, cool. Thanks. Can I pickpocket them? Oh, wait. I'm going to try and pass the check for the key. What is this key for, Shh, actually? I'm concentrating. Uh, but that's your dog. Nailed it. Is the... Yeah. Give me the key. What is the key for? Does anybody know? I've never actually bothered to check what the key is for. Hoppies? Oh, good idea. Yeah, we'll go get... We'll go get hoppies. 15 XP. We need all the XP we can get. The faster I level up, the better. 1700 XP. Fuck. It's so much to get. There's a chest. There's a chest on the arc above you, on the arch above you. What? Where? Here? That? What the fuck is in this? What? I've never seen that. Dude, this game always has new shit, I swear. Ain't no way. I've never noticed that. Please tell me I'm not the only one who didn't notice that. Shit, how do I get up there? Um... I don't have, like, a spell of jumping. Uh, shit, how do I get up there? Oh. Oh, wait. No, because I can't interact when I'm on the, on the lift. Oh, wait, I can... Okay, maybe we'll try the lift. Hold on. Because I can't move right now. Yeah, look, there we go. No, come on! Feather fall from the top of the elevator? Ooh. Maybe we try that. Hold on. Hey, sub because of the full Halfling Mobs video. Great video. Thank you, my guy. Much appreciated. I, uh... I said it a few times. Wait, how long does this last? This isn't permanent right now. Okay. That other one has me on edge. And now, come on! No! God, we can almost make it. Can I go from here? I just gotta get around before it runs out. Go, 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 go! Maybe you can survive the fall. I can with the um, feather fall. Oh, it's gotta be from here, right? Yes! Woo! It wasn't worth it. God damn it. And then we can jump down and do a hero landing in front of this, this <laughs> fucking dude. Sweet. Drow poison is always good. Drow poison is actually worth it. Being able to knock people out is insane. Uh, and then grease is always good. Basic poison. I'm good on that. Uh, actually, you know what? That was worth it. That was like a couple hundred gold right there. All right. Hoppy time. Should we go get hoppies? General hoppies? Don't I have to pass like a crazy wisdom check? Otherwise they enslave me. Like, you know, I start running towards their singing. Is someone uh. singing? I'll probably grab this as a birthday gift to myself then. I was hyped as fuck, but thought I needed to build a 2K machine to play it. It's actually not... If Larian, despite the size of this and scope of this game, they've done a pretty good job of uh, optimizing it because they're an actual good games company. So they've actually bothered to optimize their game uh, despite its unbelievable size. Uh, the later half of the game, it gets a little bit um, harder to run because Baldur's Gate is so huge. And, you know, some of the later locations, you know, are, are so grandiose and incredibly designed. Are you going to drink your stre strength potion? I already have um, Elixir of Giant Strength until long rest. So until I decide to... I haven't even done a short rest yet. And we've already made it to this point and we're level 3. Like, we're already killing it. If I 
And I, I'm also a rogue, so I don't need short rests. So I'm probably not going to use one unless I'm absolutely in need of it somehow, which I don't think I will be. I don't know why I would ever use a short rest on this guy. All right. Shit, how do we do this? Maybe if I bomb them? Shit. How, fuck, how do we even... How do we even approach this fight? Greece isn't worth it, right? Maybe if I just grease the whole area, the whole region in Greece. Let's see what happens. All right. Region has been greased. Uh, no grease at the bottom, unfortunately. That's good. Maybe that'll help. Maybe they'll just jump straight out of it by flying. Um, I might have just wasted that. Fuck, how do we even... Throwing maybe a void bulb. I can't do stealth because they don't show up yet. As flyers, they ignore grease. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. A short rest to your gnome is just a regular rest that'll go. <laughs> Stop making that joke. Stop height shaving, my boy. They will just fly. Yeah. Will a flame arrow do something? Maybe. Uh. I don't know, man. This is a rough one. Maybe if I throw some... I was going to save the holy water for undead. Because it does fucking tons of damage to undead and fiends. Ooh, oh, arrow darkness could be good. I don't know, man. This is a rough one. This is a really, really hot fight. All right, how about... I'm just going to probe. And we'll do an alchemist flask, like here. And then go back into stealth. Ain't no fucking way they're ignoring this. What's happening? Do I have to discover the what? Please. Can I sneak around them then? Or will they just automatically discover me if I go into this region? I need the high ground is the problem. How the fuck do I get them out? Kill one, turn bait. Turn base that no one uh, They're further down. I know they're further. No, there's one here. There's one here on this section. And then there's one at the bottom who's initially doing the singing. They're ever. They're all over this section. Fuck. I lit the grease on fire too. So I've literally just wasted two items. Lower. There's three. There's three of them, dude. The music in this fight is great. I mean, it's it's them singing, but I agree. Uh, they're like there I'm pretty sure There's one here, one there And then one at the top here I Do I just bite the bullet and go down there then? I need to spawn them by talking to the kid Oh man That's not true though I hope that's not true Ah, oh, fuck. Ah, oh, fuck, dude. All right, kid. I, can I just? I look like I'm. I look like a child. Listen. Can I just say I? I love this game. I love Larian. I love everything they do. I love everything about them. I love everything about this game. Why did they not get kids to voice kids? And why are like 99% of the kids voiced by women? that are trying to do a child's voice, but sounding really emphatic and well-spoken. Is it just kind of take it out of out of you, out of the moment for anyone else? It's something I like, like I have nieces and nephews and shit. Cause kids can't act. Yeah, but they don't need to act. They're kids. They're kids in a video game. They should sound like real kids. Literally shorter than a kid. It's the perspective. Uh, don't all right. You hear it? It's so peaceful. Kids can't act. Why do they need to act? Most kid voice actors are women. I know that. I don't care because it's, it, it is child labor. I guess. I guess kids... Kids could be like, yeah, I'd like to be in this video game. Kids like video games. There's no way you can't convince kids to voice kids in a video game. There's no way. Maybe there's like, I don't know, rules about it. Uh, who fucking knows, dude? It still takes me out of it, though. Can I pick bucket the kid? <laughs> what? No he fucking way. The child's stone pouch as he stumbles deeper into the water. Oblivious. 
<laughs> I can't believe I just did that. What the fuck? Yeah. I just robbed Everything the child and it's fine. probably about to die. I, get I just robbed a, 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 an about to be dead kid. Yeah, look, see, there's one here, one here, one there, like I said. One on each platform and then there's one here too. That's what I was trying to get. All right, it's me first. I might just bail on the kid and kite these things. What do you guys think? I can't get a sneak attack or any kind of like bonus and I have huge disadvantage when firing from below. Oh shit, I have all these abilities now. Uh, bonus actions together, stealth actions together. Fuck. Some of these are bad anyway. Oh my god, my damage is such dick. What even? All right, there we go. Um, <laughs> fuck. How do I do this? What if I just kill the kid and then bail? Because then there's nobody to be charmed. So it's problem solved. Um. How do we... Alright. I'm um, bailing on the kid. Alright, here we go. We're going to dash. I'm going to bail on the kid. Get way over here. And then I survive and he doesn't. And I'm going to hide and see what happens. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, God. Ah, oh, Jesus. Karma. Eh, there's no karma in this game. We're fine. <laughs> We're absolutely fine. Plus, I can stay hidden so I can keep using dash to get double movement. I get myself into a better position to, to, start, to keep fighting. I got 15 XP for some reason. They don't know where I am. Do they know where I am? Oh, what? Hey, missile snare. Get fucked. Wait, I gotta I got turn off the ask for that. There's no reason not to ask. I know it takes your reaction, but it's worth it. Shit, they saw me? How did they see me? Did Dash knock me out of it a second time? Go on, do your range attack. It will do nothing. I'm impervious to your range attacks. <gasps> Fuck! How'd that ha- what? Because it's not a projectile or something? What was that? Okay. Um. Shit, dude. Shit, dude. What are these guys? They're monstrosities. Okay, that doesn't help me. Can I have advantage? No. Uh, all right, here, here's the plan. Fire arrow. In the mouth. Hit him. They resisted it. That sucks, but whatever. And then we bonus action. That, then it's almost dead. And then we cunning dash. And we keep getting further away. And we just keep kiting them. They, they'll just keep flying and throwing shit at us. Fuck, man! Why are they so strong? Yeah, oh my god, the movement range, dude. Wait, they're being pulled in. Am I pulling people into the fight? Oh, do not hit me. Dude, they're getting ahead of me. That's crazy. No! 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 Fuck. Ah, shit, dude. Oh, this is really bad. They're gonna kill Sans Underdog. Is she gonna keep singing and doing nothing? Bro, look at all these people I'm pulling in. That's great. Nice. Now I'm gonna have help. All right, I resisted the song. I'm gonna chuck my lodge potion. I get sneak. No. Uh, no sneaking around here. Where's the one on low health? All right, there, there it is. Bam. Come on, die, 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 die. Ah, fuck. Oh, with the double hits, dude. Shit. I wish it would stop turning on dual wield. Nice! Nice, dude! Oh, they're all getting lured! No way! Oh my god! Oh, shit! They're all getting lured! Oh, fuck! Oh no, I've doomed the whole colony! They're all being killed by herpes! Solo? Hey, you know what? This is the first fight that I've taken any help with. And it's a difficult one, okay? Wait, did that one die? No. I could take one of the gods, maybe 
All right. Offhand action. Fuck off, dude. All right, one down. 20 XP. That is not a lot of XP, actually. You know what? Um... I'm just gonna fucking hit and run. God damn it! My luck with these is terrible. Oh my god, they're all getting lured. This is crazy. I gotta, I gotta interrupt the one. Oh my god, Volo's going stealth. <laughs> it's just going so bad. Goblin raid, no hoppy raid. This is how all of the druids grow. Got harp, got herpes. Oh my god, I'm getting all of these fucking civilians killed. <laughs> oh god. Hey, he resisted it. Nice. Get him, bear. I really want to do a playthrough with a wild-shaped druid. I haven't done it yet. I haven't done it since uh, yeah, yeah. being in your form fucked up your campaign. But I think the next thing that I play is going to be uh, a druid. A uh, wild-shaped druid. What the fuck hit me? When did I take damage? Did another one die? Oh, it's over here. Right. I'm going to try and knock it out of concentration. Here we go. Nice. Oh, shit. All right, good stuff, good stuff. All right, you guys deal with it. <laughs> nice, nice. Good teamwork, good teamwork. Good stuff, good stuff. What difficulty is this? Uh, normal difficulty, like regular. I would do it on Tactician, but because I'm playing it solo, um, I think it will it'll just make it unnecessarily difficult. I've never seen this lady do anything. Like, apparently she ends up in Baldur's Gate or something. She's like a, a you know, uh... Oh, get fucked. What does this one do if you kill them all? Does he just knock you out of combat? Kill them for Sans Underdog. They're <laughs> beating this... No, I'll be to death. Oh man, they're blocking the way. All right, finish him off. Oh, come on, dude. What's my hit chance on these things? This is so bad. Nice. Carrying. Ah, oh, really? All right, whatever. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. What happens when they get lured? Like, they just walk over? Because, like, in my thing, the whole demographic of this, or the whole point of this, is they lure you, and then the ones that aren't luring are the ones that attack you while you're being lured, because you can't attack, right? Which is what makes this fight so difficult. Of course I but join then, as you were getting bystanders killed. I can't believe that playing, that the playing to voice is so much better, dude. That's crazy. I'm always getting bystanders killed. Oh, look, it's Okoy House Baldur. Baldur's Gate is amazing, dude. Go play it. Like, it's worth full price. It's one of the two games that I can wholeheartedly say are completely worth the amount of money that they're being uh, charged for. <laughs> At full Steam price, even. Which is wild. My laptop runs Total War 3 decently. Should I buy... Should I run BG3 good enough? Yes! You can always turn the settings down. This game will still look amazing, even if it's on low settings. You're fine. Die, herpes, die! Nice. Not nice. What the fu- What do you mean movement out? Nice. Nice, dude. We did it. I mean, I did it. Alright, let's go finish off that last one. I feel like this might be a waste of time. I feel I think you got a ring of color spray and some bullshit, and also the child is already dead. So I can't even benefit from the dead from the, the living child. Some idiot was running to the beach lol. Dude, one guy comes down here and just fucking power bombs the, the hoppy. Ain't no way I get lured. Fuck. I saved. Nice. This one have more health. Nah. 30%? Can 
Can I just... Where's their sight cone? They don't have one? They're just singing? That's gotta be in their sight cone. Your hop. Go on, keep singing. If I save it, you're screwed. Oh, shit. Oh, what? Nice. Oh, you're doomed. You're doomed. I have so much jumping speed. Die, vile woman. No, 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 no. Of course, no, no. you're giving innocent people herpes. <laughs> oh, thanks for the dono, Brandon. Dude, I'm so happy that they, they fixed that plankton voice. It actually sounds so good now. Just for clarification, that voice for Plankton used to sound... Oh my god. Really? I'm really gonna take 8 damage over that? <laughs> that never gets old. Fucking wanton bombing them off of the top rope. There's, there isn't a better way to kill an enemy in this game. And launching well unless you do that and throw another person to another person they both die that's like ultimate satisfaction you see how my little guy swung them around this is why it's good to have a lot of health potions for this exact thing you can also listen to your guys calm noise have a crowbar named wizard staff comes with the spells open locked doors and dismantle car built at <laughs> built in an okoy. It would be good to have um, some magic shake to make up for the fact that we have like no magical knowledge. I guess we'll just use color spray instead of the magic ring and I'll keep the ring of being really invisible because it's funny. And the rest of this is eh. What's a good what's the best way to get XP guys? What's the best way for me to get XP right now? I don't call it BG3 stream, let's go. I mean... Uh, I'm glad you're enjoying it. Thanks for watching. I, I was worried people were gonna be like, you're not streaming Warhammer 3? What the fuck? And then I would have to be like, oh shit, I forgot to loot these gloves the whole time. Damn, I'm really... Oh, I don't need them anyway. Duh. I got the better gloves. Whatever, I can sell them. Ooh, guidance necklace would be cool. Shit, dude. Fuck. All right, I'm gonna get the guidance necklace. That is huge. Circle of siege settlement to get XP to level forty. <laughs> That's not a bad idea. Go to the Albat Cave and kill the absolute followers. Is that? Does that give you a lot of XP? Warhammer 3 is hated now. I think uh, it's just that CA's marketing department is hated. I don't hate Warhammer 3. I just don't like CA's marketing department, you know? I don't even dislike CA as a whole. You can't keep uh, hold them all to blame for the actions of a few kind of thing. Like, I guarantee the guys making the DLCs aren't happy with how much they're charging for the DLCs. Will you help Tieflings or the Goblings? Uh, I'm not sure. I'll probably leave it up to a, a chat vote, but my guess is that it, they'll probably say, um, uh, goblins, because goblins are cool. Ah, another potion of slow fall. Oh, wait. Nice. There's one. One for the collection. Shit, have I been forgetting to pick up oil barrels, by the way? I feel like I've missed some. I got the most of them for the, uh, the Hoffling video from the Zentarium outposts. At the back of the and, uh, that little room in the goblin camp. Folded in the chitinous squabbling of spiders. A shiny gold coin pokes from its mouth. Fuck! I use inspiration for that. Yeah, I'm gonna use my inspiration point. The creatures clutch the pouch possessively. Oh, you have no hand. Easy, easy a clap. Fuck! Within. I'm gonna get bit. Oh god damn it, dude! The Pencils milk did nothing. Ow! Dude, come on! 
the back of the crevice lies a bag. Let me try again. God damn it. Wobbling of spiders. He my spiders. stupid he little body. He my character's stupid little ass. Nice spider sack egg. That is huge. If anybody doesn't know what the spider sack egg does, uh, you can throw it and spiders come out, and it's very useful. And then you get little spider homies for a little while. Which is amazing. Alright, soul coins, amulet, quest items in general. Good shit. Um, I don't think you need the magic ring for anything. But, I'll take it anyway. Not sell it. Might as well get some out of it. Alright, now we should have the guidance cantrip. Whenever we need it, for whatever we want it for. And color spray, which I'm probably not going to use. It's kind of a waste of an action. Wait, does the cantrip not show up? Is it just a, uh... No, it's there. Whatever. I only need it for dialogue. How'd you change your dice, Sadokoi? Uh, when you, when the dice option pops up, a little option in the bottom left will, will show up. And you can change it. And those are the Larian dice. I'm, I was hoping that there would be more dice later on, but there, there isn't any. A purple twitch uh, dice seemed like the obvious choice to me, but they added in like a little purple outfit. Damn, dude, you're playing and, you, and having so much fun. You basically sold me on the game. I mean, literally, I don't. I wouldn't advertise the game unless I enjoyed it. Like, even if I do a sponsored video, I always I have to play the video, the, the game first to see if I enjoy the game. Even with, like, shit that other people don't enjoy. As long as I enjoy it, I don't give a fuck. There's, always, there's already a lot of DLC mods, though. Oh, downloadable content mods? I guess. That doesn't really count. Some mods are great, though. I'm waiting on a really good one. Actually, I'll fucking advertise this because I'm hyped for it. Look, it's, it's called, uh... Fantastical Multiverse, right? So it adds in, like, playable Minotaurs. And all these different races and shit and also hold on bugbears also goblins and also fish people you can play as fish you can literally play as a fish guy and i want to play it so bad imagine a fish playthrough also somebody made a uh, sub mod for it where you can play as an ogre so that also might be the way that I, I shoehorn ogres into this game. Playable ogres, I mean. Who don't want to play as a playable fish? Boal, exactly. Ogre rogue? Dude, imagine an ogre rogue. <laughs> you have like a negative fucking 10 to dexterity. To keep ourselves entertained. He's boring. Watch how you go. There's a trap. Ooh, is it a waste if I put one behind this tracker and shoot shoot it? Actually, I don't want to destroy all these barrels. They're really, really good. Fun when he was screaming. Oh, I don't want to throw that. Oh my god, look how big it is on my guy. <laughs> oh, playing a gnome's fun, dude. Are we gonna collect these? Okay, I'm not gonna bother with that yet. I want to go through these. Shove this man. I guess I could. What if I pick him up and throw him instead? Into another goblin. I still have 21 strength, so I might as well make use of it while I can. I'm gonna skin you. There's a water barrel here. Man, I wish goblins were playable. They're such cool little guys. Alright, uh, Potion of Mind Reading is- wait, that- those are for long rest, right? Detect thoughts? That's the same thing. Yeah, I'm- I'm keeping this with my elixirs so I can use it. Also, I'm gonna get rid of this elixir of fire resistance because I feel like I can get better. I'll- I'll have bloodlust by the time- By the time I can use- I- I, I would need to use a fire resistance potion, I'll have bloodlust potions and shit. Alright. I'm gonna power bomb this guy. Into this one. Advantage. Let's go. No sign of the <laughs> Ain't no fucking way. Oh, I thought I stealthed it. 
Damn, I thought I stealthed it, dude. Oh, I really thought I got away with that. Oh, he wasn't in combat? Shit. Oh, he died. They actually died. Nice. And the pan to dialogue, yeah. That's pretty funny. Uh, Alright, I have no major actions. I'm just gonna have to use a bonus action and then go stealth. So, finish off this person, maybe? Nice. And then I'm gonna, instead of doing an action, I'm gonna fucking hide. So they can't shoot me. Ain't no running from me. Arrest them. Apparently, there is running from you, moron. Hiding successful. Let's go. And then we shoot this guy a couple times in the mouth. We kill him. And then I just go right back over here. And then if he runs his way up here, I'm going to throw a box at him. No way. What? Right. You're done, little man. You're done. Take this box. <laughs> I don't even need to be a barbarian. I just have unlimited strength with my tiny body. Uh, shit. Ugh, I don't want to get shot by that thing, though. Gold. That never gets old. It never, ever, ever gets old. Ever. I'm t I'm t from first-hand experience of being in, in the beginning of Act 2 on a barbarian, um, it never gets old. Ever. Throwing shit at people to kill them or throwing dudes at other dudes to kill them is always fun. I, I wish the goblin... shallow. His wound... I just got inspiration! <laughs> Why did I get inspiration for that? The fuck? My guy's a little fucking goddamn rat. I can't believe I got inspiration for that. Can I get inspiration for this? <laughs> no evidence. Dispose of the evidence. Oh, man. We're definitely being a bad guy. Criminal background moment. Oh, that makes sense. What does the tab say? Oh, yeah. Um, murder an innocent civilian. <laughs> I was inspired by that. Wow. All right, let's disarm this thingy with our amazing sleight of hand. Nailed it. Uh, we don't have the key, but that's fine. I'll just lockpick it because we've got amazing dexterity. Shit. But that's fine because it's a lockpick, so I can just try again. Shit. But it's fine because I can just try again. But it's fine! I can just try again! Why is this happening? God, I'm gonna go through all my fucking things. Oh my god. It's not even worth it. It's 14 gold, the trap arm disarm kit. A oh, okay, the staff's worth 400 gold. Okay, it is worth it. Never mind. I can buy, like, a bunch back for that. That's fine. I think I need the Key of the Ancients if I'm going evil. All the shit we could sell, we're good. Alright. I kind of want uh, to wanna fast track the Zentarium hideout. Because I want to work with them. So maybe we go push the Null fight. And, like, abuse the crap out of the Null fight. Or we do the, uh, Owls. Maybe Owls. What do you guys think? Albert okay, Cave or uh, not Albert or okay, Albert Cave or Knowles or Albert Ca Cave then Knowles? I I don't know. Elokoi, you know you can extend your action bar by pressing the plus next to the chest. Yeah, I know. I don't like it. Covers most of the screen. I hate it. I don't like it. I know about it though. Yeah. Wait, what the fuck? Why is this here? Eh. Albert, We'll do Knolls after. Knolls are a lot of XP. That's true, that's true. You missed stuff down by the water when you threw the halfling. I did? Oh, yeah, it's just a key. It's just a key for that chest. That's it. <coughs> I know what it is. 
<laughs> I, I don't think he's conscious. C can you hear us, Ed? You, not just <laughs> <outside. laughs> the way my guy walked in the frame. Symbol glows marked on their flesh, and something within you stirs in response. Hey, baby, you want to see my underdark? Why is that not an option? Nice. I'm so so sorry. The shiver uh, won't be injured man locks eyes with you. The parasite right Hold the stair. Protect them. He's with the absolute now. Do you yep. have orders for us? Yep. We were reporting to Edwin. You think you'll be able to beat the three dudes in the blighted village? You mean the ogres? Because I probably won't be killing them. I could probably beat them pretty easily. If you just like remove line of sight and they have no way of throwing stuff at you, you can just infinitely shoot them. So yeah, probably. And I could use it to get that intellect crown. But I probably want the movement hat, so I'll probably just get the horn and then I can call them if I really need them and I'm fucked. Also, I love ogres. They're, they're friends. Ogres are friends, not food. Have the ogres kill the gnolls? Nah, I'll probably try and convince them if I fuck up the dialogue option, it'll be useful for fighting like a major, major fight. Um. But I told uh, Edward yep, 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 yep. not to work in that cave. It was filthy You need to find the beast and avenge your brother. What? It's killed your right. The cave is I like how he's got a little bit of rationality I'm left so in his brain and he's like, Oh, I definitely want this. Yes, welcome to Temple's Influence. As they need to. I want all the parasites. I would like all the parasites. Can I use the, Isn't that one of these as a weapon? You can use a uh, pork sausage as a weapon. I totally forgot to do it on my on my run. It's not a finesse weapon though, so. You should go. You should do a playthrough where you can only chuck people or use them as a weapon. That'd be a good challenge run. A barbarian, but I can only throw people and uh, throw people or items and then I can build around that. That's actually really strong though. You don't even understand. A, a barbarian throwing build is actually incredibly strong. Like really, really strong. Uh, it's kind of meta. The guy lying on the floor wasn't killed by Okar or the four halfling barbarians, Piggy promise. <laughs> okay, call me mad, but what if the Warhammer universe and the Baldur's Gate universe combine after the events of the game of this game's course? That is wild. But that would be cool. I would love this game in a Warhammer uh, format, you know? Like this this type of game, like a D&D style, top-down, Divinity Original Sin 2 type thing, but, but Warhammer Fantasy, that'd be cool. Are you going to take the fighter levels for an extra action or go pure rogue? I'm going to take one level of fighter so that I can get better. So like, my weapons do 16, 11, and 1, and 6, and 4, 9, and 4, and 9. What? Why does the offhand do 4, and 9? Because they're light? Can we do a bit of another light weapon? Why do the crossbows do the same amount of damage? Is that a hand crossbow thing? Do I not need the fighter perk to get the to get the full damage of an offhand? Is this the same? Hold on. I might not need to put a, a, a point in a fighter if I'm going mostly hand crossbows. Must be a bug. Nah, it's four to nine. Because it's a crossbow, they deal the same damage even when used in an offhand. Crossbow tends to be done for this. Ah. Light weapons should be dual wielded without penalty. So why are these not then? These are also light. How long did it take the, the halflings to commit genocide on the grove? Uh, we didn't kill those guys. Uh, the... Uh, <laughs> so in the, the halfling video we um i was intending on joining the absolute faction and raiding the uh the druid grove right but then we we did the whole um cargo quest line and killed uh but then when we no no sorry when we confronted them and the little kid i took the dialogue options that i hadn't taken before and so kaga just ordered all of the druids to just kill everyone Fuck! Can I not open this chest then? Do I just miss out on the necklace? Damn it, dude. Nice. Potion of animal speaking. I can put that with the mind reading one, and then I can get mind reading. Mind reading the ability to speak to animals and 21 strength on my next long rest. 
which will be in, in a long ass time. I don't care, you dark or custom. I went custom specifically so I could have uh, proficiencies in persuasion. So I can have like crazy sleight of hand, crazy stealth, and crazy persuasion. So I'm not completely just stuck doing the dialogue. Uh, getting absolutely fucked in dialogue, but being good at stealth. Wait, what is looking at me here? Oh, that's oh, the baby. Ooh. Ooh. I don't like it. Oh, fuck. All right, go. No. Okay. Hold on. I'm going to quick save here. I'm going to go. Wait, hold on. No, fuck. The quake of its heavy. No, I'm so tiny. What's this? Why does it teleport me there? You before I feed you to my son. Soft meat. Uh, it's a splinter. Well, I've got a bigger threat than you uh, with worse. Oh, okay. I'm gonna go with the intimidation one because it's funnier. Oh fuck! I actually, I actually succeeded. Brave. You can go. Nice. Wait, what if I walk over to these guys? Are they gonna go fight it? All right. Can I can I push them into fighting it? Making it angry. Uh, just hold steady. Go. Get it. Get it. What? They're not even doing it. Do I have to engage the fight? Is it because I engaged it first? I want to see what happens if I if I drop a, a fractious stalactite on it. Fuck! Damn it. All right. I still have the opportunity. It's fine. This ain't no way I'm breaking that. 24 fucking HP though. Did they fuck that up? It's like resistant to like all damage except blunt. Except for bludgeoning. Can I throw something at it? Like, uh, I don't know. Shovel? I don't have anything blunt to throw at it. That's not going to do like no damage. All right. Just, it's distraction egg time. Get them, my spiders! Adokai, you can read the book near the chest, open it after the fight. Adokai, you're gonna get Abyss Gloves in the Thief Hideout near the Burning Mansion. Abyss Gloves? What are they? What are Abyss Gloves? Wait, they did Command Hold on it? Yo! No, a little bit. Little, no, I'm def. I'm not killing the Albert Cub. There ain't 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 no way. Get it, fight it. All right, I'm gonna <laughs> keep. Do I just keep chipping away at the stalactite like this? And I do like no damage, dude. Fuck it. I get that high ground bonus. What gloves? Abyss gloves. In the thieves hideout near the burning mansion. Are you talking about the ones that like buff your companions? Or your summons or some shit? Cause that didn't seem very good to me. Holy shit, are these absolute guys gonna actually survive? Damn, these spiders suck at this. Um, nice. Yeah. Nice. Dude, chipping away. I'm telling you, dual hand cross was where it's at. Did you already complete the game? Um, no. I haven't even completed it on my, my single player playthrough. Not my spiders! Ooh. No! Oh. <laughs> it's coming for me? <laughs> what did you do? I shot you a bunch. Dude, imagine it just like absolutely nails the owlbear cub. I think there's, there's genuinely two kinds of people in this game though. 
There's the people that do everything they can to save and get the Albert Cub as like a pet. And then there are serial killers in real life. How can you not? It's so cute. The cub looks from you to his Oh, no, it's so sad. What? A single strike. Uh, all right, let the creature live. Watch, speak. All right. Perhaps it'll live. Big XP, big XP. How much XP do we actually get for that? A couple hundred? Use the baby as an improvised weapon? Absolutely not. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, those spiders scared the shit out of me. Oh my god, they look so big compared to my gnome. Oh, uh, we don't have proficiency. By the way, can I just say, this is like the worst chess piece I've ever seen for most of the game. Like, there's way more beasts than there is Undead, especially in chapter one. It's, and then by chapter two, this is already obsolete. It's so, it should be the other way around. Like, you take more damage against Undead, <clears throat> but, but you know, you know what I mean. Uh, okay, mom killer, what? I don't give a shit. I gave him food, what do you mean? Wait, shit, doesn't he have the other half of the, of the spear? We survived. Um, sir, what now? Um. Uh. Right. Thank you. Tr I kind of want to kill him to get the other half of the spear for money, but I, I've never. These guys have never lived before. They always die for me. These fucking spiders, dude. Am I allowed to keep the spiders or do I have to get rid of them because it's a solo playthrough? <laughs> uh, a solo room, what do you guys think? They're technically not a companion, but this does make it not a solo playthrough. Spiders are allowed. They're pets? Yeah. I think temporary summons should be chill. Their path thing is goddamn terrible anyway, so they'll pro I'll probably lose them pretty quick. There's one. There's one already. Oh, no, it got up. Also, I, I hope I still have these spiders if, if I go fight the giant void spider, because you can kill the void spider pretty easily with some explosive barrels and shit. Is why I intend on doing. All right, it's time to go to the Null Camp. Wait, should we just kill Kalak and get that get get a free sword and a bunch of loot from that thing? Bunch of free XP. We can kill Kalak. People will get really mad. It'll be kind of funny. I told you to go. <laughs> Fine, I'll leave her alone. Do not kill Kalak. Not the good girl. Yeah, my girlfriend came in and said, don't kill Kalak. <laughs> Kalak is best girl. Power Druids in BG3. Pretty fun. I mean, I play, I, okay, here's the thing. I want to see if people agree with this because I was so disappointed. You know, when you're, spoilers for anybody, maybe you don't listen. Uh, so, sort of spoilers, like act one spoilers. Death in your so at the beginning of, um, words. At the beginning of uh, the Underdog or whatever, like it, when you get to the Underdog, injured. basically you find this guy called Glut, the Sovereign, the Sovereign Glut or whatever. Just and he has an ability to possess monstrosities again. with uh, mushrooms, and they become like, uh, pet, like they become like followers until long rest, right? So, I thought that's the ability that you would get as a Spore Druid, but that's not the case. You get, you just, it's like a shitty version of. Um, Raise undead for the for the what what I do? It's like a shitty version of wait you didn't invite Scratch to I don't eh. it's fine. We have plenty of people at camp. I don't want more companions. Raise undead is already bad. Yeah, exactly. Like raise undead is underwhelming. I thought it was gonna be like you can raise up any NPC as like a dead NPC with like limited abilities which would be super cool but you just get generic zombies or generic range zombies what do you guys think kill Kalak or no
I'm putting up to a vote. <laughs> I'm putting up to a vote. <laughs> oh my god, this is gonna be such a skewed. <laughs> the simps. The simps are fighting for the nose. Not best girl. I'm sorry, but Minthara is best girl. She's evil as shit and has way more depth of character than any of the other characters. Except for maybe Gale or Astarion, I guess. Scratch. It's war. This is pretty close, but 9% is going to carry Kalak to her death, guys. Okay, the cave statue? What cave statue? The chest? I can't do the chest. I need to discover the uh, the note behind the statue and then read that note. And okay, push her into the deep? Oh, that would be so funny. Yes. All right. <laughs> the simps are about to be molding. Oh, fuck me. Okay. okay. What's your name? Wait, can I not the fight her? Yappy little dog, she's sick. Kill some fiends. What? Victor Parasite and take Faerun by the short hairs. Sound good? But I can. <laughs> no! <laughs> Come on. Come on! <laughs> Wait. <laughs> no! <laughs> fuck! No! 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 Oh, fuck! Ah! Nice try, lady. Why the fuck? Can I not pull push her? Oh, that sucks, dude. What? That sucks so much ass. I'm disappointed you. Hey, you know what? The people have spoken. <laughs> if you kill Kalak, you have to kill Minthara too, you fucking Minthara simp. <laughs> okay, I'll probably be killing everybody in my defense. I just want more loot. I can't take anybody as a companion anyway. I'll be either looting them or killing them. Sans Underdark is no simp. Sans Underdark is incredibly gay. <laughs> Sans Underdark is asexual and wants no companionship. I should have taken away his wiener. That would have been a good plot point. That's why he wants no companions or any romance, because he just does, he just totally smooth down there like a like an egg. And okay, it has to be the blue line push. Red lines mean there's something in the way. I, there's there was nothing in the way though. Is my point. Wienerless gnome with pure important rage. <laughs> Wienerless is such a good word. All right, I'm maybe gonna take this guy up on his offer and take his sword off him so he doesn't have a sword, and then I'm gonna blow him up with barrels. Hello, Anders, with your stupid Please. face and hair. Keep your distance. Um, who will attack you? Blah blah blah. What is this devil? Okay, very well. I'll bring you her head. Cool. All right. And also, I'm gonna loot your basement. Uh, salami club, salami lid. Oh, it's fucking light. Ah, oh, light doesn't mean f dude. I always confuse light with finesse. Dude, I got so hyped for a second there. I was about to like wield the salami. Ah, oh, dude, I was so close to salami wielding. Where did I get gruel? Look at that salami. It doesn't do much less damage. It doesn't scale with my decks though, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter that it doesn't scale with my decks. Wait, yeah, it does. It's not martial, so it just does less damage. Damn it! You have more strength than decks? Yeah, but that's only because... <laughs> that's only because of my hill giant strength. But also, it's not a martial weapon, so it does less damage, look. 
though. It still just says six to nine. Whatever, I'll wield it for style. We'll, we'll wield a salami for style. Oops. Wait. Ah, I got damn it. I can't stealth attack unless I have a finesse weapon, so I can't salami. Damn it. Surely I can get a better weapon down here. I still, I'm still wielding short swords and stuff. Ew, I'll take padded armor over the other stuff. Eh. Yeah. The salami lead. Offhand salami. I could offhand salami. Uh, I've already sent it to camp. Wait, there's gotta be more salami in here. Shit. I sent the only wieldable salami to my camp. We're gonna have a field day with that now. Don't some of these have like crazy rush in them? Yeah. Look at all that stuff. Make sure you loot this place fully, cause like... It's nuts how much good shit is down here. Oh fuck, do I not have the toll house key? What? Did I not wield, get the toll house key? Can I just punch my way through this again? Damn it. I don't have to waste lockpicks on this. Lockpicking impossible. Damn it. I gotta get the stupid key. Shit, dog. Isn't it on this guy? Do you have to like discover the key? When you kill Kalak, just her from a distance, let her run over then push her. Alright, we'll try that. Did I not take the key? Where the fuck is the key? Is it down here? Oh my god, it's right there. Stupid. It might open the toll house vault. It does. That's exactly what it does. Wood door weak to fire? I don't have any fire. <laughs> well, how am I gonna fire? Oh shit, wait, this lady might have some good stuff. Need any supplies? Yes. Fewer mouths to feed. Uh the healing potion's always good. Uh, shit, I gotta remember to sell first. God damn it, do they ever have sufficient stuff? Um, maybe some thieves tools to replace the shit that I lost. All this is kind of bad. Power of darkness is good. Mirror image could be good. Tech vault's bad. Uh, that's fine. Nice. All right. I don't know. More streams coming up? Yeah, yeah hopefully. I mean, I, I, part two of this could be pretty fun, especially with how good it's going. God, they really don't like my spiders, huh? I'm not huge on spiders as well, to be honest. Be cautious. Uh, nice. Big money, big money. Which ones of these have shit in? Purple dye. Ooh. Should I dye my jacket purple to see what it looks like? I kind of like the McDonald's thing, but I'm going to dye my shoes purple. That did nothing. That did literally nothing. That made no difference. All right. Well, I'm going to dye my... Shirt. Ooh! All right. I'm packing heat under this outfit. I thought these had some valuable shit in them. Oh, whatever. Uh... Go. I think if you just don't set off the last bit, you're chill. Trap. Be 
just in case. Is these I don't trust these spiders not to set off the traps. Nice. Am I gonna perceive it? Nice. Crushed it. All right. Great X plus one. Uh, gold. Box. With wall pick. Oh, by the way. Oh, wait. It's gonna look normal on this guy. Look how little the. Oh, my God. So this. <laughs> so this looks like a, a, a normal wall pick, right? If you use the same wall pick on a uh, normal sized character, it looks ridiculous. But it actually looks totally fine <laughs> on him. <laughs> He's so small. It kind of undermines my point a little bit. The fact that it looks correctly sized on this guy should tell you how small it looks on a normal dude. We're rich. We've hit the big time. Bruh, we're rich. Let's get the fuck out of here. Time for some null killing. You can break wooden doors with swords, stone doors with blunt weapons, and loose stone bricks with the goat wild farm for druids. <laughs> what a weird example. Yeah, I know. I, I know they're all resistant to different types of damage and weak against others. Um, I usually carry around a bludgeoning weapon on my... Uh... All right. God, jeez. I always carry around a bludgeoning weapon on my fucking... Congrats on the uh, poor happily barbarian vid man. Hey, Colin. Thank you for the donut, my guy. Dude, much appreciated. Uh, th yeah, thanks, man. I never expected it to be this popular. It's actually insane how popular it is. It's already passed a million views in a couple of days. It got one point. It's got to be two million now on on Twitter, and like people like Jesse Cox were commenting on it and stuff. Like who I've been watching for like I used to, I, I used to watch him so much, like uh, when I was younger, like Cox and Crandor and stuff, like the the podcast and the animations and stuff. It's wild, man. The full ball video is fun. It was a lot of fun to make too. All right, you guys ready? Recall like death. Wait, maybe I could lay a trap. How do I lay a trap here for? Her? Trap could be funny. Ah, uh, whoops. Grease? I tell you what, I'm gonna grease it up. Like this. And then... How close do I have to get? Can I just start shooting her? Alright, I like that idea. And then... Just wing a good old shot at her. You guys ready for Kalak death? Yay! To fight. <laughs> I mean... It's not personal to Kalak. Also, did I fucking fail a hit? Fall, 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 fall. Shit! No! <laughs> oh, fuck. Um. Nice. Oh, fuck. Okay. Jump that. Jump that, idiot. Jump that, idiot. Um. Crap. 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 Shit. Crap. Uh. Ice isn't the point in that. I'll shoot her. Ooh. Fuck. Bye. My Don't you jump. Don't you jump. Yeah. Now you can't use an action. You're gonna, you're gonna run across the grease. Fall over. She didn't even do it. She didn't even move. Uh. Nice. Get ruined, lady. <laughs> Come on, try and run, run across the thing. Oh shit, she has a crossbow. Doesn't matter though. Your range attacks will do nothing against my grab, my gloves of grabbing. Man, if she don't stop chugging, are you kidding me? What is this, a Dark Souls duel? You're really gonna chug on me? Oh, she's screwed, dude. You're dead! I swear to God, if I slip on this stupid grease. Faint <laughs> oh, no! 
Like the memory of a storm. That face. Remove her head. Okay. Is this gonna be a strength roll or? Sorry, Kallax Simps. I can't even revive her now. We're past the point of no return. I'm sorry. The head comes free with a sickening. Oh, I'm covered punch. in blood now, dude. Nice. Scroll over the fight. Good, good. Uh, axe is worth a little bit. I can go sell that up at that place. Leather gloves, funny boots, barbarian clothes. Carlax infernal trousers. What's in the bag? Ooh! Oh my god, all very good stuff. Oil of accuracy, which kind of not really the see the point in that. A lot of these oils, I just, in my opinion, just aren't that good. I think oils, full oils like this, should give you oil on your weapons for like 50 turns or until short rest. That would make oils a lot better. If oils are, were until short rest, I think I would use them way more. Way more. Right now, I, I just kind of don't. That only me? Like, it just doesn't really use them. I use some of the more powerful poisons and stuff like that. Dude, look at my little boy jump. We got hops for days. Dude, oh my god. Can I jump up here? Ah, oh, never mind. Now I'm just gonna do a really stupid jump. Never mind. Anders, give me your sword. Uh, yep, here's her head. Am I gonna hold it up? <laughs> Thank you. As promised. <laughs> the fucking thud. Bed. Are you kidding me? Here. It's sacred. The this is the sacred blade. Oh. Okay, so speaking of sacred blades. <laughs> <laughs> no, what? Are you kidding me? Okay, what about you? What if, okay, follow my follow my spiders over here. Anders, Anders, I have spiders that you don't like. Come talk to my spiders. Anders, come here, bud. There you go. All right, now, now you say away, but also, wouldn't you like to see what it's like all the way down there? You sort of fight. <laughs> Oh, that worked great. I'm gonna destroy the ladder too. So like, oh, I can't. What? What is it resistant to? Weak to fire, resistant to pierce. That doesn't mean. Oh, because I don't have an action. All right, there we go. Okay, cut them off. I've cut off their reinforcements. And then I get into melee combat. Switch to melee weapons, and we're good. Yeah, you have to go around. You can't do anything. Ain't no way. <laughs> no! What's he gonna do? He doesn't have a sword. I have his sword. But like, what is he gonna do? No! Oh my god, are you kidding me? No fucking way. Dude. If she just runs around and fucking kites me the whole time, I'm gonna shit. I gotta go break her concentration with the spiders. If I didn't have the spiders, I'd be completely fucked. Wait, I still have movement range. Why did it... Hold on. There we go. And then... Dash. Okay, gotta get close. Damn, dude. Can I jump still? Yes, nice. Damn. She can't go anywhere now. F whole person spell. This is whole person is really strong. All right, she should get bitten out of it though. I hope. All right, let's see what happens. Yeah, skip my turn. She can't do anything. They're just she's gonna have to run all the way back around. 
This guy, <laughs> I thought he would die. I'm kind of disappointed he didn't instantly die from being thrown like 80 feet. Oh shit. Yes! Knock her out of concentration. Yes, it works so good. Shit, oh my God, all my spiders are kind of fucked up. Get bit, idiot. I'm gonna go down binding at least. Hopefully it was a, a, a scroll of whole person and not just whole person. Oh, the revenge that you're about to feel, lady. I can get advantage too. No! She's cheating. She's cheating. You saw it here first. Nice. Oh, how satisfying. Man, I got a piss. This is why solo play isn't great, because whole person... Yeah, there's a lot of um, things that in this game that are built for you to fight multiple people. You're supposed to be able to, like, help your teammates and shit like that. I understand why, that it's not, like, a super viable strategy. But, uh... Shut up, it's fun, dude. What? I would love a lone wolf perk, though, so I could at least do a, a two-player campaign. Effectively, you know, without being massively handicapped. You can still do it, and it's- you're still pretty- I just got four Revivify Scrolls back, dude. Oh my god, the amount of money that I'm gonna make off of that? Melf's Acid Arrow would be huge. Actually, that's pretty good for this level. 44 with a plus two, uh, 2d4 delayed. It's pretty insane. Oh shit, Scroll of Mirror Image could be good too. Just for defense. Whatever, I'll throw it on the on the block. How am I gonna? Uh, can I melt acid arrow the, them in the face? Whatever, buy my time. I reckon a warlock paladin one shot combo in two player room will be good. Me, uh, I'm doing a campaign with a friend of mine where I'm playing as a rogue, like very much like this build, like a dual weapon rogue, uh, with with one level and fighter, and then my friend is playing a paladin as a tank and a damage like you know, suck up. And it's really, really fucking strong. Like a crazy strong combo. Get bitten. Whatever. Time for Melf's Acid Arrow in your face, lady. 45% chance? What the fuck? That sucks. At least her AC will be down. Oh! Oh! <laughs> you are doomed, lady! Damn it! Do not shoot me. Do not shoot me. Do not shoot me. I hate you! Nice. Anders, okay, Anders is no joke. If you take his weapon- No! <laughs> I hate this guy, dude! Get out of here, you fucking dork. Alright, I gotta do something big here. Because they're getting close now. I don't like it. What do we even do? Darkness could be good, but then it's just going to prevent my way to range shot. I know. Grease. When in doubt, throw grease at things. Alright, you may have saved it this round, sir. Let's see what happens next time. Right, I'm going to aim for his cock specifically. There. Right in the cock. Dude, look at the damage from the cock shots. That's how you kill people. Come on, try and move. I dare you. Ah, uh, what? I like to imagine Okoye okay, talking his no his no talking to himself in game. <laughs> no, my spiders are dead. Oh, get fucked with the jumping. As long as this guy doesn't lay on hands himself again, I'm good. Um. Oh boy. Uh. Can I just? I not got advantage. Come on, whip some shots. More acid. Below her AC. Fuck. Yeah, even if I miss now. Damn it, dude. What? I'm running. For tactical reasons.
Wait, at Okoy, Asmund just did a vid on the Bob vid 25 minutes ago? No fucking way. Asmund did a vid on it? Asmund. No way. Ah, oh, dude! He did! Holy shit! What it's like to play Baldur's Gate 3. Did he watch the whole video? So is this a- Dude, what? No fucking way Asmund watched my shit? Hold on. Uh, let me fit to screen. Maybe I'll get claimed for this, but I'm, I want to see. an accurate representation of what it's like to play Baldur's Gate 3. You can just do anything you fucking want. People wanted me to watch this. Four halfling barbarians? It's just gonna- I'm gonna claim for my own video. I was about to walk into a pub. Isn't he just watching the whole video? This is like React content. Is it just the whole video? Fucking idiot. This is your wild. Wait, isn't she a main character and you just kill her? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh, he's never I remember played this the game, part was right. in the beta. I played this. This guy was an asshole. It's they're winning. Watching, wow. It's funny watching his perspective from somebody. He's never played the game. Aspen looks like a Githy Yankee. <laughs> oh my Ooh. god. I'm curious to see what he, how he reacts to the end bit. Oh shit. This is such meta content, dude. Me reacting to somebody reacting to watching my video. There was a misinput, misinput. Calm down! You calm, you the, calm fuck the fuck down! down. Approach the dying monster. This is. Oh my god. So is this an accurate representation of what it's like to play Baldur's Gate 3? You can just do anything you fucking want? Because this is actually kind of interesting to me. A hand? The end Ow. was cheated, wait. The end was cheated, right? There's no, there's, there's no way there's so many exploding barrels in the game. Most of it was oil barrels and exploding barrels and I used uh, wine barrels to connect them all so that the fire would spread. So there's actually only about 25 explosive barrels, mostly clustered around the main generals. And then uh, it's oil barrels to, that are nearby, and then wine barrels to connect it, and then a couple of oil flasks in between. Um, and then uh, the out... I had to do it in two parts. I did the outside of the goblin camp, and then the inside of the goblin camp. So it's because you can't connect them anyway, the explo so it's because it's in a different zone. That's, that's what I did. There's enough explosives in the game. I had like 80. There's more than enough. Perhaps I should have clarified. Hmm? A helping hand. Anyone? Ow. How long did Ooh. it take to set up? 17. It took about Ow. eight hours in total. Go on. In that didn't include gathering all the barrels though. I love how like the fat and short like Halfling <laughs> barbarians look like real people. I don't know what, what that's supposed to say. Oh. <laughs> he sees himself in Hello. this. Yeah, it's like I've seen okay. that guy. I think it's a more realistic body model than half the other dudes. He has a point. <laughs> I didn't think he'd upload a video of him watching my video. That's crazy, dude. I, I've watched a lot of Ad, uh, Asmund's oh my God. stuff. I think they're on my recommends all the time. There's me. Oh, maybe not. Maybe it's the other channel. I don't know. I think I watched it, Asmund highlights or some shit. I remember the I played this part too. Shit. 
Earth. Wait, did he? Has he played this yet? Fire. Has he actually played the game? Jesus. Wait. <laughs> Those were prisoners. <laughs> and he just killed them all. What? And you can do that in the game too? <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! No, only the beta? Dude, get him to play this. It's far lighter than it should be with such a massive <laughs> <f> <laughs> What? <laughs> He's what? so befuddled by all these edits. <laughs> oh my... This is the stupidest fucking thing I've ever seen. <laughs> oh, I watched this. There's a real guy in there, right? No, it's this guy. I think I played this, didn't I? <laughs> Three years ago, yeah. You will join me. That's a big ass sword. And I remember I watched this one too. He actually says like nobody yeah. or, or no, I killed no these one guys. gets in the gay or some shit. I just capped it at no. And it just fit. <laughs> Rip ding dong's ding dong. Yeah. I feel like, yeah, because I, I want to say that if I do ever play this game, I have no intention of reloading to a previous save. I have no intention. Whatever happens, happens. That's part of the experience. That's pretty base. What if you die? I save scum well, like a whatever monster. Whatever happens, right? I just go back to the previous save. That's save scum. That's Chad. No, that's I think it's fine energy. if you want to play the game that way, right? You want to have like a specific experience, do it. Go ahead. But like, I just feel like the spontaneous nature and... It removes a lot of the... It removes a lot of the permanence and importance of things happening in the story. Or in, in, like, the narrative of the playthrough, if you can just undo it all. Does that make sense? <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, it kills the narrative of the playthrough. This is just a... <laughs> okay. He's got dick on. Uh, I, I maybe don't want to come in that. see the halflings didn't do. Is that mean? Oh shit. Damn. We didn't hey, actually yo, do this. Fuck the druids did that. What the fuck? The reaction content is so funny. What? <laughs> Dude. Nice to have this across the mug. Oh, we do it. Eat it or else. Oh. Wait. You have to make this goblin literally <laughs> eat shit? This is the best interaction, dude. What? Literally eating shit. I didn't know you could force him to eat shit. I just took this. I just took this immediately when it when it, I saw it. This is amazing. You can? You don't have to? No, if you can make him eat shit, you have to make him eat shit. He's almost at the, uh, the ending. Oh my god. <laughs> oh man. What the fuck is... is it, let me guess, these are all gonna... Yep. Oh. Oh my... <laughs> Jesus! This took so long, dude. This took so long. Every shot took like. And, and we can do any. We can do any of like, this in the game. Positioning all the barrels, walking around really slowly. 
Yes. I kept pulling into combat and fuck up my camera more than anything. That took the longest. This took, dude. I kind of, I lost count of the amount of takes. This is amazing. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, you could do What it. a masterpiece. Oh. The video and the game, it seems. This is yeah. incredible. I'm going to be real. Like, this has made me want to play Baldur's Gate 3 more than, almost more than the bare sex scene. <laughs> Let's Fuck see yeah. this. That's how you introduce a villain. What's this? Kill the goblins. Oh, this scene is so good, dude. What? This is spoilers, though. I'm, I'm not going to. That's so good though, that scene. This bit. I'm not gonna spoil it, go watch that scene, play the game. So good. Damn, that's crazy, dude. Asmund re <laughs> reacted to the video. That's wild, because I've seen him react to shit before, obviously. Uh, first time I've ever had a major guy make a video reacting to a video that I made, that's crazy. Leave the bald comment? Oh shit, yeah. Oh shit, I already closed it, dude. I don't know if it'll still be there. So is this an accurate? Uh, thanks for watching. Go upvote the comment then. <laughs> thanks for watching, oh great beautiful bald god. Alright, there we go. Guys, go upvote it. <laughs> It'll be a new. <laughs> oh man. Hopefully he, he doesn't he finds it funny and not really upsetting. <laughs> I I forgot Oka was in the uh, middle of murdering some random people. I was just doing it for extra XP. Damn, that's wild, dude. Usually I find that shit in my um my like uh what do you call it? Uh, my, it, it like copyright strikes videos for having my content in it and then I but then I just I never report any of it I just watch it oh I forgot okay <laughs> don't forget uh, he said the video was a masterpiece that's true yeah he did I don't know if he says that a lot though so I appreciate it that's like one of the biggest things that was like blowing me away like every I had so, dude if you go and look through the comments from that from the video it's all such nice stuff I was so fucking like floored by how nice everybody was like how enthusiastic like this is a masterpiece like wipes tears all you know this kind of stuff a beautiful bald god <laughs> Baldur's gate I bet people have made that joke the the Baldur's gate as when gold joke how is Oh my god, finally, dude. Wait, they're still alive? Oh, shit. Um, fuck, how do we tackle this? Uh, I'm gonna pull him over here. Get fuck. <laughs> oh, shit, I thought they got crushed by barrels. Now I can shoot him. Nice. Is the body gonna bug out in the barrels? Yes, it is. Oh, I did it for a second. That's like, did anybody do that back in Oblivion? Where you put, oh, oh my fucking God, what? Ew. Oh, Christ. Did anybody do that in Oblivion where you like drag somebody's body into a doorway and then close the door on their body so the body starts like vibrating and jiggling and glitching out? Oh, we get Carlyx's head back. It weighs day. five? I'll need to rest soon. Hold on. Can we do something funny with it? Hold on. What can we do with Kalak's head? Because I'm not going to need it for quests, I think. That's funny. Got a little Kalak head altar? Any money in this? Nope. Bring it to Will? Oh! Yeah, alright. Good idea. Good idea, good idea. I can get free shit from Will. Maybe money. Money from Will. 
All right, we're done here. It's null time though. I need to piss first though so bad. Oh my god. I've been holding it for like that entire Asmin video. Why the fuck have I got 43 notifications? Oh shit, it's- Oh my god, it's everybody upvoting and responding to the comment. Holy shit! There's my boy. Oko- Oko about to get striked for reacting to Asmin reacting to Oko's video. <laughs> Uh, well, a bunch of you found that. Holy shit. Yeah, I need to piss. I will, I will do pee pee and I will be back. Alright, I'll tell you what, I'll play the fucking clip again. Why not? Oh, fuck. Wait, no, never mind. It wipes out the thing. I'll be right back. I'll play some uh, Metal Gear in the, in the background. mission successful all right let's get back to it I still on the fence about playing music for this stream like in the back background music but I was like fuck it I'll choose the in-game stuff it'll be fine I don't care did you wash your hands of course I didn't <laughs> I'm a disgusting video gamer yeah I wash my hands don't worry Mission accomplished. Oh my god. Promote that man immediately. How are we gonna tackle the hyena fight? All I'm, th I'm thinking maybe... Oh shit. Oh balls. Balls dicks. Okay, we gotta talk to this guy. Ooh, no, I didn't mean to get... Oh fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, I, didn't, I thought I could get way closer than that. Oh no. We should help. Don't be a fool, lad. Shut your mouth and keep your head down. Oh, I'm so the killing these guys. Them that don't value their own skin. Use the worm. I will be doing that. Are they gonna go for me? Eat shit, you giant. Oh, fuck. I'm screwed, dude. There's not enough of me. They're gonna kill me. <laughs> They're actually gonna kill me. No. Oh my God, why are they... No grieving. Don't give a dart if I get caught stealing. <laughs> uh, that's fine. Thanks, Brandon. Thank you for the dono, man. Fuck. Can I... I don't think I can... Oh, fuck. Alright, I gotta load. I, I loaded... I saved right before it. It's fine. I just need to stealth up and then get up to that knoll and then talk to it. Aren't you joining them? Uh, yeah, but... Oh, the Zentrum? I'm not joining the Zentrum. I'm... Well, kinda. I'm allying with them. I just need to get that. You'll see what I do. You'll see. There's a big brain way to go about this, I promise. Let's goblin our way up there. Doom, 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 doom. Don't, don't. I need a hotkey for the uh, stealth noises. Stealth song. Okay. And now I. On stealth. Alright, here we go. 
A pack leader's mind clamps onto yours. You see yourself through her. Oh my god, look at my little legs wiggling. What's happening? Cluster <laughs> what is that? Feast. All right. Yes, 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 yes. Draw her mind. Yeah, it's lost the voice. And then. But you feel oh. nothing in response. You see, and then the voice. Uh oh. Bringing order in the cave. Uh oh. The meat is trapped. Oh no, what? Terrified, but protected by fine. Fuck! I fucked it up. Shit! I picked the wrong voice option. Which is the one that gets you to that next section? So you can do the roll. I don't know, why does that knoll look stoned? Yeah, what was that like freeze frame of like a knoll? Just whack teeth out. With a shock of psychic pain, you All right, see it's um, your whole world divert attention to the cave. No, no, it's search your, her mind for the source of the voice. The beast daubs the sedary, the mark glows. And then, but you feel nothing in response. Your illithid power is uh, beyond reach. And then explore her memories. And the meat is trapped. Now, why does it keep going to just the cave? Protected by you see, and then the voice bringing what? Order. Eating this meat was forbidden. But it would you need to sleep? To oh, fuck! Are you serious? I have to long rest? No way. When is that a, res a restriction ever? I haven't even used my, my short rest yet. It goes to the cave first. I feel like if I long rest, it's going to skip time forward, though. Oh, that sucks, dude. Wait, so I wasted it on the stupid absolute dorks in the cave? Damn it. All right, I'm gonna try and sleep. We'll try and do a long rest. Fuck it. Damn, dude. The Yankees are weird looking. All right, do a nap. Do any cutscenes that we need to. Oh my god, I do not want to do 320 of that. Alright, there we go. Do a rest, a little snooze. It's probably going to do a cutscene. Oh no, maybe not. Say bye to strength. Fuck! No! <laughs> All of my long rest stuff! Alright, well, push the giant, push the animal speaking, push the mind reading. And then uh, I'm going to get Gale in the party, get Longstrider off him, and then send him back. Damn it. Go ahead. I'm listening. Join me. Wait. Hello, Gale. Okay. Wait, can I level him up to give me more of them? Can he give you any others? What do level three wizards get? Level two spells... None of these are per long rest. Dark vision is, but we already have dark vision. Uh, none of these are permanent. Scene visibility, maybe? Maybe that is. Until long rest, level two spell slot. Can I give myself detect invisible? All right. Where's that at? Oh fuck, I didn't equip it, right. I don't like that mechanic. Very much. Long Strider. And see invisibility. What? You can only cast it on yourself. Cringe. Alright, Gail. Your mind? I question the wisdom of that. I'll be here. Alright. Later, nerd. Did I have any other uh Stuff? Or was that it? Am I missing something else? I'm not, right? Can... I don't know, can Shadowheart give you Bless Armor for... Oh, shit, yeah. They might be able to give us Bless. What level do you unlock Bless? Where's Shadowheart at? There she is. God, I really should put clothes on them. I feel kind of nasty, them all just being naked. Something the matter. All right. all right, lady. Do I have any clothes for you? I do. Put this on. Cover yourself up, lady. There we go. She looks like a hobo. 
Bless is only 10 turns. Not true. Bless. Oh, bless. Not bless. I'm talking about aid. I want to see if she can give me aids. Nah, she doesn't have aids. Damn it, dude. Concentration. Sanctuary. Bless. Shield of Faith. None of these. Don't, like, all of these require concentration, so they're useless. But maybe if we uh, level up. It's a level 3 spell? I mean, what level do you unlock level 3 spells? Level 4? Or level 5? Bless. No, aid. Right there. Aid. She has aids. Yeah. Now, uh, now she can give us aids. And, oh, warding bond. No way. And so long rest melee. Let's try that. I think that requires you to be in the same party, though. Spiritual weapon. Summon a floating spiritual weapon that attacks enemies alongside you. I'll be honest. I haven't played cleric. I didn't know a lot of these spells existed. A cleric's good. I've heard they're kind of mid. A clerk's mid or good? Look, give him that. Bam, so long rest. And then aid. And then I'm like, get the fuck out of here, lady. If you're sure, fine. Bye, lady. No way that stays. No way I get warning one still. Wait, are they going to take damage while in camp, or is this going to go away the second I leave camp? Ain't no way! <laughs> Why does that work? I have plus one bonus to my uh, AC. I get saving throws and resistance to all damage <laughs> because of this. No way that's a, an abusive bug. Did I just figure out a fucking bug? Yes, she can die in camp. <laughs> no way! That's fucking great. Okay, cool. Fucking pro strats. Holy shit, look how strong we are now. We got we got movement, we got shit, I get it again! Come on, can you reach me? Fuck! Why do I do that every time? Stealth, stealth. You're supposed to stealth. You're a stealth man. Just hire a new cleric if she dies. That's a good point. That's good. Let's see this guy's using his brain. This is some big brain shit. Oh man, dude, it's still climbing. Holy shit. Yeah, thanks for watching the stuff, guys. Thanks for watching the stream and the videos and everything. It's not over. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just passively thinking. I can't even believe how good this is all doing. Koi fish? Hey, koi fish. <coughs> Hi, koi fish. Man. Wild of you to show up in my stream. The shock of psychic pain, the pack leader's mind clamps on Full cleric yours. party is a classic. You is it? I've never heard of a full cleric party. I know that you can get like melee clerics and ranged clerics and buff clerics, so I guess that works. It's kind of like a paladin and wow. They can do everything. Has forbidden this meat. No, see your whole world as a meal. Can I use it now? This no, what the fuck? I don't acting as a leash, but it won't a memory. Buried as the symbol glows. Oh, okay, I can. Course it's through. Nice. Me. Here we go. Authority. I'm gonna use guidance, even though I don't need it. I don't. Th I think that means I physically can't fail if I have that. Full cleric parties are badass. Sensing your presence, I mean, full barbarian uh, groups are badass. I mean, your command. Its host will feast something. Yes, yes. Help me while I go and hide, and you do all the work. Go, 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 go. Kill it. Oh, oh my God. Lind is such a badass lady. Um. Oh shit. How do we tackle this? I did not mean to set that to where's. I'm pretty sure just a full bear wild hot bob potty can finish the game by itself all. Dude, definitely. Like, I, the, the bear wild hot one seems to be the best, but I'm having too much fun with the berserker throwing build. Like, picking people up and being able to throw them with fury as a bonus action and another guy to kill two people is just so satisfying. Nothing beats a wizard where everyone is a crummy wizard. I can't think where everyone is a crummy wizard. That's Four wizards might actually be okay, though. But there'll be certain fights where you're just not good. 
But like, if one of you is an abjuration wizard, one of you is a necromancer, one of you is an elemental wizard and shit, it might be pretty strong. I think almost any combination is good. Four druids, four necromancers, four everything. I don't even... Fuck the Yenog guys, they're really annoying. I eat my balls, dude. I'm just gonna hide. <laughs> nice. Now we just have to make sure they don't see us. And then they'll, they'll all gang up on the Flynn thing. They're gonna see me immediately. They're gonna turn around and see me instantly. Never mind. Dude, how are we getting away with this? We're professional sleuths. I don't call it ogre bods. Dude, I want to do uh, fantasy. Some of the evil fantasy races so bad. I'm so unbearably high for- No! Fuck! I want to- We should go back to camp and check and see if, uh, if Shadow Hodge dead <laughs> at some point. Because if not, this is a really good exploit that I'm going to use for the whole thing. Look at these guys just not helping. Okay. Next idea for Bulls Gate 3 video. Four half orc bards. Um, maybe bards is on the list potentially. I just don't really. The idea of just being able to all play music while taunting people in combat is pretty funny. I don't know. Ah shit! They can see me. Um, balls. Whatever. I'm just gonna start hitting. Die! 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 die. I'll do much else. Flynn can tank and DPS and I will <laughs> light DPS and provide enthusiastic backing support and also hide. <laughs> Go Flynn, you have this. Oh man, they are getting kind of chewed up though. It's that triple shot that these guys do that's insane. No! <laughs> what difficulty? This is uh, regular difficulty. Balance. I've cons I'll, if I start getting too OP, I'll switch it up to Tactician. But I'm not going to change it down if it gets too difficult. We've not been having too much trouble, though. Solo playthrough's been good. Rogues are nuts. Alright, Flynn is... <coughs> getting kind of bullied. Shit, what do we do here? Ice? Why do I have disadvantage? Alright, I have an idea. Going around the back. Surely they don't know I'm here, right? Flynn! No! Ah, oh, shit. They definitely know I'm here. Don't you dare shoot me. Fuck! Dude, the fucking triple shot is so OP. No! They're gonna do two triple shots on me! Please! Fuck! That's so OP. Dude, if this one gets me, I'm fucked. Alright. I'm sorry, but the triple shot is OP as fuck. It's wildly overpowered. Erm... Um, okay. Uh... Oh boy. Alright, potion of speed. And then... A chug for bonus action. And then... Uh, arrow of darkness. Kill this one, blind the other one. And then, um, get the high ground Anakin. And then, why can't I shoot with advantage? Come on. I don't want to have advantage in the high ground. Don't try it. All right, acid, I guess. Fuck. Uh, let's get over like here, I guess. That works, sort of. Come on, don't die. No. Don't you die, 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 don't you die. I hate you. Nice. Good shit. Good shit. No, 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 no. Shit, I gotta deal with all these guys now. All right, I gotta do big here. Okay, right. First of all, get out of the line of sight. Hide. Get behind. Stealth attack for big damage. 27 damage, dead. Get over here. Do another cunning action hide. Oh, can I really not attack now? Is this just a regular attack? 
Shit, I wasted my hide. I did it in the wrong order. Do ice then, maybe they'll fall with advantage. Nice. And then when they come to get me, maybe they'll fall over. Who knows? Good shit. Yes. Yes, you're blind. Fuck, what are you talking about? Wait, I just realized I have those gloves that reduce their, their damage on reaction. So their first hit at least is going to be nerfed. All right. Wrist shot. Stuff. Now we just finish off the Nor. Oh, Nor. Bro, I don't even... Fuck it, regular shots. Big damage. Come on. They're melee anyway, so they're kind of screwed. What? Are you kidding me? I'm getting lucky with some of these rolls. Thief, Rogue, Haste Potion... Oh! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, it's fine, I forgot. We can absolutely clap in melee. Fuck, man! Come on! You douche. Get ruined. Nice. You kind of fucked me there with the, with the double hit. Good shit. Oh. Oh, God. You're a sweet sight. <laughs> I am? I my crew still alive up there. Dude, if this guy rocked up, fucking milk on his lips, f little yellow jacket, is that a sweet sight? I was answering someone's question about how you can do so much, and I go, oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, no, I fucking, dude, rogues are so good in general. All I saw was blood and guts. Damn it. Risen Road's more dangerous than ever. You're the first friendly face we've seen since Eltergard. We're bound for Baldur's Gate. Uh, Got some cargo to deliver. We'll keep... Listen, you should tell the fellow on the door. Okay. Little serpent, long shadow. That's an innuendo. He'll we take got good it. take care of you. All right, uh, cool. Parents are the currency of the Zentarim. This is the point when a clever uh, one like you accepts my gratitude and walks away all right i'm gonna loot all this shit and then i'm gonna kill him for xp and also because it's useful to have the box because then we can give it to the deter then the, the, the. we know how to get in so now i don't have to pass a speech check to not get exploded to get into the zentarium hideout also this sucks by the way this flail isn't even a flail wait are they actually leaving i don't feel lucky Oh man, I was gonna throw him into a pit. Ooh. If we okay, once we get a point in a fighter, I might use this scimitar. I'm gonna keep that to the side. So this flail look, though, I was so disappointed. It's not even a flail. They they never fixed it. Look, so it's just a bone. It's called shattered flail. It's just a handle. It's just a bone. And it's pretty good, but also pretty terrible because it makes you go go mad. If you don't keep hitting people, but even if you hit them, it seems to make you go mad anyway. Oh, oh my god, it's been a long time since I managed to catch an Okoi live. Love you, dude. Keep up the content. I love you too, buddy. Thanks for watching. Hope you like the new Vidi. Actually, that does so much more damage than my current weapon because because uh, of the strength potions. I don't want to go mad though. Gaining health when you hit and a plus two is insane. But the <laughs> if you go mad, you can't do anything. Hostile to everyone in the vicinity. Oh, wait, that doesn't matter then. But it means I can't control my actions. I'd rather control my actions. We'll just sell it, whatever. Also, I'm going to assassinate this guy, I think. He's not going to know. Nice. My god, would you let me loot his body? I just rock up wearing all these clothing. Hey, boss. Ollie, did you get shorter? <laughs> Are you so little? Oh, shit. Oh, okay, I thought he discovered me. Wait, does this guy have any good loot? Or can I just throw him off the cliff? Oh, shit, he's gonna find his friend dead. Oh, shit. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Your ranged weapons aren't gonna do shit. Ow. Um... We need to go and check on that dead lady. Potential dead lady. 
Adoko, Esmond say you're Babravid. What? I already reacted to it earlier in this stream. Um, like, I reacted to him reacting to my stream live on the stream. The flail is great with the lava time mage because you get crazy priests at the goblin capital bob. Yeah, I'm sure that there's a lot of good combinations of build variety. I really love, like, I've been liking that. Um, should I just go melee? Uh, get fucked. Get fucked, dude. Fuck. No. No. Okay, I thought I was. <laughs> I thought I was going. <gasps> Wait, he's almost dead. All right. Well, I know how to finish him. Oh, I don't have an action. Wait, can I push him into the fire, maybe? I'm going to use one bonus action to get behind him here. And then one bonus action to shove him. Oh, man, he goes way too far. What? Whatever. Fine. Chests like that don't hold trinkets. There must be something more valuable inside. Money, explosives, whatever. He had a good amount of money. Alright, I'm just gonna take it. How much does it weigh? 11. That's fine. We'll go there next. Also, it doesn't matter. I have so much carry weight. I have so much strength. All of this. Ah, dude, I got 11 alchemists fire. Salami! Salami weapon. I will rectify rectify my earlier mistake and wield an offhand salami. Does <clears throat> bad damage anyway, so fuck it. Mm. Wait, there's some arrows up here. I don't go open the chest. What? Now, if I open the chest, it fucks up the quest line. You don't understand. If I don't open the chest, I get way more. I get a unique crossbow, I get like... some st a bunch of stuff. If I open it, all I get is, is an iron flask with s something spoilery in it. Open it, open it, but it's so exciting. Who cares? The Zent or lame? Hey, 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 you know what? I, my guy fits in with the Zent. Thank you. And also, you won't be saying that when you check their wares. And what they can sell. They're good guys with good shop. And also, if I give them, I'll find out. Should throw the flask, get the XP. I know what the flask does, dude. I know what's in the flask. I'm well aware of what's in the flask. Harold, iron flask. Exactly, dude. And also, more importantly, you get access to the to the uh, store. The Zen Zentarium store is really good, especially for rogues. I want that shit. Get our guidance. Get good stuff. And you can buy a guy too. Oh, you can buy a guy. Fuck your yeah, slavery. <laughs> these are these seem really good to me, but then you I think about how how I never turn off my rage and how it's not worth it at all. It should be every time you go into a rage you get 15 HP. You know? Or like you get 7 HP or you get HP depending on your constitution modifier when you go into a rage or something cool like that. I feel like some items are really badly balanced. And they're just not worth it. But then again, I guess if you were going for a build where you only... Like a tanky barbarian. But then it's not worth it to shrug off your... Your uh, rage for some hit points. Manually. So few rages uh, per day as a bob. It's good to end the fights, I guess. I, exactly, that's what I mean. Like, I, you just stay in rage the whole time. There's no downside. Maybe if you're gonna fight somebody that you know is gonna use like a calm thing on you or something. I don't know. Doesn't seem worth it to me. I'd rather use my rage that, that my barbarian revolves around. Ooh, that's a big... Do I have anything explosion-y? Area of effect-ish? Um... Maybe this? Like, then I do a... 
Give him one of these. Fuck, I got pulled in anyway. No, they're all gonna... Damn it! <coughs> no, he's gonna... He's, I swear to fuck, if he gets an angle on me, that's crazy. I thought it was like that, put it, but it's just if in a fight you lose it, it still gives you 15. So like if... Wait, really? So if you lose your rage, you get it? Because it says when the wearer chooses to end their rage, they gain 15 temporary hit points. Why would they explicitly state chooses to end their rage? Because that's, that's what made me think, like, what's the point? You know? Uh... Fuck off. Damn it. I am stealth. They're just gonna growl, growl and not do anything? Good, good. This is the benefit of stealth right here. This guy's gonna come for me though. He's gonna discover me. Fuck! No! You son of a bitch. Alright. Shit, how do we tackle this? Um. Color spray? Blinds a creature with up to a combined 30. I do not need one turn of blindness. Piercing strike. Nice. Wait, where's my bonus action? The fuck? Did he kill my bonus action with that soul offering bullshit? I'll take bonus action to reactions. Fuck off. That sucks. Man, that's really strong. Okay, hit the plus next to the end turn button. What? Oh. No, I know it. No, I know you can increase your rows. I don't. It takes up too much of the screen. I don't like it. Get fucked. And then got two bonus actions. So move here. Get a free shot off on his gut. A little bit of damage. Get back over here. Wait, can I hide, like, here? Because then the tree blocks it, maybe? Don't you discover me. Don't you do- No, bitch! Fuck. No, I think it's the triple shot off on me. That sucks. The Null Hunters are the scary part, dude. These ranged guys are crazy. Ah, oh, shit. I took my thing off my bar again. I hate it when I do that. So let's swap these around. All right. Maybe just melee. Kind of advantage. Melee is stronger than range, though. Die. No, don't fuck in with the dual wielding, dude. Ah, shit. Shit. Fuck it. We're good. We're good. We're good. Don't do the triple shot. Don't do the triple shot. Fuck. Nice, nice. They missed all of them somehow. Ah, uh, zero four. Ah, uh, nice. Okay, these gloves are really fucking pulling their weight. Holy crap! Die! Come on! Come on, dude! Die! Come on, please! Come on! We gotta get some more powerful things like now. We really do. You will need Misty Step, that helps so much. Misty Step's good for... I mean, I guess. I know what you're saying. Alright, Ice, maybe? Yeah, nice. Ice, maybe they slip. Damn it, they saved. Uh, Alright, I'm just gonna try and finish him off. Get fucked, dude. Nice. Hide here again, and turn. What you gonna do? Slip. Damn it! Nice, see? They don't even know what to do. Wait, can I actually... No. Wait, maybe. Hell yeah, dude. You're fucking screwed. What? Ain't no way. Do these have 18 meters of range? Oh, 15 meters on the hand crossbows. Okay, that's kind of a downside. You can lock the hot bar so that you aren't constantly dragging the items off it. Yeah, I know. I just forget to do it. And I move them around so much that I usually just leave it off. Alright, cutting action dodge. A little bit closer. Oh, I can use mobile shot. 
49% disadvantage. What's the point in that then? After using a disengagement, you can make a range attack as a bonus action. But I can already make range attacks as a bonus action. Mobile shot's only good if you're using a bow. Should I just get rid of that? Once per short rest, I should just get rid of that, right? That's just pointless. I can free up space on my bar if I get rid of that. Die! Come on. Die, 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 No! You clown. You clown animal. You giggling clown. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Damn, that multi-shot is wild. Ooh! Solo Rogue is fun, though. Ambos used to be 12 meters. Well, I'm glad they buffed them. 12 meters would have made them kind of dog shit. Any Okoi moment? There's been a few. It's mostly been going pretty good, though. Surprisingly. Well, I definitely don't want to be abusing short rests and long rests. Short rests? What do I even use short rests for? Like, if I'm running low on health potions and I don't really want to... Shit, how do we tackle this? Are they weak against anything, or are they just normal hyenas? Yeah, nah. Fuck it, I'll just get a nice sneak attack on them. There's a plus button next to it to that allows you to add additional roll the buttons. I know! Oh my god, I know, but it covers- look, I hate that it covers so much of the screen. What I don't get is, you know how there's like a gap to the right and a gap to the left, right, of your bar? Why can't you extend it out lengthways like you used to be able to? That's what you used to be able to do. Oh, fuck. Like back in the uh, beta, I missed that. I, I want to extend it down, not out. Fuck. Oh my god, it's bugging out. It's bugging out. Why is it bugging out? No, fuck. What is happening? Stop looking at me. Die. Attitude negative? I just kind of feel bad. Oh my god, I'm a monster. It wasn't even trying to fight me. What happened? Is the AI just bugging out? How How the XP is scaling? Pretty bad. I mean, I'm almost level 4. I'm 400 XP away. So once I do this Intarium thing in this other place, I should be good. Ain't no way. Ooh, shit. Alright, hide. Advantage. Hit the null. And... Try and finish it off? Damn it. Alright, run away. As far as I can. Ugh. Okay, this could be bad. Because they have like this biting thing and they all have their turn at the same time. And oh my god, the movement range. Are you kidding me? Have you killed all the goblins already? Not yet. We're slowly gathering barrels and stuff, and I'm going to the Zentarium outpost, and I'm probably gonna have to kill them because I want the explosive barrels. All right, die, come on. One fucking damage. Why? Who talked me into using fucking salami as an offhand? You're gonna be the death of me. I'm gonna need for one average. Shit, I might just use my... Fuck, it's not a bonus action, it's a main action. Shit, all right. Alright, I gotta fucking all ass. Go, 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 go. Are they gonna dash? They didn't dash! Oh no! No! Ooh. Oh fuck, dude. Alright, and then we bonus action dash. And get away really far. Get, get the fuck out of here! Run, dude! Sudden rush. Why are they? Is it not just regular dash? Who's feeding the provoke opportunity attacks? Oh, it's like a bonus thing. Nice. Come on, big damage. Ah, so close. I can handle one of them. Big. God damn, dude. What? Nice. Alright. 
He's not a oh, he's burning nice for three turns cool Nice definitely gonna get hit on me, but it's fine Ow You can't defeat sans underdog Salami strike <laughs> Secondary salami strike <laughs> We need to get something that isn't salami dude really bad nice What's a somebody recommend a good weapon? Oh, you know what? We could sneak into the underdock and get the little dagger that gives extra damage on first strike. Also, some plus one. Going to the getting to our underdock would be great, actually. There's a lot of stuff in the underdock for us. We gotta do the zent zen, uh, zen thingy first. Got poison, nice. Shipment orders gold. I don't want to swap back to short saw too. As much as I like the salami, it's really bad. <laughs> it's seriously terrible. Nice. It's a short saw, Rokoi. Wait, you mean the salami? This? No, this is a piece of salami. This is a short saw. This is salami. It's food. I say we get into the Zent place to get the explosives too. I want those false barrels. And then we can leverage that. Holy hell, Okoi made it onto Asmus Gold's channel. Yeah, dude, that video went crazy. Oh my god, a secondary salami though. I can't do it. I can't do the dual salami. Sans is a vegetarian. Extra damage against vegetarians. <laughs> Imagine you come across a vegan in this game and you just kill them with a salami and you get an achievement. Give me that dagger. Fit for an ogre. You notice a peculiar oh fuck. Dagger nice, critical success. I should get two daggers for that. Nice. Dagger main hands. 7 to 10 instead of 6 to 11. That's good. Less abilities. Plus 6 instead of plus 5. A knife and a salami. I use the knife to cut the salami for extra damage. Fuck, see? I move stuff around too much. Alright, to the Zintarium hideout. Maybe I could do the ogre fight, maybe, but the ogre can throw rocks and shit now. Twenty-one strength is so useful. Oh wait, shit! These have stuff in them. There it is. To the Zentarium thingy. Wait, there's no fight, and then, ah, uh, wait, maybe I could save the dude from the building to get the free item. I don't think I need any of it, though. I don't need a lightning, uh, trident. I don't need a lightning bow, and I don't need a lightning mace or shield, whatever it is, I forget. Have you seen the nine-minute speedrun of this whole game? Did they just use, like, bugs to jump through walls and shit? I have not seen the nine-minute speed through. That sounds wild. God, we look adorable. Oh wait, this could be better armor for us. 12 armor class, 11 armor class, nice. What does it look like? <laughs> Terrible, I love it. Okay, we're pretty close. Actually, you know what, 260 XP, let's fucking do the dragon thing first. All I have to do is pass a, a speech check. I don't want to reload it though. But if I have read minds, which I do, detect thoughts, I mean. Maybe we can, like, finagle our way through. What the f- a dragon. Wait, I got frightened? Me. Oh, the dragon, right. Oh shit, no, I was gonna blow up the dragon. Or try to. Yeah, we'll do that after. I wanna try and blow up the dragon. It's got 400 HP. If we put down enough barrels next to it, we can kill it. There's a three and a half sex 
speed run. Yeah, there's uh, fucking what's the uh, D disguise toast? Disguise toast, the the YouTuber guy, Twitch streamer guy. I mean, a YouTuber guy. Uh, shit, that was dumb. Um, he did a any percent like sex speed run. I did it in like four minutes, and then somebody broke somebody's record and had the world record for a little bit, and then somebody else broke it. Oh, this is gonna be so funny, dude. <laughs> Look at my little body. <laughs> you puny little, <laughs> little smile. We don't have much time. Imagine a, like a, a three foot tall little gnome rocks up with a blue eye called Sans Underdog and kicks open a door that five grown humans couldn't open. My god, why is it fucking up my camera? Oh, that's not me. What the fuck? What am I? Where's my pathing? How the fuck did I take damage there? Get him out! Oh my god, come on. Oh, this is the lady that you fucking rescue. I found her later on in the campaign. I couldn't remember who it was. Um, oh, right, fuck it, whatever. Let's try it. Go, 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 go. I have, I have enough strength. I can succeed the check. You might die, though. <laughs> this, okay, this cutscene is going to look really funny. Hurry! Get this thing off me! You tiny little pathetic man. Look at my big hands, though. <laughs> Did I just pick up the rubble and just launch it? No, I just lift it. Okay. All right, let's get out of here. Go, 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 go. Free XP, free XP. Did he just fall over again? Did he just fall over again? How is he prone? Is he gonna live? All right, he's good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Your boldness is a blessing, counselor. Yes, 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 yes. Gnome, a duke. I don't feel to the nobles. Nah. Um, sure. Thank you. Go. I will seek this. <laughs> seek, seek less. Oh yeah. So we get a, a, a spicy stick, a spicy bow, or a spicy trident. I'm sort of tempted on the bow to do the lightning strikes build, but I kind of prefer the dual crossbows just to have an, uh, an ability to use your um, bonus actions. I'll just get, I'll take the one that's worth the most, which is the staff or the bow, I guess. Can I talk to him? Miri, have you seen her? Uh, you get XP for doing this guy's shit. I think I already sold the amulet. I did, I already sold the necklace so you can speak to dad, so I can't do his mission. Oh wait, can I like, where if I find her body? Small bit of XP. It's worth it. All the XP that we can get right now is great. Level 4 is a huge thing. Brown hair. That must be Mary. She's not breathing. Doesn't he get all mad? And then and gives you like you nothing. My Miri? Yeah. She did. You think you'll get mad if I throw a body? Yeah, it's Miri. red. Damn it. Miri, you should have stayed. If I just kept my mouth shut, she said I'd never see uh, her again. She was. You Hold on. Miri. What happens if I throw a body? At him. <laughs> Get back here. Oh man. <laughs> oh my god. Can I just like fucking how far can you throw bodies? Damn it. 
Wait, is he coming back? Oh my god, he's coming back. Come on, buddy. Just up these stairs really fast. You're almost here, bud. Can I improvise weapon it? He doesn't want to come up the stairs. <laughs> he, doesn't <want> to... <laughs> he doesn't trust me. Oh, that's fucking funny. All right, well, I'm not here. I'm actually fucking stealth. Shit, he saw me immediately. Can I, mo Can I move, move the folding screens and then throw it at him? Yes. You were seen trying to move a. <laughs> the cut to him gets me every time, dude. I got one XP for killing him. That wasn't worth it. Hello, Koi. How do you feel about your Fall by Rans video getting more than one million views? Uh, one mil, I'm, I'm assuming you say. I, I was fucking in awe, dude. And it has two million views on Twitter, just on the explosion clip from the end. Uh, I never expected it to even get one tenth of that. Like, I'm kind of blown away that it, that it did as well as it did. And I'm just, obviously I'm super happy. You know, like I'm really glad people enjoy it and stuff. Uh, but yeah, more, more, I'll be working on some more stuff. I mean, probably gonna be like necro four necromancers though. For, for wizards. Wizards have some goof shit. Some really funny, goofy shit they can do. The later, especially the spells in the later levels are, are pretty nuts. But I probably won't get that far. But I need to get like level 5 or 6 if I want to do the whole undead thing. Asmongold just watched it too. I know, I know. I, I saw the clip. That, he watched it on his stream and then I saw the uh, clip that he uploaded. I commented on the video. And then I told everybody to go and upload it. <laughs> Damn it. Wait, if I perceive that. Ah, oh, man, never mind. Not even close. Monsters everywhere. Kill. Chill, bro. Chill, no, my guy. I was ready to run you through. They took the shine. I made him. I never talked to this guy, actually. He was the. I get nothing for that. I don't get any XP or nothing. Oh, I did get XP, just didn't show it. Alright, this is where the sleuth thing comes in. So, now we now we make good on that that thing, get all these barrels too. <laughs> He's gonna think I'm the, like, the, uh, the, the Noid. Monster print something. I thought you were flaming fist. Okay, Daddy, check if your healer is still alive. Love the stream. Hey, thanks, my dude. I'll check on that now. That's a good idea. All right, I'm gonna quickly go do that. Is she dead or is she alive? <laughs> yeah, she died. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, I get the thing. Okay, keep it. <laughs> the cuts are a dead ass body. Kind of got me. Also, I already had the mysterious artifact, so I definitely think that wasn't supposed to happen. Um, how did she die? So I used her ability, which is this bond ability, right? Where it makes her take, um, the like, I take half damage, but half of it gets directed towards her. Um,. I forget, and then you get adv you get advantages against saving throws and like plus one armor class and shit. But uh, I did that, <laughs> and then left her at camp. And she fucking died. Ah, uh, that was funny. <laughs> we meet again. I shall be here in my camp. Man, I like For this guy. He's so cool. Yes, 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 yes. Should uh, any of my compatriots perish? Because who the fuck would call this guy ugly? Like, fuck you. Of coin. Um. Uh, I don't need a halfling yet. Maybe we'll hire one when I need it, okay? But right now we're good. We're totally fine. We're being chilling. I'm also gonna collect all these barrels. Get all the fire wine barrels. Fire wine barrels are not to be slept on. They do spread uh, the flame around. I'm getting flashbacks already. 
I'm not entirely sure if they do a lot of damage when you blow them up, but um, they definitely help spread the fire. So if you want to spread the explosive barrels to a wider area, stuff. Now oh, shit. Wait, does this count as stealing? No, he doesn't give a shit. I can take all of these. Nice. Maybe I should just kill this guy. Oh, whatever. I'll kill him on the way out. 3 XP. I don't call it Rev Scroll. What do you mean? Oh, use a revival scroll. Oh! Do I have any? I do. I have five because I keep selling them and killing people and taking them back. Yeah, not a bad idea. I could revive her and then get her to cast that again immediately. Where's she at? Up here. She's so dead. <laughs> Does your body just get carried around with you in camp for the rest of the game now? Because that's good to know. If you kill someone in camp, does their body just stay in camp in case you need to revive them at some point? Alright, she's back. And then... I might give her some healing potions, too. Something the matter. All right. <laughs> she's like, something the matter of fate. What? Oh, she just got... Okay. If she was dead. She got all her XP back. Can I do it again? Level two spell slot. Damn it. Nope. I could, I can't even give aids again. Whatever, at least she's alive. I'll just tell her to stay. Something the matter. If you're sure, fine. Goodbye. I've never taken Shadowheart as a companion. I didn't, I'm, I'm close. Like clerics are so like, they have so many abilities and it's even more overwhelming than a mage. I just never bother. Also, she's a girl and girls are gay. So I, <laughs> No, I take Minthara, I've taken Kalak. They're both pretty cool. Barbarians are pretty pretty based. Priest of Talus is fun. I probably should play a cleric at some point. I need to do like a full cleric thing. And a wild shaped druid. I have never the last time I did a wild shaped druid was back in um the beta, and it was like super buggy and everyone was scared of you when you're in your animal form, and I also don't like that you can't talk in your animal form. Because it means I have to, if I'm doing a solo playthrough, I have to switch characters to talk to people. And I'm usually, uh, I'm like the host. I'm the one talking to people, which is, doesn't really work as a druid. Oh. That's far enough. What's your business down here? That just tells me you've met my people. Not really. We did. All right, good shit. 100 XP. Dude, we're so close. 13 XP. Are you kidding me? We're so close. Will is nice as well. Wallach is fun. Wallachs are cool. I love that how strong you can get their Eld uh, Eldritch Blasts and shit. And also, they don't really rely on spell slots as much as normal uh, casters. And they can still use scrolls and all that other good shit. So they're they're decent. Free me now, and I'll see them. Well, if you have the gold, my pet right. will make you a most heroic alliance. Brown alabaster. They never have the best one. The best die in the game, in my opinion, is the um, black and white. <laughs> Jester die, something like that. This is where I got most of the explosive barrels, by the way, guys. Look, smoke powder barrel, smoke powder barrel, smoke powder barrel. There's another one here. There's one here. There's one here. There's, an, there's another two up here. There's one here. There's like 10 in this room. And then there's a bunch of fire barrels further in in the Zetarium hideout, like in the back bit. This is where I got the majority of the explosive barrels here. And then inside the um, Holoquin die. Yeah, that's it. All right. You've already brought me. The and nice, free money, and she gives us a thing. So yeah, there you go, Harold. So this is like the best crossbow that I found even until very late game. It's just, it's a regular ass heavy crossbow, which is great if you're playing a strength guy, paladin, fighter, whatever, whatever. Like most classes, it's it's like a good race we range weapon. And then uh, it, it applies Bane, which happens all the time, and it's a plus one. So it's just a really, really good crossbow. It's there's crossbows. I feel like are super rare in this game. There's there's almost no good crossbows, and that's one of the unique ones, and it's very good. This place is a fire hazard. <laughs> they all died. Wait, where did she go? What? 
Was she down there? <laughs> what the fuck? Where's their body? Bram, Oscar... No, they're gone. They're just not there. The fuck? I didn't mean to do that, but that's funny. Holy shit, I wiped them all out completely. Hellfire Handcrosser is my favorite, okay? Is it the one where if you're in stealth and you shoot someone, they, um, they, it does like an extra 1 to 12 fire damage? But you have to be hidden when you do your stealth attack, range attack? Because that's what I have on Astarian, and then I have the one where if they're on fire, you do extra fire damage. Which, which, so they work perfectly hand in hand. I think they're supposed to, though, you know? Either one is great. I have both of them on my on my Astarian. Oh shit, we leveled. All right, big big choice here with this because we get a feat. So you can do like I've gone double dex to get eighteen. I've gone or dual wielder is good. Plus one armor class while wielding weapon in each hand, which is obviously always. And then uh, you can we can also wield non finesse weapons so if we come across like a long sword we can use a long sword and then like a, a another long sword in our offhand and you can actually get two finesse long swords later on uh far aloof is a is the like the singing one and that's you know so you get a you get a 1d10 finesse weapon which is pretty crazy and then also there's one way later on and i forget what it's called dual rapiers too rapiers are uh dual weapons you can't like they're they're a uh, single weapon, single hand only. I don't think you can, can you dual wield rapiers even w if you get dual wielder. I thought they were one hand only. Like they were specifically a two hand. Like they have the two hand trait. Like uh, two hand weapons, crossbow expert. Yeah, yeah. You can with dual wield. Ah, that's pretty cool. Dual rapiers would be pretty dope for this guy. Pretty fancy. Crossbow Master? Yeah, Crossbow Expert would be good, but I don't mind using melee weapons, you know what I mean? Whereas, like, if I get Dual Wielder, it benefits both, but if I get Crossbow Expert, it only benefits crossbows. <clears throat> and if I'm in melee, I can just use the swords anyway, like my melee weapons, like my Salami. Um... Sag, see penalties, high ground. Yeah, I don't know. What do you guys think? Should I get 18 decks or should I get dual wielder? Dual wielder seems like the obvious choice, right? Sharpshooter? Sharpshooter has negatives, though. If you take sharpshooter, look, it, uh... Range weapon attacks you're proficient with have a negative 5 penalty to their attack roll, but deal an additional 10 damage. Yeah, so I have minus 5 on my chance to hit, but if I hit, I do an extra 10 damage. It's not worth it. Especially with how much you have disadvantage with hand crossbows. It's not worth it at all. Savage Attacker is just good if you can't decide. Wait, I could also take a level into Fighter and then get great uh, two-weapon fighting. You make an attack with your offhand, blah, 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 whatever. So my offhands become as strong as my main hands. And also, I get proficiency in all martial weapons and medium armor. What do you guys think? Feet or two-weapon two fighting? Because I can pro I'm probably not going to need finesse, like the great weapon thing in the plus one armor class until later on. Sharpshooter. Uh, also archer, I guess. But this affects both. Get a plus two bonus to range weapon attacks. That is pretty good, but it means that my melee weapon will suffer. Sharpshooter feet. Is sharpshooter feet worth it? Take sharpshooter, it's insane with hand crossbows. Is it really worth it? You- I feel like a negative six chance to hit is insane. Your ranged attacks do not receive penalties from high ground. That's pretty fucking crazy though, actually. That may- okay, that might offset it. You're proficient with attack rolls, but deal an additional 10 hours. Did you say that's worth it, yeah? Fuck it, we'll try it out. Worst case scenario, I can fucking respec. You can toggle it. I don't want to have to toggle it, though. 
Ew. Where do you toggle it? On a side panel? Acids at the bottom? Could you what? Do I like drag that on and then. Ah, I can enable it or disable it. Why would I want to disable it? Just if my shit just isn't gonna hit? Like if I'm not on the high ground? I don't know, man. Whatever, I'll have it activated for now. What's my chances? So 35% chance to hit. So then if, but then if I go high ground, 45% chance. This seems super low, dude. Cause like if I toggle it off, 70% chance. Your chance to hit is so low. I'm cutting my chance to hit by like 35% or 30%, 20%. Says his muse made him do it. With advantage, it evens out. I guess. Right, so if, so then if I... Cunning action, and then sneak attack with it activated. 70%. I see what you mean. So then... If I... So if I nail this guy now... I miss. <laughs> Fuck, dude. I'm telling you, I don't think it's worth it, dude. I feel like it's. I'm gonna miss all the time. I'm not always going to be able to stealth, guys. I'm not always going to have advantage. How many fights have I actually had advantage on compared to how it is the best feat in the game? I don't, I don't know, man. I literally, this is a, this, I feel like this is a matter of opinion. Like, I'm still going to do a lot of damage. It's happened before. It's not adding the plus 10. The potential for damage is really high. 70% chance. Dude, I'm look, no. There's no fucking way. Dude. I'm missing so constantly, man. There's no way. Shoot with offhand. It is literally the best feat in the game. I disagree, man. My ranged guy is so strong, and he doesn't have it. Use your offhand shot. Offhand use. All right. Why? Ninety-one percent chance. Why is that so much different? So wait, so I'm never gonna use sneak attack now? I guess if you're a rogue, so your offhands are doing a lot, so you could just be like... I feel like this is so dependent, dude. Dude, there's no fucking way, man. And now I'm down to 45% chance to hit. It's not worth it, dude. It's so not worth it. That's not worth it at all. He's playing solo, it's hard to utilize it. Dude, that's so not worth it. There's no way. That's, that ain't worth it, Chief. You just hit for 17 damage, and... It is not worth it. You would have hit for 7. I get why the, the it adds a flat 10 damage. I get it, but if I'm missing half the time, and I'm in... Uh, like, bear in mind, too, I'm playing solo. Like, wait, am I not talking to this person yet? Assuming. Oh, wait, I've already done it. Cool. There's no way that's worth it, man. That's 2.5 times the damage. Right, but is it a static 10 the entire time? I don't know, man. If, unless I'm, if I had advantage 99% of the time, I would take it. It kind of, it's funny that it doesn't apply to the offhand though. That is such an exploit. Might not be worth it solo though. I agree that would be amazing if you were in a if you had four of these dudes, then your odds dramatically increase and suddenly that is a ridiculous damage boost. I don't feel like it's the same without it though, personally. If I'm going solo, it's not as good. I need consistency more than anything. Like if I go for dual wielder, I'm getting plus one in armor class, which keeps me alive more. People are less likely to be able to hit me. And then I can dual wield my shit later on. But more importantly, right now, I'm going to go for a level of fighter. I think. Because... Actually, should I go archery, though? That's a flat two damage. Oh, and it's a two plus two bonus to range weapon attacks. But that increases my chance to hit by a lot. 
and also it'll do two more damage right wait no plus three damage bonus to range weapon attacks is that just for hitting or is that plus two damage too Plus two, both? It is both, okay. That's gotta be worth it over twin weapon fighting then, right? It's gonna make my melee weapons worse, but I'm gonna be going range most of the time anyway. Damn, ironically it would pair well with the crossbow trait. <laughs> oh, fuck. Maybe we get crossbow master later down the line then, or something. He's now like... What's my odds of hitting that dude? 64% with disadvantage. See, that's pretty good. 64% with disadvantage. While outside of my range. Ninety-six percent chance to hit. I need that consistency, dude. I can't afford to miss. I really can't. Shit, I need these fucking barrels, dude. How do I get the barrels out of here? I'm just gonna go with this build. I like this the consistency of hitting. If we're going full range most of the time anyway. Okay, I'm gonna... Oh, fuck. Are they gonna notice? Nope, haven't noticed yet. I feel like one of them always wanders over and realizes the shit's missing. No matter what. Can you go invisible and interact with shit and pick shit up? And then stay stealth? I've never tried that. Strip this place bare. Oh, shit. Alright, this guy's gonna turn around every time. No need for Fuck. This. Free me now, and I'll see that my patron rewards you. Go, 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 go. It's a gambling debt. No, 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 no. No, no. Quick, send them to camp. Ah. Okay. Someone's reported a th Uh... What? I don't have them. Deception. Persuasion. Nice. With guidance. Come on. Get fucked. I don't do shit. You. Nice. Oh, we got two explosive barrels at least. All right, I'm going to check this guy's store and then I'm just going to kill everyone. <laughs> it's not worth it. Something I can help you with. All right. Of course. Got some interesting stock. So, I'm Giant's Breaker, fan. Jolty Vest. This sucks, I think. I think this is the one that sucks. Ooh, Hail of Thorns would be good, though. Free fucking ranger skill? Once per short rest. Nah. Nah. Bonus to slide hand checks. That does not outweigh what we've got. Plus one leather armor. I was hoping for... I'm gonna be real. I was hoping for a <laughs> fucking green crossbow. I was hoping for a plus one hand crossbow. And also a plus two set of... Um... Shit. Hide? Whatever the cloth armor, you know what I mean. I don't quite buy the thief gloves. Well, like to get advantage. Yeah, I could just have them in my inventory. It sounds like a good idea. Hold on, this guy has like no money though. I'm not gonna make them say I'm gonna pay for it. Padded armor, no point. Uh. Oh, rupturing blades, pretty good. Wait, can we dual wield these then? If we have the the greater thing, I kind of want the one d ten though. I'm gonna go off the Fowler or Louvre like I was talking about. But, um, I don't. Wait, I'm just gonna build this guy out range. Why am I bothering with melee? Like I can't deal with melee. <laughs> My guy's gonna get absolutely clapped in melee. I'm just gonna make this guy into the full crossbow build. It's a smart way to go about this, I think. Shit, we have so much money's worth of crap. Yes, babe. Dual feet? You don't get D10 if you're dual wield. It goes down to 1D8. Uh, not for hand crossbows, look. It's the same for either one. Oh, that's what you... Oh, okay. Alright, well, we got the thieves gloves. That's very good. If we need them, we got them. We gotta turn this Kallax head in <laughs> to Will. Oh shit, I can use speedy reply. Hell yeah, dude. One to six damage offhand. Damn, that's bad. 
one to six two to five for the plus one in the offhand this one doesn't have a plus one but every time i hit somebody i get momentum fuck it i'll take that all right should we use herald or just now hand crossbows are too good i kind of wish there was something you could do with your bonus action for off hands you know for, for two-handed weapons and shit. I mean, I know that a lot of them have, like, temporary use ones, but... I'd like some extended use ones. Oh, nice. We have second one, too. Alright. This bullet's going well, I'm telling you. You don't get... Some other weapons have nice effects that work just having them. Yeah, exactly. Some of them give you, um, like, you can get, if you use a shield, like, if I use a shield, I'll get armor class, right? And without being able to use my melee stuff, you don't need the shield out and your AC still goes up, right? Or does it only affect you when you have the shield out? I was under the impression that it went up anyway, because I had a shield, I had a crossbow, mason shield on my barbarian, and I had two extra armor class at all times. And I don't think it went down when I didn't have it out. Shield's always active? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe I should get a shield then. Something I can help Especially the... Uh, what if I get the one that gives you saving throws? How do you get that shield? Got some interesting stuff. It's just a plus two... It's just a two armor class shield that gives you uh, plus one to all saving throws. And that's at the goblin camp, right. I should seek that out. Get a little bit more AC. If I'm not going to be using my melee weapon, I'm going to be skirmishing the whole time. It'd be nice to not not just take some. Wait, I want to buy some dye actually from this dude before I kill him. My God. Something I can help you with. Give me your dye. Holoquin black and white. Let's go. And then also pink would be funny. Oh wait, I think pink and leaf green just dyes everything green. I think I tested this. I kind of like the McDonald's vest, but I'm going to dye the boots with this and see if it actually looks any different. Fuck! Those are the wrong boots! Damn it! Come on, white shoes. Dude, that is bullshit. It is like nothing. I don't think you can dye them. I think it might be like a bugged set. No, I like the little McDonald's jacket. Ooh! That's pretty nice, actually. Eh, actually, you know what? They're just kind of brown. I missed the belt. Yeah. I wish they would just add in solo dyes, like black, just plain black dye, plain white dye, shit like that. You know, it's all mixed. It's like mixed or nothing. Shit, I'm, I need to figure out how to kill these guys without blowing up all these barrels. Can I... Alright, I'm gonna see if I can assassinate them secretly. Alright, that'll be the that'll be the go-to. Alright, turn off all the lights for stealth. And then... Go into stealth, and then... Uh, oh, shit. I'm not sneaking around. What are you talking about? Alright. Uh, fuck! Damn it. Oh. Die, 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 die. My god, fuck! Are they all in? They're just gonna blow me up, I feel like. Wait, they're not in? Are they in? This is so difficult to tell. Surprised. Oh shit, they are in. They're all just surprised. Maybe I could do something with that. Come on, die. Please die. <laughs> Jesus Christ, you suck so bad. God damn it. I'm not even... Uh, hold on. I'm not even using the fucking ranged ambush thing. What am I doing? I'm like, let's go ranged, and then I immediately start stabbing people in the fucking back. What am I doing? I can just stealth. I can shoot people in stealth with my plus two archery shit. Moron. Damn, your character has some drip, right? Look at my little McDonald's goblinoid outfit. Right, climb on top of boxes. All right, fuck it. Here we go. Mm. No 
I should have advantage. 96%. Damn, we don't do enough damage yet. We just don't. Nice. Alright, now we go up here. They're surprised for one turn, so I should be able to throw her off, right? Surprised, surprised, surprised. Alright. Get over here, grab her, pick her up, 49% chance, throw her down to... Damn it, really? What if I get a little bit closer? Yes! Get down there, lady! <laughs> nice. And then... Only a 64% disadvantage, that guy only has a health. Fuck, really? Turn off the brazier, hide. And they should just stand there like idiots, right? Oh, they're dashed towards me. But I have the high ground. Her scream is she just plummeted to her death. Shit. How the fuck? Nice, no way. What? <laughs> I am fucking gone. Dude, this is why stealth pro proficiency is good. Holy shit. I mean, this guy's probably going to see me, but there's no way I get it again, right? Oh my god, no way! <laughs> I'm right in front of them! <laughs> I'm still succeeding it! Dude, what? No fucking way, you moron. <laughs> Fuck yeah! No, fuck off that ledge! <laughs> no fucking way, dude. Wow. This is working great. This is Skyrim levels of stealth. The, the, the fucking... It must have been my imagination. Oh, they're gonna try and shoot me. Oh my god, taking the longest route? And then we cunning action hide. We back to the edge of the thing. We should have advantage. Die Zeris. Oh, 31 fucking damage. And then where's the other guy? Is it just the one? Where's this guy? Where's Brim? Where are you, Brim? I can't see him. Oh, he's invisible. Oh, shit. That's scary. Oh, he was right there, though. Ain't no way that the stealth works this good. Don't you die, don't you die, don't you die. You've already, he's dashed, he can't do shit. God, I fucking... Dude. <laughs> no! Fuck! Come on! Oh man. Can I get away from him? Yeah, he has a range weapon out. Nice. You're dead. Fuck! Alright, now I get melee weapons out and stand close. You can't do shit. Go on, do something, Mr. Invisible. No way. What? How can you- can you attack when you're invisible? I thought it broke you out of invisibility. I thought it was the whole point. Why, when, why do they never learn? They never learn. We need that deep learning AI so that they f figure out how to avoid my <laughs> stupid fucking pushes. Stealth. Oh, is he coming up the ladder? Ain't no way I succeed. Yes! Oh my god, my yes Fun was timed fact. perfectly. Most crabs cannot turn invisible. <laughs> I got him succeeding! I had to use... <laughs> what? I am a stealth god! No, he's healing! That's fucking bullshit, dude! No way. I was too good at, st at stealth and he just left. He got bored and left, I was so good at stealth. 
Dude, I missed the dono. I said yes at the same time as the dono too. Jonathan Grover with a crab fact. Fun crab fact. Most crabs cannot turn invisible. <laughs> it wasn't fun at all. I was under the impression that crabs could turn invisible. Crabs! It didn't say crabs like Mr. Krabs say crabs. Oh. All right, then we go here. No way he gets. Oh, he's surprised. What the fuck? Did I just teleport? You are doomed, you fool. Nice. Now we can take all of the explosive barrels. And hopefully, blow up a dragon. Oh, shit. We get the caravan strongbox. Nice. And we can let this guy go free. Because fuck it. That, that could be profitable later on. I don't know who this guy is. Wait, wait. I'm uh, just a prisoner. For you've rescued none other than the artist, Oscar. Assuming Lady Janeth still wishes to marry me after uh, the, I made cool, a cool, tiny cool, cool, retreat cool. into the countryside to paint. I like a cool, cool, cool. Say, I'm not giving you. I don't suppose you this fucking guy. Coin, could you? Give me two hundred gold, dude. Ease the discomforts of the road, some. I'll give you a serious discomfort deal if you if you don't get going now. Yeah. Right, you are. Until bo he knows he was pushing it. That big dork. Oh shit. We have proficiency for, for medium armor. That might actually be way better than we've, what we've got. And it doesn't imp uh, impact stealth, I think. Nope. Take one less slashing damage, and when the wearer takes damage while having lightning charge, the attack on Muxy, blah, 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 blah. All right. We can wear that. Hey, Okoy, you see that Asman reacted to your video and made a video about your four halfing spurbs? I had just woken up and saw it on my feed. Yeah, no, dude. A couple of people have joined and told me. Like, I appreciate it. I, I, I watched it on stream. I, I reacted to him reacting to me reacting. If that makes any sense. No, I, I reacted. No, I reacted to him reacting to my video already. Thanks, thanks for the dono, by the way, my dude. All right. Yeah, 16 AC versus 15 AC. And for all those bonuses and shit like that, it doesn't impede stealth. That's a definite W. Even if it's just like temporary. I don't know, you could use fog cloud or other line of sight blockers to steal stuff under people's noses. Oh shit, like darkness? Like I could use a scroll of darkness or whatever the fuck. Um, shit, what do we do? I think we're good. Maybe kill the guys in the back now. Take all the explosive, the, the fire barrels and shit. Uh, I think I've looted everyone. Zerus has been looted. This guy. Silver ingots. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What's the green one? Oh, wizard bane oil. Smoke explosive. Smoke powder barrel. Smoke powder barrel. Oh, guys, okay, also, do you know that chest that you can get in the tower in the underdark that allows you to put stuff in that turns it into, like, spoons and forks and shit so it doesn't weigh as much? Make sure you empty that when you get to Act 2 or 3, because if you don't empty it, everything... I think it's Act 3. If you don't empty it when you get into Act 3, everything inside of it will bug out and be permanently, like, spoons and bowls and shit like that. And I didn't realize until I was balls deep in, uh, in Chapter 3. So it was way too late for me to go back. Just a heads up so you don't make the same mistake. It's called the chest of the mundane. You get it in the tower in the underdark. Like if you if you use that to store items like I have, just be warned. You will lose everything that's inside of it. Because <laughs> I know a lot of people have been using it. It's like a good meta strat, but it'll fuck you up. Like I lost, I lost the uh, powder barrel. I lost the purple powder barrel. I lost all of my uh, explosive barrels, all of my... Um, I was gonna make a video blowing up a bunch of shit in the in the capital, and then I went to check my thing, and it was all gone. I was like, it's very sad. Can I use the Tash's hideous laughter? There's probably no reason, right? Need more explosive barrels. Ah, there's one. This is a lot. Wait, they do how much damage per barrel? They do 44 plus 18 each, so even if they are... If we can somehow figure out how to kill the dragon with them, that would be huge.
Never found that chest. Where is it at? It's in the tower in the underdock. The mage tower. Anything that you put in it will get turned into, into like, things, and it saves a shit ton of weight. It's pretty amazing. Chest of the mundane. Uh, and then... Oh, shit. Dagger plus one. Wait, did they just zombie me? No, what the fuck? Did they throw yes, a dagger at me? I like it. Fun crab huh. fact. Empty your <laughs> crab twice daily. <laughs> Why is it... Why does it... <laughs> we also hear it like go extremely hot on the sea. It turned into like a demon. <laughs> Empty your crab twice daily. Why is that a fact? That's more like advice. That's like crab advice. Thank you though for your crab advice. Uh, thank you for the dono as well, my dude. Man, how are they going to deal with Sans Underdog? How are we going to deal with this fight, actually? If we actually have to get into a fight. I was hoping to stealth this section. If they see me, am I immediately going to get pushed into a fight? Because I might just pick them up and throw them off the cliff. Oh, fuck. Ooh. Yep. Okay, well, here we go. Um, path is interrupted. What? Shove. Nice. One down. Um, I don't want to blow up any of the explosive barrels, though. That guy's got dual hand crossbows. He's kind of jacking my steez. I don't think they can actually get past this section. So I might just fucking... Frostball. Wait. Wooden barrels. Alright, good. Nice. And then... Hide. Hiding successful, baby! Now what are they gonna do? They can't do shit. What are you gonna do? Oh, no. This wolf is just going to sit there and growl. He's going to do nothing. Nice. And... Fuck. I kind of wanted to hit that guy. Shit. Okay, right, let's take one of them out. And then... Can I get advantage from a stealth attack if I hide and then use a... Yeah, I can. Nice. Oh, good shit. Fuck, he's definitely gonna hit me now. Damn it! Okay, is a barrel loot goblin confirmed? Absolutely, dude. Barrels are amazing. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, God. This ain't good. Die, please die, please die, please die. Ah! Fuck, um... Okay, I can't get away from this wolf without getting bitten. Should... Alright, finish him off, please, 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 please. No! No! I need him dying. Alright, good. Um, I'm just gonna have to take the hits. Don't you dare shoot me. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, I might need a chuggy. Oh shit, wait, I still have the barrel in my inventory? What a can, that shit's heavy. I can't move to shove more of them off the cliff Always without... enjoyed your content, Okoy, and I love the pure oh. chaos you do in these types of games. Hey, thank you, my dude. I'm glad you like it. It's all about fun, right? If you're not having fun, I would, then what's the point? Thanks for the journal, my dude. Uh, and thanks for watching. Fuck, dude. Advice, chat. I need advice. Can I get both of them in this? Dude, if I move in either direction, they, the other one bites me. Oh, wait. Wait. I can get in the middle. Wait, how, what's the furthest I can get without... Right there. And then shove. Yes! Get fucked! Nice. And now that frees me up to... 
get close like this, and then... Here? Yeah. Can I... Nice. Use disengage? I should have used disengaged. It's fine, it still worked out. Tip O card. Use the plus button to increase the ability tab so you can open more items and abilities at once on the screen. I know, I know, I know. You can't extend it lengthways, you can only extend it up now. It used to be able to in the beta extend it lengthways, and I, I don't like extending it up. It covers way too much of the screen already. I mean it's pretty small as far as HUDs go for these kinds of games, I guess, but still. Alright, um shit. He's got 28 health. I'm gonna use a bonus action to chug. And I'm gonna run over and, and try and push him off the cliff. Shit, that's a bonus action. Fuck! Um. What if I throw one of these? Dude, the range of these things is fucking huge. Now that's just gonna pull him over towards the cliff. Shit. Nice. All right, let's hopefully he tries to move away and I just kill him. Nice. He gets disadvantage because he's ranged. Nice. All right, that worked out great. What? Can I not? No way, what? What? Oh. Come on, dude. No, <laughs> come on. Nice. Get fucked. Woo! Good shit. That went okay. Oh my god, so many thieves tools. We have so many healing potions, it doesn't even matter. Probably should have used a short rest since I can't use them for anything else anyway. But I can use potions in combat. This guy is using hand crossbows. <laughs> the spin animation just kills me. Glad to see others doing a solo challenge. I hope this becomes a fully playthrough. I am currently doing what? a tactical duo druid playthrough with Shadow Heart, and it's so much fun. Yeah, I love, dude. I absolutely love having. It's weird hearing Plankton's voice say really nice, sincere stuff <laughs> instead of just shit posting. Uh, thank you, uh, my dude, for the dono, by the way. Um, yeah, I agree. Like, I, I don't actually like controlling a party of four people. It gets really messy. Uh, I much prefer doing like lone wolf playthroughs and shit uh, or like playing multiplayer with friends and stuff like that like it's so annoying a buddy of mine was here for like a week doing our main campaign with my bob and shit and then he went away on on vacation for a week he went on holiday for a week and I was just saying like well fuck what do I do and but at least it pushed me to make more content I ended up making the, the uh, Huffling Barbarians vid way sooner than I thought I would I thought I was just gonna be lost in the game for too long you know but yeah, I definitely prefer doing smaller campaigns. I want the lone wolf perk from Divinity 2 in this game so that I can, you know, where um, I can have like just two characters, but they be as strong as a party of four and also get more experience. Or, or at least get more experience. If you leveled up quicker, that would be a huge thing. Like if you got double XP in exchange for only playing solo or 1.5 times XP if you're playing solo. That would be huge. That would be a really, really good change. How do I get through? Oh, nice. Aren't these both trapped? Be yep. We fucked this up. The dog from the dog meme passed away from cancer at Okai. What? What dog meme? What dog? Which dog meme? There's so many dog memes, dude. The doge one? Like Doge meme, you mean? Ooh, Infernal Lion. Dude, 
doge wait really gabriel the dog Th there's been so many dogs dying like which one where are you at in game i've never found this place i'm in the zentarium hideout zentarium hideout really fucking good place oh fuck am i gonna explode what? ow ow And this is why we buy health potions. You pop them like Tic Tacs to keep yourself going. Alright, I think I'm going to nip into the Underdog before I go to the Dragon. Since we're already level 4, I'm not really going to benefit from the Dragon XP as much as I was previously. Also, there's so much fucking loot down here. Doesn't work. In all the Baldur's Gate titles, the amount of party numbers determines your XP multiplier. The less members, the more XP you got at Okoi. You see, that's a, that would, be, would have been a really good mechanic for this game. But also, you would have been su You could potentially be, like, crazy OP. So, I don't know. I get, I get it, but also, I kind of miss the lone wolf thing from Div 2. Your Hoffman Barbarian video was the best thing I've seen all week. Hey, thanks, man. I had a lot of fun making it. I, I, you, <laughs> a lot of people have been uh, dropping in, you know, praising. I think a lot of people... Um, all right, here are people here today or people that um watch my uh my video because like literally i did a uh, a live stream of Baldur's gate before and uh okay it kind of like bugged out and shit too so it, like wasn't the best but uh that had like one tenth the amount of viewership i've had this stream it's uh i'm definitely got a bunch of new bunch of new guys from uh that video which is really cool Fuck! Wait, was I supposed to disarm the thing? Does it have a thing on it to disarm? I kind of wish guidance would automatically apply. Yep. Ooh. Dude, three of these scrolls is going to be amazing for me. Bam! Seven free false life for multiple casts. That's just seven extra life every time I lose it. That's great. Wow. That's legitimately great. Sweet. Hello, Corey. Are you aware that you can and use the... Yes, I... No, just kidding. For fuck's sake. I literally was just like, shut up. <laughs> oh my god. Damn it. I, I hate that feeling of people are genuinely trying to be helpful and you're like, I know, I just don't like it. <laughs> like, I feel like such an asshole. <laughs> uh, I appreciate all the, the advice anyway. Like, you can always, this like, Baldur's Gate is so huge. Like, I never understood, have you ever watched those people that hate backseat gaming and they just can't take anybody giving them advice and shit? You could, you, I don't give a fuck how much time you have in a game. There's always things you can learn. You know what I mean? You can't be a master of games. I don't get it when people are like so touched up and like p they get all pissy and like in their ego and shit when people give them advice and, ba and they call it backseat gaming and shit. It's like they're just trying to help, dude. They're literally just trying to help. Like it's a community game. Like people can give you stuff you don't know about. These fungal spores are everywhere. Hey, have, be humble. Like fuck. Okay, there's a lone wolf mod on the Nexus. Doubles XP to level 6. Oh, dude, that fucking scared me. I forgot about the funky mushroom voice. And the words echo from every Wait, why is my left eye glowing? They're coming. They're coming. Oh, this voice saying that, dude. They're coming. Stop saying that! They're coming. Oh... <laughs> <laughs> They're coming <laughs> Dude, oh my god, the amount of lockpicks in this location Forgot They're all loot boxes Shit, oh fuck, aren't there minotaurs here? This is where the minotaurs are, right? Oh my god, I'm not looking forward to that They're big guys, they're big boys I think the best, ooh, grenades, nice uh, that's huge. Grenades are huge. All 
I really want to see Oko do with the Minotaurs. <laughs> I knew there were Minotaurs, damn it. We got this, we got this. Also, I kind of want to use an Elixir of the Colossus on my guy. What do you think? Elixir of the Colossus or... Um, I think it might ruin his visual aesthetic, but I feel like 21 strength is good. But Elixir of the Colossus, though, would be really cool. Because we'll get bigger. We get 1d4 to all of our damage, uh, our weapon attacks. We get um, advantage on strengths and uh, checks and saves. And yeah. And we also get bigger. We increase in size. What do you guys think? 21 strength or, or this? I won't be able to do like throwing people. Like I won't be able to jump as high anymore because my strength will go back down to 16. The world's tallest gnome. We got to do it, right? Large powers activate. Here with the biggest gnome. Look at how fucking normal size we are, man. Oh my God, the hands on hips. He's so precious. Get your crossbows out, bud. Time to fight. Okay. Time to fuck up this Minotaur. Shit, I can't reach. Can I just... What happens if I destroy the rope netting? What happens if I... Fuck up... Right? Now how do they get up? How do they get up now? They're fucked. I don't think they can climb. I think they're just gonna jump. I think Minotaurs can do crazy jumps. They've got hops. Oh my god, my first Oko alive. Hey! Oh, thanks for stopping by. Colossus for gnomes. Look how fucking big and glowy we are. Can I just say, I don't like that you get this big, thin, blue glow around your body. I think just being bigger and having just the eye effects would have been enough. Because this kind of gets obnoxious over time. Like, this big, glowy, glowy bullshit. It kind of gets super obnoxious. Or at least I found it really obnoxious. I didn't like it. All right, here we go. Yeah. Dude, no way. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Fuck! Ah, fuck. I don't have advantage anymore. Is he got a sight cone on me? Can I stealth? Why can't I see the sight cone? There we go. Come on, I gotta have advantage. Really? How do I not have advantage right now? I definitely should have advantage. Alright, 64% chance. Hell yeah. Ooh. Kinda feel like he's gonna jump on me and it's gonna be really scary. Please don't jump on me. Please don't jump on me. Reckless roar and then he's just gonna stand there and not jump on me? Nice. Long strider swirl is obnoxious. Yeah, that too. I think a lot of them, I, I kind of... Now that I know about the, uh, the Nexus mods thing, I'm probably gonna install like a fuck ton of mods off stream. Uh, um, so I'll probably get the one that stops your dudes being afraid, like stops all of the NPCs on the entire fucking map being afraid of, um, your followers, your undead, your zombies and shit like that, like your, your pets, your, uh, summons, your elemental summons, all that kind of shit. I need that mod so bad. You can't be at long range. Yeah, you can, look. Watch. See? See? They just have to be close enough. And then... Give me all. Nice. Give me all. And then... I hide again. Like this. And he's like... What? Growl? What? And then you fucking... Uh, crit again! And then you shoot him again. And then you re-stealth. And then they're like... What? Are you... What? What's happening? Dude, shrug emoji? And then you fucking kill him. And then you shoot his friend in the face. And then you disappear and they're like, I, don't, I can't figure this out. What's happening? <laughs> this is so fucked. This is so unbelievably fucked. And then you shoot him and he's like, oh man, I dodged that crit. And you just keep stealthing. And they're like, uh, he's like, ah, oh, I'm so mad, but I can't kill you. And then you shoot him again. And you shoot him again. And then you stealth mode. And then you just, and he's like, ah, oh, man, this is, this is really, I hate this. <laughs> you 
<laughs> you shoot him again? And then you shoot him again? And then you stealth again? And you wait, and you wait for him to be really mad, and then you shoot him again? And then, you do a regular shot, and if you don't crit, you just shoot again to flex. And now he's got five health, so I'm just gonna let him come for me. Because I know he can't get to me. He's like, oh, I finally found him on so mad, ah! He just he almost died to the trap! <laughs> nice, dude. Range crossbow build, baby. Why aren't, why aren't they using the last known location thingy? Because they're dumb. And also, I love Minotaurs, dude. They're so cool. But they're dumb. Also, I, I think it's legitimately only based on um, if they can get to you. Because they couldn't get up to where I was. They just... They were just like, I... I, I, I mean, nothing. Wait, do you think we'll be able to kill the bullet? Or do you think it'll just shoot us with its, like, poison spit thing and I'll just die? Probably wouldn't go great, right? Broken bone. Oh shit, I'm gonna go and get Al Al whatever it's called. This is a good opportunity to get that that sword. If I ever want to respec. I'm having I think range was definitely the best choice here. Look at this big fuck. I, I am definitely gonna do a playthrough as a Minotaur though when that gets added. Oh shit! Nice try, buddy. Ooh. What do you guys think of that, though? Like, when the... Oh! Nice, 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 nice. Nice, nice, nice. Yes, 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 yes. More for me. <laughs> more... <laughs> more explosives for the gnome. Um, yeah. I was I was thinking of doing, like, a Minotaur, an Ogre, or, like, one of the... Like, a Fishman playthrough or something. It's one of these more interesting races. Slender drow blade impales All right. the stone. Before. Strength. Keeping we have advantage because of Elixir of the Colossus. These are probably gonna absolutely fuck this up. Are you kidding me? Okay, I actually am gonna use. Come on, man! What? Is it because I, even though I have advantage, my strength is pathetic? Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Yes, double seventeen. Let's go. Damn. Look at my little Feels body. Feels like you're warring with ten people for the blade. But with another hard yank, the weapon slips free from the stone. Nice. <laughs> Pose. Pose is with it. The chance to roll a pair is low. Yeah. You don't need a pair, though. So look. Finesse. Scales with dexterity instead of strength if your dexterity is higher. And it's a long sword, so 1d10. Um... And it also has Feral of Melody, gives you performance, and it's a plus one. So automatically this thing is just cracked. Um, and I didn't take benefit for dual weapons yet. So I'm actually, I think I'm just going to equip it. Because I don't have dual wep perks. It's all like range stuff. So fuck it. Now I'm slightly better in melee, and I have a big sword, but it also scales with finesse, so it does actually, like, really decent damage. I can't take advantage of the bonus actions, though, which sucks. But you can still sneak attack with it, which is really cool. 8 to 30 sneak damage, and that's before you crit and stuff. I've wanted to make, like, a, a stealth... Finesse, stealth, like, um... Because it just needs to be a finesse weapon. You don't necessarily need to... Don't give Okoi explosives. Hey, hey, ban that guy. Nobody listen to him. Nobody, nobody listen to that guy at all, ever. I'm gonna forget that these exist, guys, so please remind me. On the gloves of whatever. <laughs> I'll forget completely. Shit, we need to figure out how to get in there. There's plenty of more fire barrels in there without having to go through the underdock. I need a potion of leap. Big jump. <clears throat> it's enabled by default. I know, I know. I, I wish it wasn't, though. Huh? Oh shit, oh fuck. I, want to know what that is. I know what it is. It's like the coolest creature that I wish you could get is like imagine if you could get mounts in this game, by the way. Like it would kind of be weird and under undermine the game, but it would be pretty cool. You ride around on like a fucking bullet or a I don't know, whatever other creature, as long as it's a beast that it's big enough. 
And it's dependent on you have to be like one size above it or something or the same size. Poisonous if memory serves. Or it has to be the same size or larger than you, I mean. Not smaller. Have you played WOTR? Uh, War of the Ring? Wrath of the Ring? What's WOTR? I don't know, I got to beach and stay to the left and there was a jumping path. The spectator and Cell Unite outpost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I don't want to go near the spectator though, he's scary. Motherfucker gets like eight turns in one. Oh fuck, I f ah! <laughs> Oh fuck! I lost my fucking false life scroll over that bullshit. Damn it. Well, the sleep, at least the scroll survived. Well, see, now I don't give a fuck about getting the, um. Like getting the sword because they have this file or louvre thing whatever i'll get it anyway Corpses. These i don't know how long it's going to be before i get that like there's a really good sword down here i think it's down here right here the camp looks abandoned this guy's voice is getting to me I should have made him sillier, but I guess that would be way more annoying. So look, this sword is insane. So deals an additional one to eight piercing damage to targets that still have all their hit points, right? And that's if they heal the first people that you fight. And since I'm doing a solo playthrough, this is fucking crazy. This is kind of what I was I wanted to go for, like this, and then the Fowler or Louvre sword, which is a finesse weapon. So think this in my offhand with the greater weapon dual wep perk, and then also great weapon fighting, and then this in my main hand so it'll do you know a, a fuck ton like 1d6 plus 3 plus 1d4 plus 1d8 conditionally like i could like potentially if you then crit with your main hand attack can you imagine the damage dude if you have like a double finesse setup like that that would be crazy so it affects what's best comic or comic dice i have no idea there's no manning in the game, so the spell is pointless. Phantom Steed can't attack. Yeah. Oh. oh, I forgot about the shrooms. I love these guys. Um, they're next to my home. Oh, that's fucking cool. You can just like, because I'm a, a deep gnome, they're like, chill with me. That's neat. I don't have to pass the speech check or anything. I know the speech check is super low, but that's still cool. Oh my god, my jump distance is so bad. The fuck? Did I just jump into that mushroom? Will you make more videos like the four halflings anytime soon? Uh, I'm not sure if it'll be soon because this game is so long and it's dependent uh, on me getting other people involved and if people have time to be able to help and stuff like that. Um, it's, our kind has uh, yeah, it, it really depends. I know the feeling well. What a, uh, forgive me. I do enjoy me trade. Bargain. If Where's move, speed, move, something. I kind of want those boots of striding. Although I don't need them because I'm a rogue, actually. Never mind. What's good boots for this guy? Yeah, I'll definitely be doing more videos like this. Like, more videos like the Hoffling one. Absolutely. I was already planning... Like, I'll sh I have a list. I literally have, like, a bookmark list thing. I have, um... Yeah, four Hofflings Barbar four Hoffling Barbarians in Act 2. So like, just keep pushing it into Act 2 and do a bunch of, of, of goofs there. Four druids and four necromancers. Which would, four necromancers is just four wizards, but also... I'm gonna put them, push them down the necromancy route. And then maybe respec them later on or some shit, just to try some different builds. Or different fights. Blurg is, and his friend are bros. Yeah, they're absolute bros. Agreed. They're chads. Oh wait, where's the asset? Wait! I need the acidity ring. Oh fuck, this is where I get that really good ring. I totally forgot about the fucking acid ring, dude. Wait, okay, if people haven't used this ring, I get it in every single playthrough, it's fucking cracked. It just adds another flat two as, uh, acid damage to every single attack. And if you're using two weapons, it adds it to both weapons. It's pretty insane. 
No, oh, hill giant finger? The caustic band. Damn it, I'm gonna have to give up my- No, I'll give up the ring of color spray. I don't even use the other one. What does this one do? Where I can see in the dock of 12 meters. Pointless, dude. Man, if Okoye just betray everyone on the Hoffling vid during the end game, that would be the idea, is we just do all the evil guy stuff. I kind of want to do a, a kill and blow up everybody thing. Because you'll get more XP and also, you know, everybody die and it's funny. What else is heavy? Wait, fuck, did I sell that? Oh, it's just a quill. What am I trying to sell that's so expensive? Oh. Maybe these? Yep. Oh, and the Albert egg. I've got so much shit to sell, dude. I'm gonna be rich. I don't think I can use any of this shit. Very well. None of this is roguey. Roguelike. Okay, what's your favorite song? Mine is Imagine Dragons Radioactive, but it's... But it's just, I'm waking up. Oh, like... He just keeps saying I'm waking up for the whole song. Uh, I like, um... Uh, Smash Mouth's... Seems and I Don't Stop Coming, but it's just, and I Don't Stop Coming, in. over and over again. Name. That's a pretty good song. That's a good, that's a good one. Ooh, jump. Ooh! Bonus action once per short rest. That's worth it, right? That's better than a ring of being really invisible, unfortunately. Fuck, I don't want to buy that. Herbalist touch, pointless. Oh! Plus one hand crossbow, let's go! Oh my god. W, huge W for the little man. Don't need divination stuff, dies, I'm good. Healing potions I could use, nice. Plenty of those. So, 400, and then we switch over and sell it. Bam! So now we got two good rings. All of our attacks now do uh, acid damage. And we got a plus one crossbow. So we do 8 to 16 now. 1d6 plus 4 plus uh, 1d4 piercing and 2 acid. And, yeah, so with the Colossus, that's a ton. I kind of want the Elixir of Bloodlust, though, because it's sort of better. Okay, I wanted to try this. Are you looking at my search history again? Yes. I mean, I actually dox everybody that watches me, and then I find out what they want to see, and then do it before they do it. So they're forced to watch. Oh, man. What's Amulet of the Un... Oh! Resistance to slashing damage for vulnerability to bludgeoning damage. I feel like that's not so great. Um, we're good now, right? What do I- should I just open the caravan strongbox, by the way? People were asking me to do it. Alright, I'll just lockpick it. Wait, no I won't. Hold on. I will equip the gloves first so I have advantage, and then I'll lockpick it. See you guys? I'm learning. I'm learning. Guidance. Gloves of whatever. 15, 21, nailed it. Crushed it. Nice. Open. Yeah, there you go. I gave you this criminal surprise. Then we take everything and then we take the funny iron flask and we throw it in the middle of a major camp. What do you guys think? I don't know how long this campaign is going to go on for. So should I just use this now and just chuck it into like a camp or something? Does this. What does this actually do? Like, I don't think I'm going to be playing this campaign long enough to get to the like act three. I might do a part like two, maybe a part three, whatever. I don't know. Break the chest. Of someone's skull. What? What do you mean? I could. Oh, wait. I might keep this, fill it full of heavy shit, like other boxes and people's bodies and shit, and then throw it off a cliff. Go use it on the gith? Oh, release it on the gith. Is it actually that strong? What level is it? I'm just gonna test it now. If anybody doesn't want a spoiler, I'm about to throw this iron flask. So, look away now. Oh, it's literally, oh, I thought Spectator was a boss. It's just a Spectator. Dude, it has orange eyes. Cool. Oh, 
Dude, look how many turns this thing gets. It's insane. All right, good to know. Good to know. Spectator versus spectator. I wonder if they fight. Dude, that's a... I kind of want to find that out. What's best for an archer run? Straight up fighter or ranger, gloomstalk, rogue, multiclass. I haven't really fucked with the whole ranger, gloomstalker thing, but I imagine a rogue range build mixed with ranger is our gloom stalker is probably best but you get like a bunch of bonus perk stuff with maybe it would have been better if i went with a level in now nah, because i like the the you get a melee proficiency as a ranger it, as you know like when you can get great weapon or dual weapons and all that kind of shit can it solo the goblin camp probably maybe Where are you there, it gets so many turns on its turn, it probably could solo the goblin camp. Oh, I'm gonna go give Kalax head to what's what that dude. Also, I didn't really pay attention to how big the gnome was. I, I'm gonna go stand next to a tiefling and just see how big I am. Look at this animation for running. <laughs> What song would go with well with this? Wait, I know. Hold on, hold on. I have the perfect song. I'm gonna get copyrighted. I'm only gonna play it for like a second. <laughs> Alright, here we go. It fits fucking perfectly! Fuck, god damn it. If it wasn't for copyright, I'd just play that. That song's such an absolute monstrous bop. That fits so perfectly, holy shit. Need anything else? Of course. But please, remember. Wait, why did I come here? You're not the only one in need. Oh, yeah. Where's that stupid guy at? Wait, what the fuck? He's gone? Where does Will show up at? Look who's here. Where's Will at? Huh. I don't think I got him. He died? Did he die? Did he die in the fight outside the camp? No. I don't. Did he, did he fucking die? <laughs> what? What the fuck? Did he really die? I didn't notice. No, he's not dead. His body would be here. Did you resume with the scroll? Re equip the. Yeah, but he's not dead. I don't think he's dead. If you kill Kalak without talking to him, he leaves. Where the fuck does he go? Oh, he comes to your camp. Oh, okay. All right, fine. All right. What's next? All right, dragon time. This might be a good way to close out the stream, actually. Depending on how this works. I just realized I've been streaming for fucking ages, dude. I've been having so much fun, I just kept going. Okay, did you know that Asmongold reacted to your video very hyped for your success? Well deserved. Thank you, my dude. Um, yeah, I did. I, I actually... I watched it on stream. If you go back far enough, you'll see... Uh... Oh. Oh, shit. Drop your pants. That's it. I'm getting out of here. Yeah, I, uh, I I reacted to it live on stream, like reacted to him reacting to it. So it's getting pretty meta in here. Uh, ooh, okay. Can we actually get down there without triggering a bunch of shit? Because they're not looking at me. I could put stuff next to Quednos. Why does Quednos sound like a Mexican guy? I'm Quednos the Dragon. <laughs> That's a good name for a dragon. 
Fuck, I need to go back to camp first then. Shit. Alright. Okoy, are you mad at the price of Warhammer DLC? Um, I mean... I get them all for free, so I'm like a bad person asking away, but I still, despite that, disagree with the amount that they're charging for it. I don't- I'm not mad at CA. I'm mad, I'm sort of disappointed by their marketing team. See, look, I wasn't even really trying to collect explosives, guys, and look how many that I got. I keep seeing comments on the video like, like, you must have been cheating, there's physically no way to get this amount of, like, you know what I mean? It's absolutely possible. Shit, did I just put... Where the fuck did that go? God, what? Oh my god, what? Why are these locked? Why are my thieves tools locked? What? What the fuck? Can't pick up and add to where it's too heavy. Ah. Oh, I see. <laughs> I should probably read. <laughs> it's probably a great... Why did they put it as a lock symbol, by the way? It just seems convoluted. <laughs> oh, man. Wait, can I bug this out if I... Shit. Can I still... If you get too overweight, can you not move? But can I not do like bam bam not the salami what if I just go like this and then get all these and then right click them and ah oh, damn it fuck fine four is enough to go on for now <clears throat> there's something like 120 82 barrels in Act 1. Did somebody go and count them all? Or like, just look at the data? Shit, am I actually gonna be able to get this in range? Without getting spotted? How close can I get these? No, 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 no. I already pulled into the dialogue. Can I throw them? Nah, throwing will put me out of di it'll, it'll put me out of this thing for sure. All right, I'm gonna try and, what if I do this? Like sneak, yes. Here, oh, no, don't look over here. Don't look over here. I feel like half of these are not gonna hit the hitbox. All right, I'm just gonna get over here while I can. Go, 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 go. All right, this is the best opportunity I'm gonna have, so I'm gonna quick save. All right, and we just move barrels closer. And we just keep stacking them. Can I not stack these? Ain't no way. Come on. What? Alright. Four? Is this thing immune to fire damage? Shit! Ah, oh, shit! Dude, it's not gonna take enough damage. I'm gonna have to get so many smoke powder barrels. I've got, I've got to go to the goblin camp, right? No, 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 no! I know, but I've got to get specifically smoke powder barrels. Because I can't use... My plan was to get all of... Right. My plan was also to get... My god. Was to get all the oil barrels. But there's no point. Because the oil barrels aren't going to do shit. I'm going to need every single smoke powder barrel, right? Shit. What did I do with that? Ah, oh, shit. Where'd it go? No. Where'd it go? In here? No. Where did that go? What? Where'd that fucking explosive barrel go? Did I just delete one? Where'd that go? I need them all. Where did that go? Did anybody else see that disappear? Am I going nuts? I swear to fuck, I just deleted one. 
God damn it. How far ago did I load? Oh, just like right here. Okay, cool. And it's the bug with the traveler's chest. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I'll just load, I'll quickly put the barrels back down and then I'll teleport back. You're not going nuts, had something like that happen? I moved it up because I couldn't pick it up and then it just vanished. All right. I don't think we have enough of these personally. Because they do, like if we math it out, it does 18, 44 plus 18. So minimum it's doing four damage on top of the 18, right? So 22 damage. 22 across these is what, 88? 88 damage. So 88 it has 400 HP. So that's minimum 88 damage from these. Well, and then I can get what? Well, maybe 18. Like I'm going to need so many more of them. Best I think I'm going to be able to do is like super weaken it. So maybe I can weaken the crap out of it and then finish it off, right? Because it's only resistant against fire damage. You'll need 20. Yeah. 20 minimum. It's a guaranteed eight. 18 damage per explosive barrel. Yeah, I definitely deleted one. He flies away regardless. You cannot kill the dragon. That's not true. The, ca the, the guy runs away with the dragon on turn one. What? What? You make. Fuck! Right with it. Forgot to stealth. Damn it. A weapon oil? Should go get the room powder barrel? I don't think I can come back and it not advance time. The only way that I could think that we could be able to do this would be to maybe fill a chest with a bunch of heavy shit and then thunder wave it off a cliff or something. The only other way that I know you can do a shit ton of damage is by dropping an unbelievably heavy object on it. You are okay. Could you also place down smoke powder bombs in the ground and trigger them with the barrels? What do you mean? The, the problem is we don't have enough smoke powders to, to do enough damage. I'll be able to damage the crap out of it, but I don't know if I can finish it in a single turn. I would have to, it would have to get on such low health. <laughs> There's so many already. And so 88, another 88. So like 160 damage maybe right now. And okay, Grimforge, Underdog doesn't progress the Githyanki and Dragon. Only Mountain Pass progresses time. Oh, so I can go... How do you get to... So I can go across the boat, the Grimforge, to get the, uh, to get the explosive barrel there? It, it's immune to fire damage, yeah, but the, the barrels are force damage. It's fine. Can? All right, we should try that. I could like speed run my way there. I'm gonna have to get the boots off of that lady though to, get, to earn the trust of the Grim, uh, Grimforge guys. And then, then I can just go straight across the boat. Is that rune barrel gonna be enough? Also, I need to go get the smoke powder barrels from the goblin camp, so I should go do that as well. What easy prey you make. What? Walking right within my blade. No, I fucking no, because I fucking didn't walk away before I went. Oh my god! Fuck! Dude, I walked right into these nerds. Oh, dude. Gith are such dorks, by the way. They're such evil traitorous dorks. I got jump scared by that crap. Yes, uh, 80 to 120 damage for the room powder. Right. God damn it, dude. Fuck. God. 
This is the definition of insanity out here. This is why I quick save all the time, or I try, I try to, because I always make fucking mistakes. Fuck, dude. <gasps> why can't I stack them? Not enough space? It's because of the dragons there? Where did I put them last time? Is it because I'm not close enough? What? Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. We're good. We're good. Damn, I'm really lucky I got such good stealth. Alright, now we go away. Get the last two barrels. I'm quick saving also. Go back to camp. You might be able to amplify the damage with a subclass of wizard. I don't think that's gonna help. <laughs> the only other thing I could think would be to stop putting shit like bombs. Like I can stack these two uh, smoke powder bombs too. So that's another 3d4 plus nine. Oh, I can go through stealth anyway, nice. I can stack some bombs on too, though. So... Nice. There. And I can split these stacks up. I can put one like, I don't know, here. One... Here. Let's just test it, right? I could be wasting my time. I'm just gonna quickly test this and see how much damage we do. All right, motherfucker. What? Fucking dumb game with its stupid mechanics, and I love it, but I hate it. Ain't no fucking way it just shrugged it off and just left. I'm gonna fucking cry, dude. I just wasted like a whole five minutes on that. Can we load it back up to... yeah, here. Damn it, dude. Fuck. Did it take any damage? I don't think so. No, I used fire to set up the fucking barrels. You can't set off the barrels. No, you can't set off the barrels without exploding them. It just doesn't take damage. It's invulnerable. It has plot armor. Yeah, he flew at full HP. Exactly. It didn't take any force damage or any fire damage or any damage at all. Damn, dude. What a dick tease. Look how small it looks in this picture. What do we do with all the the fucking barrels then now? Damn it! Damn it! Hmm. What do you guys think? What could we? What else could we do? I guess if we're not gonna blow up something individual, I can use it to kill a bunch of bosses, like like Kaga, or um the the kids. I don't know. Disarm the. I'm not blowing up the goblin camp again. That took hours. Bomb will. Blow up the Emerald Grove. We could do that. Grimforge boss is a good one to blow up. Huh. Okay, great vid for halflings. Never into streams, but you're really entertaining and fun to watch. Hey, thank you, man. Much appreciated. Uh, glad you liked the video. I'll tell you what. I'm still going to do this interaction then. Because it's free XP. But as long as I don't fuck it up. Don't even try the Grim Forge boss. It's immune to all damage. It's not immune what to blunt, but play. only when it's like. These I think they mean uh, Nere, you, anyway. Tell me. Um. Why shouldn't I run you through this? Instant? Nailed it! 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 Come on! Fuck yeah! Of this guy's character development is cool, by the way. You Kithrak. are not 
for you to keep a vessel. You suddenly you attune your mind to it. Help us find it, and I will leave your blood beneath your skin unspilled. Um. Do not. He begins to move his hand in a quick flurry. Oh, gestures. I'm gonna fuck you up here, dude. You're not gonna get me. Oh, nailed it. You realize he's casting detect. Nope, balls. you're not doing anything. I am the master of resisting. See? I never fail. <laughs> Nothing even approaching a useful right. thought in that skull. I ought to just clean. Crushing it. Crushing it, little man. Unlike Look at my little jacket. So adorable. Their heads. Now go. All right, we'll do. 315 free XP. Let's go. All right. I have an idea for the explosive barrels. And it's really stupid, and it's only going to be funny for like eight seconds. But... What if we blow up the the uh, ogre and the bugbear having sex in the bar? <laughs> Would that be really dumb? Hey, okay, love your videos. Glad to see you having more fun with Baldur's Gate 3. Yay! Yeah, absolutely, man. I mean, it's impossible not to have fun in this game, dude. It's fucking incredible. I had 150 hours in the beta. I know chapter one like the back of my hand, but even then, I can still. I this game is just so naturally fun. That would be dumb, do it. Well, that's like three to four barrels. Yeah, that's easy. That's an easy one. I can carry around the barrels required for the explosion of ogres. Just kind of... Oh! That scared the fuck out of me, dude. I'm not this fucking guy. Well met. I am Raphael. Walk away while you still have legs to walk uh, with. I will blow you up, man. Like a deep... I will blow you up. Get, get the fuck out uh, of here. Middle of somewhere. Take me back. It might just be a I'm gonna start eating now. <laughs> Not easily rap. What's the... <laughs> Am I a friend? He's just an edgier tiefling. <laughs> nope, don't I care. Fix it all. Okay, cool. Hope. <laughs> Alright, bye. I'm leaving. Alright, cool. Nice. I don't go. All you need to do is forge boss is to kite him under the la into lava and use the hydraulic press. And flip the level, it takes like 80% of his health. Yeah, yeah, I know. It takes like 50% of his health. A little bit less than 50% of his health, like 48%. So you just have to like hit him a little bit, get him in the lava, uh, get him in the lava, hit him a little bit, smash him, and then get him in the lava again, and then get him back, and then smash him again. That's how I did it anyway. I mean, that's how most people have been doing it. Can I just put a bunch of barrels in front of the thing? Do. Because surely this will block the ogre, right? There's no way the ogre can path its way through this stuff. Alright. Now we get the barrels. <laughs> this is so dumb. Huh? Okay, we, we got it. We now got a new idea. We blow up the House of Hope. What's the House of Hope? I don't remember. It sounds like a really good boy place to blow up, though. You know? Oh, shit. You can blow that up? Is that what what act is that in? That's act two, I think. I've never I never went there in act two. Did I miss a whole fucking thing? Wait, I gotta move these a little bit, actually. This. Shit, am I gonna get stuck behind this? Oh fucking gross, dude! What the hell did you do? Oh no, did they get a turn first? Oh fuck! Oh, it's okay. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good. Um... How do I knock this guy prone? Get fucked. Okay, um... Shit, she's not close enough. Can I slow this guy? Like, stop him from moving? Nope. Grease. Get greased. Okay, maybe he won't fit. Uh, he won't save that. She's gonna throw so many rocks at me, dude. Fuck! Oh, 
god! Don't you dare! Oh my god, ow! It should not be this difficult! Oh my god, he go- he went nowhere! I don't think he's close enough. All right, fuck it, whatever. Oh, I could have used the fucking I had fire arrows. <laughs> I mean, it worked. A little messy, but it worked. There's a lot of mangled corpses in there. Damn, she got laid out. Okay, the more XP you should pacify people, then kill them like those dudes from the bridge. If you pacify them for 350 XP, you can kill them for another 350. Oh, yeah, I guess. They all run away though and shit. Come on. What? Why can't I get these close to him? What is that? <laughs> so fucking unnecessary in every way. <laughs> <laughs> it's so pointless. Uh, uh, okay, you meet the ogres yet? No, I could go talk to them though. I might leave that for next time though. Shit, how do I even get up there? Maybe we blow up the spider. Hold on, that, maybe that's a, what do you guys think? Is that a good outro to the video if we try and figure out how to blow up the big spider? That'd be a good way to wrap up the stream, I think. That's doable. I think. I might need a distraction though. What the fuck happened with this box? I feel like a player's been here before me and fucked it all up. Put, putting barrels through shit. Also, what happens if you build a giant tower of boxes like like this and you get on top of it and like really really high up like a massive tower of boxes and then uh like what happened like did it can, can you just um can nobody hit you did can they still shoot you what if you're so high up that no one can get you oh my god i'm literally too small are you fucking kidding me I'm literally- I'm too small, dude, what? Oh, man! I have longer legs. Nice. Bruh. Fucking short people problems. Is this sturdy? Weak to force damage. I mean, that doesn't really help. Fuck. Can I punch it down? <laughs> Fuck yeah! <laughs> Look at my little kicks! What?! Is the regular <laughs> melee attack for... For uh, gnomes a kick? A little jumpy kick? I don't know, Matt Mercer made a box tower. He's got a video out of it. Yeah, I saw that. He, Swain was like spectating him too. The, uh, the director of the game, right? He was like watching him do it. Watching him break his game in front of his very eyes. Four monks could be cool too. I think the idea of beating the crap out of people would be good. 
Just Enemy mailing. Oh man, fuck, how do we even do this? If I jump, is it gonna... Is it they gonna discover me? Nope. Nice. Ah oh, fuck, there's an enemy! No! Shit. Wait, I have jump? When did I get jump? Oh, from like the ring or... Yeah. All right, I'm gonna give myself 10 turns of jump and just absolutely smoke this fool. Boing. Shit, it relies on, oh my God, I forgot it works on movement. <laughs> oh shit. Oh no. Um. Oh fuck, how am I even gonna get there? I don't have to fight these guys. Shriek. Oh no, oh no, this isn't great. Okay, did you know that Esme reacted to your full Hoffling Barbarians video on stream? And he said, uh, pr and then he said, if you press the plus on your hotbar, it will expand it slower. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> full Hoffling Shadow Monks fighter multi-class cosplaying as Ninja Turtles. That actually sounds pretty goddamn hysterical. I'm almost fucking dead, Jesus Christ. Um, can I get away without being hit? Yep. I'm gonna disengage. And then jump away. And then get over here. And then I can't stealth. Fuck! I was hoping to stealth. I'm gonna load. <laughs> Do react content is gross. I mean, I don't mind. I just, it, you do kind of benefit from someone else's video, but it also advertises the base video, so. Um, shit. All right, if we step on the spider webs, it's gonna alert everybody. Can't go that way. I think I just have to fight him. Do I just have to fight these fucking things? What are they weak against? Fire, right? Maybe? Nothing. Nothing. This is not a good fight for one person to, do, to have to deal with. What if I do jump? No, it knocks me out of stealth. Damn it, dude. Shit. I need invisibility. I should have got a potion of invisibility. I fucked up. Invisibility would have been perfect for this. God damn it. Wait, maybe I just do that. Hold on. I can just go to the mic and call and just buy it, the healing potion and come back in like two seconds. Matron also spawns spiderlings. Oh God! Have you made any new discoveries? Not if I kill it too uh, too fast for it to get any spiderlings. Shit! Who had the uh, invisibility bullshit? Oh shit! There's the woman in the main place. God damn it, dude! Oh yeah, it is kind of yeah. That's a good point. It is kind of weird that the face spiders have a poison projectile attack. It makes them so much uh, more of a threat. Here we go. What's your like odds of getting? Oh shit! Did I not get the fucking portal in the middle of the town? No! <laughs> I don't want to run all the way back. Oh, son of a bitch! Should I got the teleporter? You can also kill the eggs so the spiderlings don't spawn. Yeah. I kind of just want to do a big cluster of explosives around the spider. The pro the main problem is getting 
to the spider without being seen repeatedly. I'm gonna have to maybe use the invisibility potion. Should have just bought like a fuck ton of invisibility potions for this exact thing. I wouldn't have found Oko if I didn't watch the reaction and I would have missed Oko's content. Oh man. See, there you go. <coughs> Thanks for finding it. Shit. Um. Ooh, I can get that fucking hat while I'm here. Oh, shit. 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 Whatever. You the mark glows, but you feel nothing in response. Your power is beyond. Uh, I'm meant to be here. Thank you. Wait, shit. Did I ever re-equip those gloves that make me good at resisting range damage? I did not. Nice haste helm. Always good. His little camp run never gets old. I recommend grabbing the spider boots. I will be fine. I can avoid the spider boots. If I'm invisible, it doesn't even matter. I don't even think you can get discovered if you're invisible. Unless they uh, have like a defect detect invisibility thing. It's actually really goddamn strong. I broke somebody out of prison in, in one of the later acts by uh, putting an invisibility scroll on them and then just having them be invisible. And just walking out, and nobody knew they were there. I can just invisible, and then fucking. Oh shit! If I take damage, does it get it? Does it? Does it remove it? Shit! I'm only gonna fight more turn. There's so many. Oh. Yeah, it's nuts. It's nuts, dude. I might be able to use this to get over there. Shit. How do you get down there? Ah. Oh my god, I'm on top of it. Okay, it didn't matter. Three. Shit. Two. Shit, I don't have time. Fuck, 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 fuck. Two. Two more turns. One more turns. Alright, I got the waypoint. That's huge. That's huge. We point without doing the fight. Shit. Also, I can still stealth while I'm down here and I have dark sight and they don't. Actually, they probably do have dark sight. They're fucking spiders. Yep. No! What? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm glad I saved. What the fuck? Dude, waypoint is huge. The waypoint is huge, though. Amethyst a few feet away. Actually, the amethyst is in the middle, underneath the whole spider bees, out in the open. Can I, like, stealth kill this thing, or does it trigger the whole fight? Like, can I do that stealth mish bullshit? No. What the fuck? What? Dude, how is it seeing me? Did you get the town teleporter? I got all of them. I got both of them, I mean. I wanna know what is actually spotting me. Is this, um, the little emblem on my thing? It, right. Nah, something's fucked, dude. There's no fucking way. Am I just failing the, the stealth Stack checks and over and over again? Win? Oh god, never! I keep, I've told you this so many times. How many? T how many times we gotta teach you this lesson, old man? Yeah, I don't know what's going on with that. That big ass spider has whack just detection. 
I need another fucking... There you go. That's what's detecting me. Maybe he just has, like, really good perception? Alright, well, I need a bunch of... Shit. Alright, I think I'm gonna need another invisibility potion. If I take stuff out of my pocket in an invisibility potion, does it... Because I can use turn-based mode, right? And then infinitely put explosives around it? Alright, that's what I'll do. Alright, that's that's a good idea. We have the Underdark Teleporter now. The Whispering Depths. So I can just go to Environs, get the Invisibility Potion, pick up a bunch of explosives, come back, use it, uh, and then with the end term thing, put down a bunch of explosives next to it, and then we blow it up. And I can just keep... It doesn't take an action to move something out of your inventory, so I can just keep moving uh, barrels out of my inventory over and over and over and over. And, and the, invisible, the invisibility lasts for 10 turns. I have plenty of time. What happens if you trap it on, to, on top of the web? You know what I mean? What happens if it, go, if it walks, does its patrol, gets onto the web, you block its way back with a bunch of uh, explosive barrels while invisible in, in the end turn thing? What happens if you then play it and it just sort of starts walking at the barrels? Will it just stop in front of the barrels in the perfect position or will it just like plow through them or attack them or detect you automatically? It'll jump probably. That would suck. Wait, where the fuck? Ethel's gone. Oh, she's still there. Good. Yep. Thank you. Much appreciated. Damn, we got five, almost 6k already. Uh, and then... Wax camp, get some barrels. Human NPCs jump if you're in the way. Yeah, but it's a giant phase spider, so maybe it'll be different. Who knows? Also, I can use the fire ones, but I don't think I'm going to need to. Oh, wait. I'll just teleport straight there. Nice. I wish I could see the fucking spider. Oh, it's... Uh, uh, uh. This is going to be fast with it. All right. Invisibility potion. And then... Oh, no! How am I going to get keep getting back in turn-based mode? You can't teleport when you're in turn-based mode, right? I should only need a couple of barrels. No! Son of a bitch! You know what? I'm gonna play this a little bit out. I wanna see what happens. Oh, How the fuck did it detect me? I'm fucking invisible. Oh no, I'm not. Yeah, it knocked me out of invisibility when I dropped down a bunch of explosive barrels. Dude, cringe. I'll make this work. Fuck it. Nobody's got line of sight on me. I'm gonna hide. They're not gonna do nothing. Can I just hide? Can I just keep hiding? What happens if I just keep hiding? Will it teleport back? I'm actually so curious to see what happens if you just keep teleporting. My stealth? Yes. Until end turns until you show up? Not... No. Well, does that mean I could just sneak behind them and put explosives then? Like over here? Are they just not gonna look? I guess? Fuck! I might as well use it then. God, they really are just gonna stand there and not do anything <laughs> for fucking ages. 
This is your favorite Act 1 fight? I do not like spiders, so this was not my favorite. I always thought the draw, uh, the draw Raglan fight was fun. You called in the ogre homies to help me? Dude, I've never asked for help with this fight. If you wait until the, the spider's on top of this little, like, spider web and destroy it, uh, it, it just gets totally fucked. Like, it, it loses, like, 30 to 40 uh, health and then teleports onto another cobweb. And if you shoot that one out from under it, it drops and takes another 30 to 40 damage. So it's basically half dead. And then from there, you just, you know, whittle it down a bit. Or you sneak up behind it, um, put a bunch of explosive barrels on here while your friend distracts it, and blow it up and it falls into the chasm in the middle, which is what me and my friend did on our two-player co-op uh, campaign. Yeah, big, big creatures, anything large or huge takes a crap ton of damage when you, uh, when you blow it up. When it, when it takes fall damage, I mean. Like, the bigger, the harder they fall kind of deal. Oh my god, our movement speed is so dog shit. Can, you can use Cunning Dash while stealth, right? I'm gonna quick save just in case this fucks me. Nice. <laughs> Ain't no way it's not just gonna they're just gonna sit there again. I'm right there. All right, guys, you ready for this? Y'all ready? <laughs> I mean, this is working. You can knock back the big spider with Eldritch Blast. I accidentally knocked it back into a chasm with Eldritch Blast. All right, on three, two, one. Oh my fucking god! I almost died! Dude, it's dead. It's so dead. Oh my god, the fire spreader on the corner and like lit all the, the cobwebs on fire. That's crazy. Oh fuck. Okay, and now I just died of fucking phase spiders. No, come on. How am I failing this? I have advantage on strength checks. What? What, do you, what the fuck? Target must be movable? Is it the camera? It is the camera. Oh my God, are you fuck? What? You gotta be fucking me here. I've never seen no melee animations, especially for two-handed weapons. Ew, they're discharging. Ew. What the fuck? Okay, well now I have to. <laughs> Get shit on. No, you just spit at me. Oh fuck! Oh well, god damn it. Um, I'm just gonna. Come on, dude. What? I can't even. It's like the pit, edge of the pit is bugged. That's crazy. 
How am I getting disadvantage here? Poison. Right. Fuck. Don't crit me, don't crit me, don't crit me. Oh my god, ow. Shit, am I gonna die to this thing? It keeps healing. Oh wait, I don't I just don't think I've hit it. <laughs> Never mind. Get away, don't spit at me! Must oh. heal. Die, 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 die. Fucking, oh my god. Now I'll do a short rest. Time to get and another one, fuck it. Alright. Face spider's dead. Just blown up. Funny little guy. Good times. Always oh, this robe looks good. I'm glad they gave that a unique model. It used to just be like a generic green robe. All right. Yeah, that should be good for the, today's stream. That's one of the longest streams I've ever done. I had a fucking blast, dude. Uh, I love my little, I love my little gnome. We're only 1900 XP away from uh, leveling. I've only used a couple of uh, explosive barrels so far. We could kill plenty of more bosses with these, these some bitches. I can get the barrel from the underdog. We can do all that good shit. I can uh, maybe set up an explosive thing to kill the bullet or just keep, or just use the same stealth technique with the barrel placing. Glad to hang out with you for the day, Okoy. Hey, you guys too. Nice. Thanks for, thanks for watching. Thanks for the donos. Thanks for the support. Thanks for watching the Halfling video. I'm glad you liked it. It's, uh, this is the most viewers I've had for a long time. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. This was uh, a lot of fun. I I'll probably do a part two. Or, or, or uh, an eight player random multiplayer campaign as well. I thought it would be a lot of fun. Where eight, ra uh, seven random people jump in with the multiplayer mod, create a random character, and then. And then yeah, and you can uh, you can all install it all with like Nexus mod manager and shit, I guess. So it'll be a lot easier. But I thought that'd be a fun stream, like eight player, on uh, the hottest difficulty, and everybody just makes random shit. But uh, yeah, anyway, I'm rambling. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I'll see you on the next stream, or the next video, whatever.